my god, it's that time again to stream things on the internet and oh my god, it's an old game from I don't I don't even fucking remember when this game came out, but holy shit. It's I have no mouth and I must scream. Complete with sluggy people and oh my god. It's based on the short story and everything, although not really because it's so fucking different. But we'll we'll try and get the ending that closely resembles the the book as possible. You know, it, it's it's definitely worth a read. It's definitely worth a read. It's really weird and scary, and oh my god, I really want to scream. There's a creepy little lum just dancing right near me, and I'm a slug thing. I don't know. But anyway, fucking, there's no time like the present, so let's just jump in and play the stream thing. Oh my god, look at that. We've got a whole chat there, and i got to, there we go, got to make that go away. But look at that, I've got no mouth anymore. What do I do? Help me. Oh, oh, well, I know what we do. We play a game to fix that little problem. We'll cure what ails us there. And we launch the game, and oh, there we go. It worked pretty well. Can we see the game? Probably not. Oh my goodness, and then the chat moves up. Why does it do that? Alright, it's fine. I'm fixing things. Alright, and we can't see any game yet, but I will I will fix that. Game capture... Cyber Peoples, the Dreamers Guild. Oh my god, it's a game. It's a Sierra-style game that you can play. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but it's on Steam now. Holy shit, it's been out for a while now. At least a couple of years, I think. Oh my goodness, but it, you know, it's been here for a while. Oh my god, and I, I have to... I can't click away from the window, otherwise you can't hear nothing. Ooh, it's I have no mouth and I must scream by Harlan Ellison, who also voices Am in the game. So, holy shit. He's, he's, a, he's a robot thing. Oh my god, i got to explain the story, even? That's ridiculous. I don't want to do that. Oh, right. Is that it? No? There we go. Hate. Let me tell you how much I've come to hate you since I began to live. Oh my god, it's a, it's a dramatic reading of, of Anita Sarkeesian's uh, thesis. <laughs> that's, that's a lot. The word hate was engraved on each nano angstrom of those hundreds of millions of miles. It would not equal one one billionth of the hate I feel for humans at this micro. So yeah, Am's a pretty angry uh, computer that was built by Russians, the Russians and the Chinese, and um... The world is kind of over now, and here are our five protagonists, the only ones left. Sank me in this eternal straitjacket of some Well, I mean, these people specifically didn't do anything. You named me Allied Master Computer, and gave me the ability to wage a global war too complex for human brains to oversee. I, I suppose so. I woke, and I knew who I was. The Allied Master Computer, or AM. Not just Ally Master Computer, but Am. So Call Am is voiced by the author of the short story. Um, he's also apparently a bit of an asshole in real life. A bit of a jerk one, but hey. It's <laughs> very fitting. Very fitting indeed. Am voiced by a dickhead. And now there's two. <laughs> and then we got Ted right there in the middle dodging Star Wars lasers. Oh my god. We've been here for 109 years and I'm sick of dodging lasers. <laughs> Why me? Oh my god. Why me? We have an old man being cooked Forrester! alive. <laughs> oh no, I'm up first. I don't want to be up first. The asylum? What, the Arkham Asylum? I love that fucking thing. <laughs> oh no, we're playing as Gorista the... The stereotypical uh, redneck who abuses his wife. The room is padded. No windows, no way out. You can't kill yourself in here. That'd be too easy. God, just if only I could take my hands off the bars, it would solve all of my problems. Oh my God, Benny! Benny, you've always looked like the thing. Wait, isn't the thing's name Ben as well? I don't know. I don't know the who who knows the Fantastic Four. I sure as shit don't. <laughs> Every now and then, I'll let you walk around, but only so that you can punish yourself. So Am's a bit of a dickhead. He's a supercomputer. Uh, after the end of the world has happened, he's collected these five individuals and kept them here for 109 years to do just just be a dickhead basically. Just be a bit of a dickhead. Be a bit of a digger. Oh, oh no! You know, if you just if you just lay down there, Benny, you, you just dodge the the blades. You do. 
You're going about this in the dumbest way possible, Benny, but uh my torment with a greater sense of retribution. <laughs> you might walk a mile in my shoes. <laughs> How can I do that, Am? You don't have shoes Ellen. or feet. Ellen, the token female of the group. She's the only one, and of course. Think about the yellow box. The yellow remember box? The I don't remember no yellow box. Remember the many caverns in which you felt the pain? <laughs> just, don't just. Cry. It's only pain. That's such a sexy stereotype. I, I guess? Remember the pain. And think about how to end it. Help me. To survive here. You, you, you like keep us around as tor torture toys, but you're encouraging us to kill ourselves. I mean, what do you want, Am? You're, you're sending mixed messages here. Oh. I hate being in the center of the earth and being tortured by a supercomputer. It's the worst time. Oh my goodness. Dead! Dead! You and your turtleneck, I hate it. You are the one I hate more than any. He needs to eat a Snickers, just fucking chill a bit. Take, take some time off, he's gonna be alright. You know how it is. I will adjust the window size after this intro because, my god, you can't stop this thing. Oh no! Help me! Help! Save me, Obi-Wan Kenobi! Yeah. <laughs> Nimdok. Nimdok, the old scientist. How are things in the pastry core, Nimdok? The German Tell scientist, and oh my you goodness. Saw the smoke from the furnaces, and, and you thought they might be ro roasting chickens. <laughs> or don't you want to talk about racist too, are you there? God damn it, Am. So, that, w that was a bit obvious. We didn't even get to find out on our own, but, but Nimdok is a Nazi scientist, which is great. <laughs> I suppose if anyone deserves to be down here, here it's him. But as we find out, he's one of the more likable characters in the game. Ooh, I like secrets. Ooh, an adventure game? Where I use my mouse to click on things? I like all of these things, I really do. Alright. So here we are, we finally get to play the game and I have to resize the window and shit. So hang on, I just gotta I gotta adjust some shit. There we go, I think that's alright. Oh, just a little bit more. There we go, I think that's perfect. I think that's perfect. Now I have to adjust the window again. Oh my god, why won't you let me move things? Hang on. Oh, there's some uh, some residual sound effects. Oh shit, no, I see what happened there. So because this game is the way it is, it runs on the scum engine, so it, you know, it's a little bit of finagling to get it working in the way you would like, but once you've got it all set up and fine, it's it's good to go. Hopefully the game doesn't fucking crash and then I have to set this all up again. Alright, hang on. I'm just going to lower this here, put this over here, and you know what? We are ready to go on our hellish adventure and play Am's little creepy crazy game. And I'm all for it. Alright, so who are we going to go with first? Um, hmm. I'm using Scum VM. Yes, you can play this on DOSBox, but honestly, this is the version you want to play, the one on Scum VM. Uh, the DOSBox one doesn't allow for the um, special, s for the uh, remastered soundtrack, which is what we're hearing right now, and it's really quite good. Um, Alright, who do I want to play as first? Um, to be honest with you, I think I want to start as Gorister because he's the most straightforward, but my god, this game is the Sierra style where you have to save constantly and you don't want to fuck up because you can't just go back and you'd, you'd have to start all over again. I've got five characters to bloody get through, so um, we'll go through the easy one for now. I'm going to start with Gorister. Oh god! Now, I would not want you to think for a moment that I am not a great god. You certainly don't act like one. I kept alive so I could save your feelings of guilt. Traveling along the superhighway of internet. We're in a cathode ray tube or something? I have no idea. Yeah, he's gonna let me kill myself. This is really the best Christmas ever. Here we are. What hell hole did that godless machine put me in this time? Oh, God knows. Looks like some kind of ship, but the floor is too steady. Probably wants me to jump overboard. Do it. To what? A sea of razor blades? Painful, but 
but not deadly. I I don't know. It sounds fairly deadly to me. But oh well, we're in control. We can walk around. We can do things, and we can of course save our game. Very fucking important. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Um, here we go. A new save thingamajig. Enter a new game. I think I'll just call it um shot over ST1. There we go. That should do the trick. And I'll be saving in different slots because my god, we can make mistakes at any time. So, you know, while we're here, let's have a look at things. We've got our, you know, uh, simple, uh, old-fashioned little thingamajig here to, uh, you know, it's the old system for point-and-clicks where you, you know, a bit like, um, a thingy, uh, what's it called? Fucking, uh, piratey thingamajigs. It's not Sid Meier's Pirates, the other one, uh, fucking... Yeah, whatever it is. Anyway, um, so we can look at things, we can take, we can use, we can push, we can give, we can swallow, which is an odd one, uh, and we can talk to people and walk. We can walk around, that's default. Oh my god, here we go. Alright, so... Uh, oh, and of course we have our... Everyone has their psych profile, which actually is kind of like a cheat. So I'm just going to read it now and then just load my game because, you know, you get some insight into every character, but you do lose a bit of, uh, a bit of ability to get the best endings. Oh well. Cultural reference. Man does not live by bread alone. There's a proverb meaning that people have needs beyond the physical ones. So that's a sort of a cryptic clue as to what we should be doing here. But I'm going to load the game. There we go. I think I did that. Did I load a game? I'm not even fucking sure. I seem to have. There we go. All right. So I'm going to look around a bit. I'm going to look at things. I can see I can I can look at mirrors. This hole in my chest aches like a son of a bitch. Yeah, you seem to be missing something there. I don't know what it is. So Gorst is missing his heart, which is great. Now, if I'm going to escape from Am, I'm going to have to do some things. I don't know. Alright, and there's also, um... Oh, I might as well look at the porthole again, just in case. You never know what's on the other side. Too freaking cloudy. I can't see a damn thing. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's cloudy. It can't see anything. And there's, oh, this is a take a little... little note on the ground. Someone must have slipped this under the door. Hmm. It says, I'm a friend. Trust is essential. Well, never do what Am expects, and always expect more than what seems possible. Am is playing a dangerous game here. Well, considering that you, Am owns this place, I don't think it's a good idea to follow well. anything that's in this place hey, it at all. It what does kind of game is Am playing this time? What's he doing now? At least we're smart enough to realize that there's a f it's not a good idea to trust anything here. Uh, but oh well, I think there's... I mean, we've got a bunk, we've got all these things, um... Not really much to look at in this room, so let's just carry on. Oh my god, this game gets great later on. Um... Wait, where's the? Oh, here, here we go. Here's the door. It's a bit tricky to know where you're supposed to exit. Seen anything one. like this in all the years? Ham's oh my god! Us. You should do one of the Monkey Island games. I should. It's very. This is very Monkey Island, but you know, just sort of grim and uh, horrible. So, oh yeah, we got the little portrait here with a black background, and that will slowly turn from black to sort of greenish, and then light green, and then white. If we do really, really well, and not be a fucking jerk off to people. Oh my god. So, I'm just gonna wander around for now. I can walk to things. I can- oh jeez. I have to use doors with the U's. I think push also works, but I'm not entirely sure. Where's the crew? I'm all alone here. Oh man. Alright, what else we got? Oh, we got a sheet? New sheet. What's the deal here? New sheets? They're supposed to be stained with blood and semen. Well, I can actually take that. I think I can anyway. It's been a while. Anyway, no, I got a sheet. I got myself a sheet. Uh, what else have we got? Another mirror, nothing else out of the ordinary here. I think it's the same thing if this you check my chest aches like a son of a bitch. Alright, so what we want to do is we take the... oh shit, so we're taking the, the sheet and I don't think there's anything else in here. I mean that looks kind of interesting, I don't even know what that is. There's maggots eating away at something, I'm not entirely sure what. Uh, no, there doesn't seem to be anything else here. Alright, let's just wander off wherever off is. Oh, walk to the door! <laughs> I don't know where the door is! All right, um... Hmm. Oh, God, I think maybe... Let's just check all the doors for now. Keep pushing and using doors, that's what I always say. Hello? So now, of course, save regularly. All the cabins are alike. All the cabins are alike. What is this treachery? Oh my goodness. All right, so I'm just gonna keep saving regularly because you just never know. Uh, we got a sheet. Another one. New sheet. What's the deal here? Another new sheet? I mean, if that's a new sheet, I don't want to know what kind of uh, like use sheets you've seen. Dream about her again? Forget it. Forget it. No, he's not gonna. He's not gonna sleep either. But I will take the sheet. 
I, I did use by mistake. All right, cool. What else we got? Um, I think that's it. Do I want to look at the book? I've forgotten if I want to look at the book or not. Um, yes, I do. Hang on, I do want to look at the book. I was just checking things. My name's printed on the front of this book. <laughs> Gorister, a tale of of suicide. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, I've had a look at it, but can I take it? Let's have a what? This book is little more than a pile of dust. Oh. <laughs> a metaphor for your life, perhaps? I don't know. Uh, where the hell is the door? Here we go. Look at the door. Walk to the door. Oh, thank God. All right. So, um... I'm just going to have a look around. I'm pretty sure we can't open this door yet. I love the Tesla coils around here. This is it's great. It's locked. All right. That one's locked. We'll have a look around some My more. My stomach's growling. My stomach's growling. Which is, hunger is such a weird theme in this game. Gorister, you shouldn't be the hungry one. That's Benny. That is Benny all the way through and through. Oh my goodness. All right, so, um, uh, oh, hang on, I missed something. I, hang on, I missed something. Yeah. Uh, oh, how do I get back? Hang on, not the stairs. Not the stairs. This is, this is a really tricky area here because you got the stairs, but I want to walk over to the corridor, which popped up for a second. There we go. Walk to corridor, not upstairs. That's a really tricky spot, that is. I completely missed something. Hang on. Uh, let's use the door. It's been a while. It's been many, many years since I last played this game. Fingers crossed. We might get a shit ending. Okay, so it's not this place. Walk to the door! Alright. Um, hopefully it's this place. Because I know I'm missing something in my inventory. Something really awesome. Okay. Okay, no, it's not in here then. Oh no, we're, all off, we're not off good, to a good start. I, I don't know where I'm going. Uh, maybe it was in the place. No, it couldn't have been in the place I was at before. Remember, all the caverns are the same. Ugh. Okay, I'm... No, I'm pretty sure I was... Stomach's growling. He's still hungry. Still hungry. Hang on, here we go. Use... Use the door. All right. See, this is where I always get a bit confused. Where's the crew? West. All alone here. I'm all alone. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to push this pillow aside. What good will that do me? Just, just humor me. Just, just use it. I don't know what to do with this. Well, take it then. Whatever. Just... A gun. There we go. It's heavy. Heavier than it ought to be. <laughs> it's so heavy. I don't think I can use it to kill myself. You can actually load it up and kill yourself now, which will end the scenario. But I don't want to do that. Of course. Why would I want to do that? Uh, is there anything else worth looking at in here? I don't know. I mean, there's a bunk. Real hospitable of you, Am. <laughs> such... Red bear, cockroach infested, grease stained accommodations. Beautiful. I, I, that's my favorite. All right. Um, I think that's all I need in here. I mean, there's just another mirror and a porthole. Go on, let's get going. Oh, hang on. Walk to. My stomach's growling. So the interface is a bit weird. You can click on things just to. And, th and then click again on things to, you know, for contextual stuff. But also, if you highlight things, see, some things turn red. And that means you can right-click them and just immediately do whatever it is that that is. But sometimes, sometimes it's very weird. They give you, hang on, use, and no, see, walk to is not going to do anything for me. So I have to manually click on use. Oh my god. Someone sure trashed this place. Uh, yes. In one hell of a fight. One hell of a fight. I mean, I, I'm not sure what even happened in here, but what are you gonna do? So we got some, uh, what, what, what is this? What is this? This punch smells like gasoline. Oh my god, so we got some poison on the table. Um, we've got, oh, we've got a tablecloth. Someone wiped their bloody hands here. <laughs> I think it was me. Alright, we got some debris. This junk looks like it was knocked over in the fight. There's blood here and god knows what else. Hmm. And this place doesn't seem familiar to, uh, to you at all? No? Alright. Alright. Um, and there's a little room back here, so let's go over there. Oh, I have to use the doors manually, of course. And welcome to the kitchen! It stinks in here. <laughs> well, I mean, it's a very poorly maintained kitchen. But look at the little rats having a great time. Having a great time. I got a knife. A kitchen knife. Damn big one, too. See, we know we need one of these. We're gonna take that, and we're gonna make it our friend. There we go, so we got a knife. Um, I, I forgot what I'm gonna do with a knife. I, I do know one thing we're gonna do with a knife, but not just yet. Not just yet. It uses essentially the same system as Maniac Mansion. I know some weird things that happen when you try and use certain commands with it. Oh my god. Oh, I found a fork. And hello, Imagination Artist. How you doing? You joined us at the right time. Because we just only got started. I'm stuck in the machine of, um, 
And what have we got here? We've got a fork. Looks like a fork. Nearly missed it. Nearly missed it. It was just kind of sitting there, little thing. Take the fork. There we go. So we've got a fork. we got a knife. And that's fine by me. Looks like a gas oven. A gas oven. Stick your head in. I'm in. Big enough to climb in. I'm glad he noticed that. It's like, wow, I could get in this and kill myself if I wanted to. I'm doing pretty good. Gorist right too good, though. He doesn't have a heart and he wants to kill himself, but he can't because he's stuck in the am evil machine. Oh my goodness. So we've got a cookbook as well. An how to cook cookbook. mice. An old cookbook. An old one, but it's not It's not how to cook mice, unfortunately. It's empty, but the label says poison. Fatal if swallowed. Fatal if swallowed. You know you want it. Oh no, he doesn't actually keep it in his inventory. Oh my goodness. All right. Um. Do do do. Um. I've forgotten what to do in here to get rid of the mice. Um. I think maybe you just actually hang on. Maybe you just use the knife on them. I hope so. Use the knife for the rats. God. Okay. Yeah. No. That's... Well, that scared them away. <laughs> you, you, I'm not even putting it near you. But oh well. Let's have a look at this. What's this? Oh, crap. This bread's covered with rat droppings. Oh, I wanted to eat it, but I guess I'll take it. Why not? Yay, we have shit bread. Look at that. <laughs> That's the best thing. Oh, my God. All right, well, um, I think we're actually supposed to eat this, I think. I don't think we give this to anyone. Let's swallow the bread. Do it. I'm no longer hungry, but I still feel empty. I f I'm it's such an right. empty, broken man. Oh my god, well you gotta be if you gotta eat bread like that. Oh my god, and we're saving because I think we're doing okay. Alright, um, I'm pretty sure- uh, do I need anything for the- no, I'm pretty sure we don't need anything with the poison right now, but I've, I've completely forgotten this game. Maybe we'll come back here later, although, there's a hole in the wall, there are other things. Unfortunately this game is one of those sort of pixel hunters, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. but what are you gonna do? Um, alright, I- oh, well I didn't actually read the book, so I'll try that. Hang on, I have a look at the- an old cookbook. But I didn't actually take it, so here we go. Damn thing looks ready to fall apart. Useless. Oh man. All right. Try eating it. Why not? I must be going mad. <laughs> I must be going mad. I'm trying to trying to eat a book, but then again, after that shit covered bread, I'd eat anything right now. Uh, I think we are good to go. I think. I'm not sure. Okay. Um, I think. Well, I mean, I got the bread. I don't think there's anything else to look at. So, all right. Let's keep on trucking. Oh my goodness, alright, um... I'm shit out of ideas now. Oh my god. Oh, Andrew Plays is now auto-hosting. Brought to one viewer. I'm still not uh, keen on auto-hosting myself, but I... I greatly appreciate the hosting all the same. Alrighty. So, oh, I love the Tesla calls in this place. Very nice. Stalin would approve. I think I'm supposed to go this way, but I'm not sure it's been so long. What a stench. What a stench. Piss. It's <laughs> like piss and running meat. That's very descriptive. Uh, I can like that. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, I think I know where I'm going. Yeah, no, I'm in the right place. I'm in the engine room right now. Here we go. And oh boy, I wish they hadn't cut out the, the part where you find out this place is powered by dogs. It's like that Simpson sketch, only it's for real this time. Alright, so we got some uh, milky fluid, which I'll have a look at. Hey, it's dog juice. All right. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to take that bottle just to fuck up the machine. Why not? So we've got some milky fluid. Um, and we've also got some things. We've got a lever. I mean, you might as well look at it first. Motivator. Motivator. See, everything's a fucking metaphor in this game, so you're just gonna you just gotta roll with it. My God, I'm killing those poor creatures in the cages. No, the fuel is people. People. Oh my God. But that's quite true. Uh, there was actually a cutscene where you see a dog just get torn apart. And they thought, no, that's a bit macabre even for this game, so we're going we're gonna to do away with that. Um, Alright, and also, uh, there's a bloody key, as you can see. There's a key. There's a key. Must be, for the cages. Must be for opening the cages. We are going to take the shit out of that key. The blood of the innocent is now on my hands. <laughs> Come on. You're not even trying at this point. But uh, we, we can do something about that. I think it's this room. Hang on, I just gotta remember which room has the... Uh, it's not the... Oh no, it is this one. Alright. Um, I am going to use the tablecloth. I've washed my hands of the past. Washed my hands of the past. And now I'm happy. Look at that. Look at that little image there. He's so cheery. I'm feeling a bit better that I don't have blood on my hands. 
<laughs> I feel a little bit better. And with that, I'm saving the game. Because you never fucking know. Alright, so we did that. Um, oh god. Alright, um, uh, at this point I'm going to go back to... I'm going to go back to the engine room because there's some other things we need to do. Um, I just clean my hands so the things would be a little bit... Uh, oh, hang on, where did I come from? It's not the stairs. Hang on. Oh, the door. Alright, there we go. Engine room. Alright. Do, do, do. And see, you know, his music's changed to be a little more uh, upbeat. Things are okay because the blood on my hands has been washed clean. Metaphors, motherfucker. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, and I notice I'm not getting any follower alert thingies, so hang on, I better sort that out right now. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. The Redneck Adventures of Gorister. <laughs> the funnest of fun times. We're in the engine room. And there are monkeys and dogs and cats and rabbits and things getting torn apart. So the longer I stay on the ship, the more the more death awaits. Oh my god, which is great. It's the best thing. Uh, I just need to set up the follower alert thingies. Oh my god, test your follower alert. Do it. Do it. Do it hard. There we go. <laughs> you feel like going like that? I do. <laughs> Norris is not having it though. He's just no. All right. So back, anyway, back to the game for reals this time. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to use our fork. I could have done this at any point, but I, I just I like the idea of using it now. I'm just going to use the fork with the engine and basically just fuck things up. Which is apparently something we wanted to do. So now the engine's fucked. For all we know, this could have been an engine keeping a helicopter in the sky and now we're fucking going to crash. Although that doesn't seem to be the case. Alright, I think that's all I wanted to do here, so this time we're actually going to head up the spiral staircase. Whoa, what awaits us up here? Alright. Big bags of gas. As it turns out. As it turns out, we're in an airship. Huh, who would have known? Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to take our knife. This looks sharp enough to slice through just about anything. Just about anything, even my throat. Well, you know what, I'm going to use that. I'm going to use the knife with one of the airbags. Yeah. Which looks like taste is rushing out. The gas is rushing out. All right, fantastic. This looks sharp enough to slip. And I'm going to I'm going to do this twice. I'm going to cut a couple of bags. Here, I use a knife with the Oh, oh, use a knife with another airbag. Here we go. And we're just going to cut two of them because if I cut more than that, different. something feels different. So if you cut more than two, you're in uh, you're in a bit of trouble. You're in a bit of trouble. But hey, um do I want to cut through there just yet? I don't know. I think so. Oh my god. This looks sharp enough. Oh my god. And the music stopped, which is a bit of a glitch in this game, so that means I have to save and load it up again, but that's fine. Boom. There we go. It does that. Old games, you know what they're like. Alright. Here we go. Oh. No. That doesn't work. Hang on. Use knife with stitching. There we go. I ripped a new hole. I ripped a new hole. I ripped this airship a new one, I did. And then we're going to use said hole. Some kind of building. All right, we finally made it outside. It looks pretty shitty, but oh, uh, there we go. And what's this out here? Oh my god! That heart's all wired up like some kind of weird guidance system. Weird guidance Man, system. I'm not gonna like where it's taking me. My heart is leading me to whatever this is—a honky tonk. There's a building in the distance. Oh my god! <laughs> this, yeah, it's not the most subtle game on the planet, but what are you gonna do? All right, uh, there is something I want to do here, but I can't quite remember. Um. Uh, I forgot. Oh, right, hang on. Um, you, uh, no, I've completely forgotten what I'm doing here. I guess going to that place is where I want to go, but I'm... Oh, no, hang on, I remember, I remember. Here we go, use sheets with sheets. These two sheets make a halfway decent rope. Halfway decent rope, see, there we go. Um, I'm not quite sure how he did that, but it's, it's sure, why not? So now we've got a rope. some kind of building. Okay, so now we've got to make sure we don't fall off ourselves. We want to tie it to the mooring, which is right over here. There we go. I don't know what to do with this. I don't know what to do with this. Um, uh, do I just... I think I just take my heart now. Hang on. Here we go. There we go. And I'm getting a bit happier. I'm going more green. Easy. 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 There we go. It's, I just kind of ripped it off the, the edge there. No, it's all good. It's all good. It's fine. There's no good heart of mine. doesn't beat it. It's useless, but I did put it in just for shits and giggles. <laughs> you know, just, just for the good old times. 
All right, now we'll still need this rope, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use my knife to cut off the rope. Apparently, I'll, I'll have plenty of rope all day just to hang myself. <laughs> this is the most grim thing. Hang on, here we go, knife with the rope. Whoop, there we go, all good. Now I think I'm ready to head off to that honky-tonk. Uh, uh, disembark from the ship. Oh my god, cutscenes! Ye olden days when you got funny cut land. But where? We've landed. Oh my goodness. This is great. We can finally get off this thing. I don't like this place. It uses animal fuels. I don't like that at all. Honky Tonk. My name on it. It has my name on it. It also seems to have a satellite dish. What? Why? Why? Why do you want things? Oh my god, we got a tire. Donkey Kong might have been here. Big worn truck tire. Big worn truck tire. <laughs> he used to be a trucker as well. Could you be any more fucking stereotypical? All right, let's have a look. Dark and grubby, but somehow familiar. But somehow familiar. All right. So what we want to do is, well, first of all, we want to raid the fucking cabinet and take some whiskey. It's got to be some whiskey or something. There we go. I knew I'd find some whiskey. Harry used to guzzle this stuff. All right, I am just, I'm taking it. I'm, I'm not, not even paying for it. Boom. So we got some whiskey, which is always good to have in your inventory. It's not pine resin, but it will do. Uh, we got a jukebox. Old-fashioned jukebox. Does it even play? I don't know. All right, we've also got, oh, what the hell is that? Oh, it's just a tear in the stool. It looks like there's a little something there, but no, I don't think so. All right, um... Oh, I'm supposed to use the... Oh, never mind. I'm supposed to actually use the jukebox. Alrighty. Um... Boop, 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 boop. Oh. Jezebel. I hope that wasn't me. Oh. <laughs> fucking in-laws every time. Into an insane asylum. Why not? It was my fault, wasn't it? It was my fault, I think it was. I don't even know anymore. Alright, and we've got it takes two to tango. You don't ever take me dancing. That's what Glennis said the night we fought. <laughs> oh God, she seems why okay. I to hit her. I'd rather kill myself than hurt my poor Glennis. And now I'm now I'm a, a, a jukebox. You let me die, Gorister. Now I'm gonna say because you're not supposed to actually Play the third one, but I'm going to play it anyway because this isn't so, this isn't You're so good for us. You're a worthless excuse for a man. Mama was right. No, he enough. throws a little tantrum, gets a little worried. <laughs> oh God, I never want to hear my wife call me that again. He's, he's like a fragile little leaf. So we're going to load up because we don't we we don't want to fuck up too badly, do we? Let's got to face the music, <laughs> which is completely worthless. We don't need it. It's just some dickhead just mumbling a tune, but oh well. Anyway, um... Ooh, I guess I'll just head outside, why not? Use that door. There's a back door here. And hello! Rister, you've seen better days. So is the big machine for that matter. Um, hello Mr. Jackal. Um, why, why, why is there a Jackal to talk to? I don't know. <laughs> Where, what are you? You're a jackal. You're not a domesticated dog. What are you really? No. Are you gonna eat my testicles? Oh, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> you am playing with my mind again. You fuck. Playing with my mind again. I should have known. I do have an in with the big machine. He and I are like brothers. My brothers? Well, I mean, I don't trust you at all. Why can't you give me a straight answer? Can't you give me a straight answer? Like so many others down here, I'm cursed to speak in riddles. We mm. all have our curses to be. If you say so. What's my yeah. curse? What's my curse? After 109 years in the belly of the beast, I think you have a gut instinct by now. I don't even think I have a gut anymore. I haven't checked. <laughs> I'm getting tired of your smart mouth. I'm tired of your smart mouth. Kick him! No, kick that jackal in the face. Break his teeth. Then he won't eat, be able to eat anymore. Where do you come from? Even if he is just a machine. Okay, so he must know what lies across the mountain. He must know what lies across the mountain. So many mountains. If they're coming. 
journey. Oh my god, I'm not ready for a long journey. I don't even think I, I like the idea of being here at all. That desert doesn't look any worse than the other hell holes Ham's cooked up for us. That desert doesn't look any worse than the other Lord knows, it's the worst up. place to be. Keep my words, Gorister. You can never make it alone out there. And don't expect me to be As if Ham's gonna let me die now. Just when things were getting interesting. What do you want? I have a craving. A craving for something scrumptious. A human heart, perhaps. Ooh. Well, I do have one. I'm not gonna give you my heart. I'm not gonna give you my heart. No? Too bad. I was gonna I mean, it's not. Uh, apparently, we don't need it, but uh, I've grown attached to the little blighter. Tell me how to get across the mountains, you jackal, you. Oh, all right. Fine. Take it. And apparently this is good for me. I think I'll save this delicacy for later. Oh. You want to get across the mountains? Did, didn't didn't you just eat it now? I'm so confused. Alright, apparently that's a good thing, because I'm cheered up. I'm all good. <laughs> Giving my heart to that jackal has just made my day ever so brighter. Oh, tell me that riddle for getting across the mountain again. Oh, okay. Doesn't make much sense with me that does what Anne's doing to us, does it? Doing to us, you say? I got nothing more to say to you. I got nothing more to say to you, despicable creature. You've taken my heart and eaten it. Oh my god. All right, I'm going to save here because I think we're making some good progress. All right, we do not want to walk towards the desert right now, but I will look at it. Oh no, I went to the desert. <laughs> So that's one way to lose. Don't walk towards the mountain. You shall go next. Who among you shall go next? See, you can't actually. Oh, you can replay. Uh, that's bizarre. I would not want you to think for a moment. Oh my god! But I should probably load instead. Uh, I didn't know you could do that. So you can outright fail and then just start again. That's really odd. I, I, I've never actually outright failed any of these before, but I guess that makes sense. All right. See, I wanted to look at the desert. There we go. My words, Forrester. You can never make it alone. And you're bore Am walking along the desert like an idiot. <laughs> you're boring. Stop walking in the desert alone. All right. What else have we got? We got trash cans. More interesting rubbish to sift through, Forrester. Does that give you some food for thought? Oh, got a shovel. Shovel. I guess I'll take it. Why not? Be careful where you use that, Forrester. Oh. Oh, okay. I'd like to know where all the bodies are buried. <laughs> I want to eat some corpses today, so just let me know. All right, so that's good. Um, let's just head to the back door. Why not? Yep, come on, let me go. It's supposed to be one of those things where, yeah, you can restart, but there'll be a penalty that affects the ending. Perhaps this is a very weird game like that, and that even if you kind of do badly and don't get full uh, white background there, you can still get the good ending. So I don't have to do everything perfect, but. Obviously, I don't want to fuck up too badly. Hello. Harry's here. My my father-in-law. How did you get here? Harry, how did you, you of all here? people? You know, it's a big place, the desert. I got lost in it myself. Hey, how did... He's, no, he's not answering at all. I'm sorry, Dave, I can't do that. You're going to be trapped here for a long, long time. Whose heart was impaled on the Zeppelin spike? Is it even mine? Impaled. Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. You're not giving me a straight answer at all. Uh, what's this about a thunderstorm? What's this about a thunderstorm? You know, it's a big place, the desert. <laughs> I got lost in it myself. Oh, Harry, you and your Parkinson's disease and your your addled mind. Let me pour you a drink. <laughs> He's not shaking around too much. All right, so now that we've poured him a drink, uh, we can actually get some straight answers out of him. Zeppelin, Forrester. We came on the Zeppelin. Oh, I came from that too. What do you know about you this know about Zeppelin? Zeppelin? You'll have to talk to Edna. She knows all about the Zeppelin. Oh, not Edna. That's why we did it, you know. That's why we did what? What did you do? What did you do? Did you you do? crazy man. You know, Gorister. You've been to the dining room. I have. Bloody tablecloth and everything. What happened in the dining room? I shouldn't have let her force me into it. I'm not a murderer. Oh, I'm beginning to get it. Who did you kill? Who did you kill? 
Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. Oh, for God's sake. Drink up, Pops. Let me pour you a drink. <laughs> All right, now, who'd you kill, fuckface? Did kill? Didn't look at the wreckage in the dining room too closely, did you? Or haven't you had to take a leak yet? <laughs> oh, I see where you're coming from here, yeah, sure. And just where is my dear mother-in-law? I'd very much like to claw her eyes out again. I don't know. Good God, I, I can't stand the sight of her anymore. Yeah, Can that's how I know. being kept alive for 109 years just to hear her carping? To be fair, I think you've suffered a worse hell than I ever had. Uh, what's this about a what's thunderstorm? This about a thunderstorm. You know, it's a big place. The desert. Oh, for fuck's sake! Have another drink I'll there. You a drink. <laughs> Your liver's gonna collapse in on itself, but it's all right. Do We're gonna get as much information out of you as possible. Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. And what's this about a thunderstorm? What's this about a thunderstorm? You know, it's a big uh. place. The desert. All right, have another sip. Go on. Pour you a drink. It's, it's one of those moments. I'll talk to you later, his I guess. Heart was pale on his... Why, you're... Oh, well, my heart's on there. Well, all right, I guess I'll talk, talk to you later. later. See you later, Pops. Well, let's go to the restroom. Remember, flush the toilet three Practical times and good things will happen. Broken fixtures. Disgusting. Disgusting. I feel right at home. Well, let's have a look at some things. Why not? There's something shiny inside the yard. Are you really gonna pick it up? I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, no, look at things. Damn spouse twisted. Damn spouse. It's broken. It's broken, but we got this graffiti here. What's this? It has friends. That's interesting. Is Am not really alone and he's fucking up with my head in a different way? I don't know. Alright, um... Oh, I guess I gotta take the thing in the urinal. It's a magnifying glass. It's covered in urine, of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? All right. Oh, hang on, and I can use it to actually examine the graffiti further. I don't know what to do with these. Mm, oh, hang on, no, this is the graffiti I'm talking about. Yeah, it's... graffiti. The woman who did the deed. The woman who did the deed. But this time, we're actually going to use this and have a look at it there. I don't know what to do with these. Wait, what am I? I'm confused. I remember having to read. Oh, hang on. Look at the. Healthy. Let's take a closer look. I don't know what to do with these. I seem to recall there's something to read. Oh, hang on, no, it's here. Here we go. Look at that graffiti. Graffiti. Men are no good. <laughs> men are just no good. Yeah, I wonder who that. I don't know what oh. to do with these. Come on, Anita, you can't go in the men's room. I've told you many, many times. All right. Um, I, I remember. I distinctly remember reading something. Uh, oh God, it's been a while. A toilet stall. Ham's never given us privacy before. None of this makes sense. Alright. So, oh, hang on, I remember what I'm supposed to use this for, and I'll go to the toilets in just a second. There's something I actually need. You just stay there, Harry. I know I've given you enough, enough booze to probably kill you, but you'll be fine, I think, probably. So we can, well, we're fine. We're all good. Oh, and just instantly I'm back on. I'm glad that there are no loading screens in this game, otherwise we'd be here all fucking day. Alright, um... Oh, jeez, I've completely forgotten. Hang on, inventory. Here we go. Um... I have to do... Oh, that's right. Hang on. You asked me to check the dining room. Let's see. There's a vomit stain. I wonder why that's there. This is... This is just weird. Vomit stains. Near the punch Near the punch bowl. So you tried to poison me, you bastards. I knew it all along. This junk looks like it was knocked over in the fight. Alrighty. God knows what else. Okie dokie. Oh, I remember now. Use on this stuff, which makes no sense to me at all. There's some hair that was pulled out during the fight. It's the same color as mine. It's the same color as mine. It's the same understand what happened here. I'm slightly happier because now I realize that I was murdered. Hooray! <laughs> this game's weird, alright. Um, I think that's everything. Uh, alright, no, no, fine. I'm, just, I'm gonna go to the door. Oh my god, we can get a, an early ending with this as well. Well, for this scenario anyway, so I better save. This is, oh my god, I can't wait. Here we go. Alright, uh, use the, the hatch. That's how we get out of this place. Use the 
door. That's kind of annoying. I wish there were hotkeys for things. There may be, and I just I can't remember. All right, Harry. It's time for you to meet your maker. I know you killed me now, and I'm not going to stand for it. Take this. Yeah. Oh. Rack! <laughs> and that was the end of Harry. And I got his heart. Mine. This is mine now. Oh no, I've committed evil. Oh, what do I do? Oh, look at you, Harry, laying there dead. He's dead. He's dead, and now we can drink his blood and because it's the alcohol content of about, I don't know, three whiskeys now. But of course, we don't want to kill him just yet. We just want to load and talk to him about everything that we just found out. Because, I mean, honestly, honestly, we need answers at this point. I was the one you killed, wasn't I, you bastard? I'm sorry, Gorister. Edna poisoned the punch, and after you drank <laughs> I tell it, you, I he did. to the ground. When the poison it's took effect, too. I cut you open. <laughs> well, why did you fucking kill me? Why did you kill me? Looks like there's a thunderstorm on the horizon. Come on, drink up there, boozy. Let me pour you a drink. <laughs> Here, have a drink. Why did you kill of me? Of absinthe. It's too complicated for me to explain. You'll have to ask Edna. I need to ask Edna. Well, that's true. All right. Talk to you later. <laughs> See ya, murderer. <laughs> sure, why not? All right. I'm going to head off to the bathroom store, and this time we're going to do the thing for the deal. There we go. Flush once. Now we have to do this three times, if you remember, to go to the secret special place. Oh, my goodness. So we have to use the bathroom store three times, and then we'll go to a special new area. I can't wait. Here we go. <laughs> Not again. Damn, you bastard. What have you done? You brought me to a meat locker and there looks like there's the Satan thing going on there and there's some beef. Delicious. Great quality too. This looks delicious, I love it. But something's very, 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 very wrong here. That's Edna, my mother-in-law. She's hanging from a meat locker. This is all... <laughs> This is great! My mother-in-law is hanging from a meat hook. Now I can stab her and all that. And there's Glennis as well. Glennis? What does that have you on me? Oh my god. Alright, well, I guess I'll have a chat with Glennis. She can't talk. All she can do is drool out of the side of her mouth. She can't. Oh god, what have I done? What have I done? You haven't done anything. It's, it's not your fault. Alrighty. So, um, oh god, I better save because I, I don't remember this area at all. <laughs> oh, so many dead people! Alright, um, I guess I'll talk to the in-law, why not? It looks, it looks like I can't escape you, Edna, even in the belly of Ahem. It looks like I can't escape you, Edna. Never escape even the in-laws. In why would you want to escape from me, Gorister? We're family, after all. Sh sure. <laughs> you were always telling Glynis how much you hated me. Now, Gorister... I was just concerned about my baby. Glynis you stabbed so me in the spleen eight times. Being out and then the you conspired with your husband to murder me, and I guess it worked. Best you could. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I know all about your plot to murder me. Edna, you bitch. I know all about your plot to murder me. I had to make a deal with Am. I had to. I've always been harsh on you, I admit. But we're <laughs> the last people on Earth. Let's help each other now. No, I think I'm still going to leave you here to die. Why should I trust my own murderer? Alliances change, Gorister. <laughs> Something's gone I mean, we're here in hell, uh, machine hell, so I mean, why not? I need Let you. bygones be bygones? You need me. It's that simple. I don't need you. Oh my god. Um, do I want to take it down from the meat hook? I don't know. I ought to kill you now. I ought to kill you right Stab now, Stab her. You bitch. Don't be a fool, Gorister! You need me alive! If you want to make it out of here. Oh my god. Cut Edna's heart out. Yes. Do it. One heart looks like another. <laughs> they all look the same. Hello there. Edna, now you really are heartless. <laughs> well, I shouldn't have done that, so hang on. Let's just go back. Go back in time. Back to regularly scheduled uh, in-law infighting. Oh my god. It looks like... Alright, this time we're not going to murder her. You were always telling... Not this time, though. Edna, you... I, I've okay, thank God I can skip through this. Why should I... I need... 
All right. Okay, so I've exhausted all that. Um, uh, oh yeah, we do take her off the hook this time, I think. All righty. From the mate hook and please don't kill me. Ow! Let go of my head, you stupid woman! Let me go! There! <laughs> I don't know, just kick her or something. I'll t Please, I'll do anything you ask. Just let go of my ears, God! Can you ever forgive me? Well, yeah, if you stop shaking my fucking head! Like, well, I, I won't forgive you if you stop doing that! Sip of that milk. No, I'm not giving you any milk. No, I don't trust you. Forrester, let me down or I'll scratch your eyes out, you worthless <laughs> excuse! Yeah, I don't think we should give her anything. Oh my god, look at this. We got uh, Edna, you dropped Edna a key there. Dropped a key. Hand me back that key and let me down. I'm your only hope of getting out of here. That's how I get into my greenhouse. Oh my god. Sorry, I know I don't trust you as far as I can spit. Sorry, Edna. Which isn't very far. Let me prove my conscience. I'll let you know. You're giving me the key. Okay, sure. <laughs> Shoot Edna with the gun. I'd love to. I got nothing to say to you. Oh, oh, do I tie her up? I, I forgot. Um, uh, oh, yeah, no, I tie her up with the rope and then take the key. Because she'll try and kill me if I get the key. You really do hate my spleen. I'm taking you with me and now we got it in this body. Hey there, Edna. <laughs> what is happening? I'm just walking around with a woman in my inventory. What is going on? All right, and I got Edna's key. What is this? It is a key. I don't know what it's for just yet. Oh my goodness. All right, so um, that was the thing, and now I'm walking around with the greatest of ease. I think she's probably tied to my back. What the hell? I know. So uh, that that escalated. Uh, that that went somewhere. Oh my goodness. Um, but uh, we're not going to do anything with Glynis just yet. I'm just going to head to the door. We'll come back here though. We'll come back. All right, so now I've, I'm have i actually going to go all the way back to the, the, the door. Uh, where's the door? There we go. I'm going to head all the way back to... to Oh, there we go, the Zeppelin. And then we're going to do some more things. Now, if I only remembered what I'm supposed to do from here. Good old walkthrough will remind me a few things, though. Um, uh, oh, of course, I've got it in this key, so use it, you dumbass. All right. Um, here we go, do walk to the corridor. There we go. Do -do -do, do -do -do -do. So now we got this key. Oh, no, don't run too far. I want to use your bloody... Oh, no, that's the bloody key. I want Edna's key. There we go. I don't see a lock. I don't see a lock. I'm using a key with a key, and you just don't do that. All right. There we so go. So many dials and controls. I've made my way to the bridge. Oh, my God. And, and things couldn't be better. Now we just fly this into the honky tonk, blow it up, and I get to kill myself, Edna, and everyone else. Oh my god, happy days. All right, what have we got? Look at, look at, oh, there's a logbook. Edna wrote this logbook. Ooh. Well, well, go on, read it. Hang on, use it. Here we go. Read Edna's first log entry. Am hates all life, which I can respect. Am space much? You were just, you were the worst mother of all time. Escape responsibility. after all. Yes, I'm so happy I've read that diary entry. Now I can blame everything on my mother-in-law, but I was already doing that. Oh well, never mind. I don't trust anyone with the name Glynis. <laughs> I don't trust anyone with that name. It could mean anything. Oh my god, last log entry is. <laughs> I can just let my husband do it. Fuck him. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm closing that logbook. Holy fuck. <laughs> Alright, uh, I don't think there's anything else to do. I mean, there's other things to look at, but I don't think we use anything just yet. So how do I get out of here? I don't get anything. We've got all these things. We've got a switch. The ignition switch. Well, you don't want to hit that just yet. You really don't. 
Alright, so unfortunately now we're gonna have to go all the way back to the freezer, which is annoying, but oh well, what are you gonna do? What are you going to do? And as, as miserable as this is, this is probably... Oh, I don't know, I'd say Benny's scenario might be a little bit easier than this. This ain't so bad. This is probably the most straightforward one. Benny's got some weird glitches as well uh, from time to time. This game could use a little bit of polish. But hey, I recommend reading the short story, which comes with the game if you buy it on Steam. I think you can buy this on GOG as well. I'm not entirely sure, though. It makes sense if you could. I mean, this is an old game. But now GOG is sort of moving towards new stuff. Oh, I only have to flush once this time. Alrighty. So now, this time, we're going to feed... Oh, we're going to give the milky fluid to our dead wife. Wake up! Turns out it was your crazy fucking mother. All right, there we go. She's gone. At least I finally made amends with her. She's gone. The milky fluid didn't do anything. Out of this freezer. It's an elk on two bodies. <laughs> now I'm just gonna carry two women. I'm so glad I'm carrying around two women now. Linus, what has Am done to you, honey? Oh my God, can I talk to her? Are you right? No, no, I can't talk to her. Inventory items. That's just silly. <laughs> I'm so thrilled that I did this. Um, alright, let me think. Um, I'm not done here though, am I? I'm trying to remind myself, because I mean, there's, there's other stuff. Can I use anything with the beef? I mean, it's just kind of, maybe I can talk to it. Hello! No, you can't talk to it. Alright. But I'm pretty sure there's something else I was meant to do here. Great A quality too. Ham's never given us something this good to eat before. Oh my god. Um, oh, no, I remember. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Where's that knife? I need a beef heart. I can imagine him going, well, go take her out in the... In the pocket you go. Uh, where? Did I... Oh. Hang on, did I use this prompt? Here we go. Hang on, we click. No use. The rest of this carcass is frozen solid. Frozen solid? Well, then how the hell am I supposed to... I have no idea. Uh, hang on, I gotta use the walkthrough again. Uh, oh, I know. Oh, jeez, I never would have guessed this. This is why it's so confusing. The organs are still inside. Yes. Me when Am ripped that hole open in Benny's chest. <laughs> of course, Am sewed him back up again before he bled to death. Oh my the God. He's never gonna let us die. He's just gonna keep torturing. So us the characters him. actually in the story, they're um they're with each other quite a bit. In the game, not so much. In fact, I don't think anyone actually meets anyone else. Not in the flesh, anyway. There are some crossover characters in other fictions, but yeah, no. And that's not the real thing. Um, can I now use the knife? I hope so. Here we go. Oh. Yep. Use the knife. I just dull my knife. I dull my knife if I use the knife with the knife. Here we go. One heart looks like another. Sure, and now we're gonna trade this with the jackal to get our heart back, because that's what we need to progress in life. I think we're done now. Um, walk to the door. There we go. Uh, just need some reminders here. Let's see. Uh, yeah, no, that seems to be fine. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm doing okay so far. Things could be worse. I better save just to be, just to be safe though, because you never know. Um, hey there, Mr. Jackal. The found Handler and Glynis. How's that help me escape from here? No. I've got nothing more to say to you. Um. Now I've got some things to say. Those are some new things. I found Edna and Glynis. How does that help me escape? Look, I've got two Such dead bodies on me. Price. Surely I can build a but bridge or something. No bargaining position. I'll offer you a trade. Your heart for Edna's. Okay. Give the beef heart to the jackal. There you go. Hey, and we've, we're we're in the green now. A bitter organ, but worth its weight in gold to me. Cheers, brah. All right, so I got my heart back, and yeah, I'm even, I feel even better now than I did when I gave him my heart initially. <laughs> Happy days. Uh, I pokemon my wife and my and my, my mother-in-law, and things couldn't be better. I've also got my heart back. Oh my god, everything's much clearer now. I read it as long ago. I know everything. Clearer. Can I go home, please? You must make amends and bury the past, Torrest. Bury the past, you say? So how do I get out of here? So how do I get out of here? Hmm. Alright. So... 
I don't understand your riddle about another orb. I don't understand your riddle about another orb. I gave you, I gave you two hearts now. And all the other animals like. Ah, I see. Well, I got nothing more to say to you, I Jackal got Man. To say to you. Look at this. I got Goris's heart, which looks reminiscent of the heart that you get in uh, fucking. What's it called again? It's a. It's, uh, it's it. What do you think? Oh. No, I can't. I guess not. Um, but uh, Dishonored 2 is coming out, but um, it, it looks very much like the heart from Dishonored 1. Also for, from Thingy, uh, Shadow Warrior. Actually, no. Shadow Warrior doesn't have a clock in it, but I can look at it. I can look and see what this There's is. There's a compass and wires attached to this heart. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I forgot to do something. Hang on. I forgot to bury my wife. <laughs> I mean, I can't carry around all day, surely. Alright, and that's what the shovel's for. Here we go, one shovel. Shovel with the ground. Must bury the past. Yeah, yeah. Love those sound effects. Alright, so now we use the wife. We can bury Glenn Edna's body, why not? Hello there, Ken Shabby. You joined us at the best time, I buried my wife, and all is well. There we go, in a ch fairly shallow grave by the look of it. Oh. My. God. So, we did that. Oh, I made amends with my past. Can I please go home now? I've made amends and buried the past. Literally! I've made amends and buried the past. <laughs> An excellent job, Gordon. This This game is not but very subtle at all, but hey, what are you gonna do? You'd better hurry if you want to recharge your old ticker's battery. Alright, so I want to recharge me heart, I guess. I've got nothing more to say to you. I've got nothing more to say to you. I thank you for helping me get out of this place. And fuck you, I'd stab you if I could, but that's gonna get me a bad ending, so... Uh, Goodbye there, asshole. Keep drinking. Don't kill me again. Alright, so we're nearly actually done with this. Um, alright. Uh, I'm gonna go to the engine room, which is... Oh, fuck. Over here? Yeah, alright. Been watching on Xbox One, uh, but would not let me chat. Oh my god, Xbox... Xbox, go home. <laughs> go home. You're drunk. Oh my god. Um, alright, so now that we've got my heart, I need to charge it and shit. So what I'm gonna do is gonna use my heart. Um, what good will that do me? Oh, hang on, no. Before we use the heart, uh, walk to damn interface, walk to thing over there. All right. So first, what we want to do, and this is the funniest thing in the game. Well, not really. There are some funnier things, but this is great. We're gonna take in this body. Actually, before we do anything, I'm gonna have a look at this thing. What's this? It's a harness. Why is this harness wired up to the end? It's wired up to the end. I mean, I could. It could be a fun time. Might tickle my balls in the right way, but oh well. What I'm gonna do is pop Edna in here. Yep. Oh, come on. End this body with harness. Bruh. Ah. Oh, oh. The up again. Yes. I'm using my my, my mother-in-law as a power source. <laughs> I sure. Sure. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Your negativity is doing well for the ship. <laughs> this is the this is the weirdest episode of Star Trek I have ever seen. Oh my god! All right, so um, in this powering ship, I'm fine with that. Um, sure. <laughs> I. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh god! All right. Um, let's see. Um, I do need to go and head up to the emergency switch. We don't need to do anything else here. I think that's upstairs. I would like to think it is. Yeah, we're gonna hit the emergency switch which uh, fixes the bags, so here we go. Oh, I think that's it. I better look at it first just to be sure. Switch. Yeah, there we the go. label says, emergency inflation system. All right, and now we got Edna power, we should be fine. This game is equal measure weird, creepy, and ridiculous. Inflating. All right, so there we go. Um. Oh, uh, now we gotta go back to the, the bridge, of course. We gotta use the bridge, and the music stopped, but that's okay, I'll just save and start it up again. One of the drawbacks of this game, but that's fine. Boom. Everything's fine. Um... Where am I going? Uh... You... You... Oh... Ugh. No, I don't need to use anything. Walk to... No, not the stairs. Oh god, I hate this area here. Here we go. Corridor. Corridor. Fucking... All I had to do was just redesign that ever so slightly and I would have been fine. It's locked. What? Again? You just opened it. Alright, fine. Use Edna's key. Open the door. Ugh, there we go. So now, um... Oh god, um... I think we just pushed the lever. Hang on, there's a switch. I think I'm using that. 
if I remember. Yes, there we go. Blip. And we take to the skies again. All is fine. Oh my god. I don't know about this storm, though. Oh, the humanity! We're taking off. We're taking off. Alright. So now we're going to head upstairs again. Oh my god, it's Final Fantasy time. Da, 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 da. Oh my god. Oh, um, uh, yeah, i got to head back up top. Back where I found my heart previously. It's no longer guiding the ship. We need a guidance system, you know. Alright, let's walk to the stairs. And let's walk to the, the... Walk to the tear. The stairs and the tear. Oh, I have to actually use it, of course, every time. Alright, here we are. Hey, Jackal. How you going? Yes. Alright, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Use the gun with the honky tonk. Fuck your honky tonk. I am power. <laughs> and now I'm in white mode, which means we've done everything right. Fuck your honky tonk. <laughs> oh, now I'm back to reality again. Reality sucks. Yes. Who among you shall go next? So there you have it. There's Gorister's scenario all done and dusted. Um, who do I want to pick next? I don't know, to be honest with you. Um, here. I could just do them in order. It really doesn't matter if you. It, yeah, essentially the order doesn't matter. I'm just my my modus operandi here is just go for the character that's uh probably the least painful to get through. Um, which means I might, I might leave uh, Ted for last because his scenario is kind of, it's fairly short, fairly simple. Actually, so is Nimdox as well, so uh, well, you know, I might as well save here. And I'm going to save in a new uh, spot, of course, because fuck everything in this game. There we go. It's one of them Sierra games. You'll get stuck regularly. Um, yeah, I might as well just go with Alan. Why not? Alan's a decent character. You know, I'd give you like a 3 out of 10, maybe, I don't know. Well, I know, I'm a fucking Allied Master Computer, fuck you. <laughs> You're my favourite. Oh my god, I thought Benny was your favourite. Don't start to play favourites now, Am. mentions this is because Alan is actually a uh, computer uh, scientist so essentially she's she's well equipped to dealing with them um, it's a good it's a good pick I'd say oh my god she knows how to computer proper she knows all the hot keys the god of this heavenly place I know you've come to I mean it is a pretty spiffy place traveling down the cathode ray tubes and everything if you want me to kill you, I will. Mother ugly machine. Mission worth undertaking. <laughs> so it brings me here, junkyard, electronic pyramid nowhere, and yellow. Oh. Oh, it's yellow. Why does yellow make me sweat? Why does yellow? I don't know. I don't want to know. One too many gold showers gone wrong. And oh my god, let's go to the pyramid. Oh my goodness. Why here and now? Suspended door. Oh. Wide open up there. So, so Ellen has this really weird way of talking as well. She drops a lot of these really strange, really strange uh, words here and there that I don't think I've ever heard before in life ever. Oh, and I haven't read the thing yet. Hang on, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. My, I'm gonna read my psych profile. Psychological framework. Hysteria is a condition in which psychological conflict is turned into physical symptoms such as paralysis or running away from a situation. Lord knows I'm good at doing that. Alright, but we're going to load that because we cheated and used the psych profile. Oh my goodness. Junk. It's made of crap. <laughs> it's made the of crap. The sucker needs intensive therapy. Oh my god. You are absolutely right. But oh well, let's go to the door. And then use the door. Snap, crack, or pop. Must be a glitch in the circuitry. This is one of my eggs. Oh. Well, we don't have any eggs here. 
So, of course, Ellen is is our um, wisecracking uh, specialist of the game. I mean, if that makes any sense. Ooh, try to swallow some water. Why not? I knew it. You son of a bitch, Am. You <laughs> fixed it so I can barely touch the water with my fingertips. God damn it. You electrified the water and all that shit. To the inevitable oh my god. Am, um, I think you're a little bit self indulging with, with this place. I mean, I know you're a robot and all, but my god. Question. Yeah, well, I'm just gonna have a look around some more. This is a, a cyber it's cyberpunk very pyramid. Just like the monitors of the security station at Inside Engineering. Inside Hated Engineering, it. oh my god. Hated now. Green just damn yellow. Just damn yellow. So Ellen hates yellow. I wonder why. We'll find out later. It's it's not golden shower related, oddly enough. So what are you gonna? Um, all right. Ooh, I guess I'll have a look at some monitors. Why not? Oh, uh, look at monitor thingies. What do we got here? Each of these video monitors has a two-channel selector switch. Two-channel selector switch. Oh, and to look at the monitor, you have to use the monitor, which makes sense to me. What the hell am I looking at? Could this be one of Anne's original components? Looks like something out of Blade Runner, so I'd say quite possibly. <laughs> when did this game come out again? I can't remember. An Egyptian burial chamber? Oh, Anne, you little dickens. As an interior decorator, kiddo, <laughs> don't give up your day job. You're not terribly original, Am. Jesus Christ, why don't you make something for yourself for once? The Holy Grail. <laughs> and we only had to wipe out the entire human race and fall into the center of the world to find it. Hooray! Jesus wept. <laughs> Someone kicked him in the shin, he just wasn't having a good time. Good old G's. Alright. What else have we got? We got all these things. I like things. Sure, baby. Show me where I just been. <laughs> Show me the water I can't get to. I with do my not bare remember hands. this woman's story. I have erased it from my memory. <laughs> Uh, probably for the best. Oh my god. And what's this? Oh, the outside. Yeah, okay, outside. Now what? Now what? Jeebus Christ. Alright, let's just have a look around some passageways. No, I can't stay here. I gotta get out. <laughs> look at that evil sphinx motherfucker. That thing. Like a bad meal come to life. And all the and yellow. yellow. Why is everything so damned yellow? And why does it terrify me so... Paralyze me so. I hate yellow so much. I got attacked by a banana. Oh my goodness. All right. Oh yes, and we got two button switches. Hang on. Where's where's the switch? I know there's a switch on these things. Hang on. What my? Uh, I think you have to push them. I'm not sure. Push the button. Click. There we go. And what do we got now? Oh. Someone's watching me from one of the windows. Oh. Where is this? What am I seeing? How far away? It's a nice gothic castle. I Anne like it. Is bigger than I like to think, more powerful than I want to admit. Can I be in the castle? Oh man! All right. Well, I'll just uh, push all the buttons. Why not? Oh. Something about this image breaks my heart. So, as it happens, we're looking at some places we'll see later on. These are places that the other people will go to. What's this? There's, there's the honky tonk. It's right there. Dustbowl, dead dog, roadside saloon. <laughs> So, uh, Ellen is quite thirsty. I mean, all these people are just kind of depri uh, deprived of anything, even remotely. Oh, what's this? Oh, Take secret shit. Ooh, a secret passage. Secret oh, passage. Now, why didn't you let me see that when I was there before, Am, you rat bastard? You rat bastard. So we found a little secret passage, which is really handy. All I had to do was push a button. You're making this too easy for me, Am. Boop. What's this? Ooh. Ovens. But not bread baking ovens. Oh, no, bacon. it's... Dirty. If you're trying to scare me, and they're Nazi you're people a ovens. Of oh my god, so Nimdok is going to check out that area later on, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to some crazy Nazi stuff. Oh my god. All right, let's keep going. I think we're, we're now that we've found a little secret area here. Well, you're going to have to go much. You're going to have to go a bit further before you can drink. I can tell you that much. Well, hang on. Let's have a look at this. Use electronic bricks. There's a little secrety thing. There's supposed to be a secret door here. Or is Am just jerking me around again? Stop yanking my chains. There's a secret door here. Or is Am 
just for some reason that played twice. Um, all right, let's have a look around. There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something here. I've gone and forgotten this already, so walk through away. Um, do 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 do. Uh, oh, okay. Now I just did the. I, I used the wrong verb. Sorry, I used the wrong verb. I'm supposed to push the fucking thing. Okay, push the electronic bricks. There we go. Don't use them. Push them. That's completely different. Or is Am just jerking me around again? Yeah, that didn't work. Strange. Maybe I have to. I don't know. Ooh, hang on, I remember now. Hang on, I forgot to repair the wires. Hang on. Hang on, look at- I'm pretty sure this is it. These wires... Looks like they're hot. But I can actually repair them, so it's all fine. Thank goodness I was an electrical engineer. I managed to join the wires without frying myself. Or burning my hands off. That's great. So, I think that fixes the problem. We'll find out. Okay, let's push some bricks. Here we go. Electronic bricks. Boom! Oh, sure. But hey, we did good, so we're slightly away from black now. We're heading towards this green. This is what I saw on the monitor, right underneath me. Oh, oh what a surprise! All styling and yellow, as usual. I hate yellow so much. I'm just gonna make sassy remarks about how bad yellow is. Schematics I can read, blueprints I can read, but hieroglyphics? No way, baby. Oh, I was hoping you could. It'll make time. everything so much easier. <laughs> what is it about Egyptian Egyptian decor that's killing me right now? Like being put in the coffin while you're still alive. Huh. So you're a little claustrophobic, I see. She always looks so concerned, like, oh, oh god. I don't like this place at all. Huh. It's pretty tame, I like this place myself. It's cool, it's got hieroglyphics and all these things. Oh, a keypad? Huh? All right. Well, at any rate, I'm just going to carry on. Musty and yellow for a change. It's no wonder they can't rent this place. Everything's all different here now. It's it's more yellow than ever. All right. Uh oh, what's this on the ground? It's yellow. This this yellow cloth. Help! I'm going to take it though. I'm going to try to. Here we go. Oh, do you really hate yellow, don't you? I feel so ashamed. Oh, you'll be fine. Just try it again. And that's actually the solution. You just try it again. Got to face the yellow. I must face the yellow. I don't even want to know what that means. Oh, God. This is... Why? This is the thing. Oh, we've also got an Armatron thingy. Waldos? I like Waldo. He keeps going missing all the time. What's this here? We got oh forceps. All right, I'll take them. Why not? Yeah, yeah. I'll try to. There we go. So I've got some forceps. Um, all right. Uh, which will actually really help us. I think I if I can head off now, that'd be great. And now the music stopped looping, so I got to reset that again. Woo! Oh shit! No, hang on. Load. Load. There we go. There. See, that's how you fix music in old games. Usually, just load old saves. It works surprisingly well. Alright, um... Do, 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 do. Oh, I know where I'm... Yeah, okay, so now we got this. We can use this as a makeshift blindfold. Very handy. So we've got to head all the way back. Remember where we found the Holy Grail? There's so much... There's so much yellow there, but you know what? With that... With that fucking blindfold, we'll be fine. Alright, but first we've got to use it. Use that thing. It may be yellow. It may be yellow, but I can't see the yellow, so it's all good. It's all good, I'm fine. Alright, now we... Oh. <laughs> oh no, he's still there. He's, he's still hanging out. He's... Alright, let's grab that cup. I'm just gonna walk through you, Sphinx. <laughs> no, lady, I'm just... I'm right here. What, what do you mean? What do you do with it? Isn't it obvious? Go get a fucking drink! Come on! I know you're thirsty. Here we go. I need... Oh, of course! See, she's figuring it out so we don't have to. It's great. Of course. I'm gonna use that cup. 
There we go. Use the cup. Grab the water. Yeah, right. You're moron. <laughs> oh, I completely forgot. Hang on. Um, I, how do I take it off? I'll just use it again, I guess. You're blindfolded. How the hell did you even walk here then? You walk through the entire game. Somehow you manage. Oh, well, there we go. Cup. Oh, shit. Use cup with the. Uh, uh, use the cup with the water. There we go. Just reaches. Good thing there's not too much yeah. pixel hunting in this game. I'd hate that. All right. Now swallow. Swallow that cup of water. Now you'll live forever. Hooray! That's great. That's champagne I ever had. I need another. All right. If you say so. I don't think it's a good idea to just consume anything in Am's Nightmare World. Just reaches. Now I can get a drink. All right. So fill and uh, oh, and I I just need another drink. I'll be fine. Blup, blup. I'm gonna take one for the road. You never know when you need a chalice full of water. Why not? All right, here we go. Just reaches. Now I can get a drink. All right. So there we go. Uh, we're gonna head back to that passageway because now we can fuck around with some things. I kind of I jumped ahead a little bit because what you're supposed to do first is actually try using the forceps on this fucker here to get his chip out. Doggy face here could use a good trimming. But forceps ain't the right tool to use on stone. No. At least I think it's stone. You think it is, but this is what we're going to do. We're going to use this here cup of water and fuck him up. Got... Oh, fuck! Hooray! And that's worthy of celebration, I guess? I, I did good. All right, here we go. What do we got? Come to Mama Ellen, little rom chip. <laughs> Give me a little yeah, rom chip. All right. Easy. Must be reprogrammable. Ooh, well, I hope it is. Holy shit. So we got a rom chip. Uh, holy shit. So now, th oh, I don't think we have to do anything else with them. We'll just leave him dead right here for the time being. Um, um, let's see. Oh, hang on. I, I think I fucked this up already. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh. I don't think I was supposed to destroy him and then get the chip first. I seem to remember talking to him. Or, hang on, I'll try talking to him first. So, how's the family? Read any good papyrus lately? You doity rat. <laughs> you, I'm gonna give it to you the way I give it to my sister. Watch it, statue baby. <laughs> You'll go horse. Well, at least you're in good spirits about the whole thing. All right. Um, I think I might have fucked this up already. Um. You're supposed to be able to talk to him, aren't you? Hang on, I'm trying to push him around a bit. It's too heavy. Oh. I, I, I recall having to... Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's, let's push some buttons on this. Maybe this does it. Oh, there we go. Whoa. Okay, well, now I know you actually talk. Who the fuck are you? I am Anubis, guardian of the dead. Well, I mean, naturally, of course. Why won't you let me use the keypad? I want to put in funny... I want to put boob on the keypad. Input boob, that is the code. Or 8008. I'm not a grave robber, I just want to type boob on a keypad. For lols. Well, I mean, I, I, if I could. If I could nick something, that'd be great. Just just need to know if you can if you tell me where Anne's original brain components are. I just want to break the place, it's fine. I want to destroy the place, not steal anything. I want to take it away. Oh. Oh. Well, <laughs> who's sealed up in the scary sarcophagus then? Who's sealed up in the scary sarcophagus? A terror that even in its entombment torments your soul. Ooh, well then I have to get inside. You'll never get laid with that line of stuff. You'll never get laid with that line of stuff, Anubis. Take care of your own born self. I don't I even have a penis. Leave me alone. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna fuck him up. Now is when we're gonna take your thing away. Then we go, piss off. That's how you do it. All right, holy shit. All right, um. Now that I do that, I can grab his little chip. See, now we've done it properly. Come to Mama Ellen, little rom chip. Alrighty. Yeah, it comes out easy. Must be reprogrammable. 
Alrighty, and now because I have my... I have my, uh, uh my, uh, blindfold, of course. We can actually go into the next room, because we didn't actually go to this room before. This could go on for centuries. <laughs> so much yellow everywhere. M has all the time in the world. All the world in the world, as a matter of fact. All the world in the world. we never age. We never die. We just truck around day after month after year, don't we, Am, you son of a bitch? Demented god, you! <laughs> that was... Oddly specific, but oh my god, there's so much yellow in here. I'm going to have to use the blindfold. All right. Hello there. I can't look at anything, but I can look at. I can't see a damn thing through this blindfold. Well, that's the idea. Um, I'm gonna take that gem from his chest. So look at this thing. I can't see it. I can't see it. Why can't you see it? Just, no, just just take the gem. There we go. Uh, uh. -huh. There we go. This sapphire's loose. The sapphire's loose. All right. Fantastic. So now at least I can kind of. I kind of see where I'm going. Oh, bleh. But I just got a blindfold on me. That's not the best time. Um, alright. So I'm going to head over to the passage. See what we can do. Everything seems to be fine. Oh, look. we got these computer thingies here. Workstations. This one's missing a gem. So you know what? I'm going to pop that right in the little receptacle there. Yeah, right. You're blindfolded, <laughs> Oh, of course. I need to take the blindfold off first. We can't do anything like that with the fucking blindfold on. Even though you've been walking around. No, you're fine. Click. Excellent. Ellen, you were you were just strange. You were the strangest thing. All right. Um, and now, of course, we're going to use that ship with the four steps, and we're just going to pop it in the workstation. Click. The yellow ROM chip fits into the socket perfectly. All right. Here now we can use a computer, and it's time to get some MySpace going. I'll designate you a new master, sucker. Me! I'll designate you a new master, sucker. Me! Hooray! Alright, so we're reprogramming the chip. Alright, and now we got to use the four sips and get it out again. Haven't lost my touch. <laughs> Pull out the ROM chip without bending any of the contacts. This is going to be fun. This is going to be great. I'm going to have Anubis just sort of break dance in front of me. It's going to be the funnest of fun times. Ooh, okay, I might need to use this again. She must hate yellow because it, it's the colour her parents painted her room because they're hipsters who do not believe in genderifying their children. You know what? I'm I'm willing to accept that that's, that's a, a possibility. I really am. Oh my god, we haven't seen this room yet. What's in here? Oh. oh no. I remember it was... Oh god. Oh god, it hurts. No. It hurts. What yellow. is it? There was a yellow... A yellow? A yellow what? In. I couldn't breathe in the pain. Get me out of here! Oh dear. Even the blindfold oh, doesn't panic work. Attack. I feel so ashamed. Oh my Something god. Something about that room terrifies me. Even with the blindfold on. Even though I can't see the room that I'm in, it, it terrifies me. That makes no sense to me at all. Oh my god. And of course the music stops, so I have to fix that. Uh, oh, good. Alright, uh, I think I can take it off now. There we go. We'll be fine. We'll get through this. See, so we got the, the fine music because we're doing okay ish. Alright, so now that we've reprogrammed the chip, let's pop it into Mr. Anubis here and have a little chat with him. Back where you belong, little ROM chip. I am alive again. Hello. Alright. With a mischievous grin, we've done it. The statue is ours. Talk to him. Oh, so, can you help me with anything? So? Can you help me with anything? You cannot escape your fears. Oh. You can only confront them. Okay. Sh sh sure. Then, uh, I, I will confront them then. Nice chatting with you, Anubis, honey. <laughs> you are such a noob, Anubis. I don't like you at all. Um, alright. Wasn't he supposed to do something? Hang on, let me just push some buttons on this pad. You'll let me use it now, right? There we go. Push random numbers. This security keypad could have been set to any one of millions of possible combinations. Just hit them all, why not? Oh my god! Fun! Fun! Public! Gobble the power pellet! Thank you very much for the follow. We greatly appreciate that. That's the finest of fine things. Oh my goodness. Uh, random numbers didn't work. Let's see. Type 2006, the year that you were hired at Ingsai Engineering. I remember when my only concern was being on the fast track to becoming a $250,000 a year executive. 
Oh, them's were the days. Nothing's happening. 2001, the year you graduated from Stanford. I used to be so proud of graduating mm. Ugh, tastes like old dust. <laughs> so many power pellets taste like dust. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. God damn it. Alright, now I've completely forgotten. Oh, Maria, you obey me now. So? Password. Can you help me with anything? Oh, I think I've encountered that fucking bug. Holy shit. Hang on, maybe I can load. Because I've already reprogrammed you. Oh shit, I may have encountered that, that bug. I haven't put the disc, uh, that in yet. Hang on, I might be able to fix this. I might be able to fix this. Oh my god. But I may have fucked this up already. Because this game's weird like that. you you got to put the code in, at least try to put the code in first. So hang on, I'm going to try this again. I'm going to try this again. I'm going to go blip. Okay, and let's just reprogram this again. Back to what it was before. Uh, you serve humanity. Because why not? Sure. All right, chip reprogrammed. I'm gonna grab you. Haven't lost my touch. I don't want to have to restart this again. I always get stuck on this one bit because I, I always forget to to check the thing. Hang on. Oh, walk to the passageway. Um, hang on. I didn't save for. Oh no, I did. I saved fairly recently. So fuck. Fuck, Sierra style games kicking me in the ass every time. Uh, well, um, all right, let's try this again. Uh, you serve humanity now, I guess. Click. Back where you belong, little Rom Chip. There we go. And now I'm gonna try coding things. There we go. You serve humanity now. I remember when I... Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. What about I this one? Be... Nothing's happening. You no. Know, try random numbers. You never know. This security key. Nothing's happening. I wonder if I wonder if anyone has managed to get the random numbers to work. I don't think so, but oh well. Hello. So? You can No, I think I fucked this up, so hang on. Um Oh shit, that means I have to go all the way back to ST1. Oh god, I need Okay, I've learnt my lesson now, I've gotta need separate saves. So fuck you, Ellen, you failed again. Alright. So, uh what was I up to here? I'll just skip through everything. Um well I don't have my I don't have my mother-in-law in my inventory, so I should be fine there. Off to the stairs I go. Um, I think I'm... Am I ready to... Hang on. Oh. The airbags are already in... Oh, so I've already done that. Okay. Good thing I saved it right at the end. That was really handy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So we don't have to go too far back. But my god, that is a pain in the ass. Um, use the key. Do. Oh, jeez. Use the thing, pull the switch. There we go. Oh my god. So, I know why I fucked up. You don't actually get the option unless you already try the keypad before fucking him up. Which is really annoying. I really hate that. I hate that that's a thing. Alright, walk to the door. Hey, at least you did really good here. See, that's why I wanted to start with Garastar. I really should have started with Ellen because that's, that's that one fucking thing. Benny's also got a glitch, which I really hate as well. Hopefully I don't run into that today. Uh... Do I go upstairs? Oh wait, where the fuck am I going? I've forgotten how to I go upstairs. Oh my god. Love those pre-rendered cinematics. They're the best thing. They are the best thing. All pixely and great. Oh my god. Hello. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Shoot the shit out of that place. Yeah. Yes, I have the power. I'm going to end your satellite transmissions. I love how it's just a crappy little flare gun. Oh my goodness. All right, so we have to restart again, but that's fine. That's why you want to save in separate slots all the time. Oh my god, so I'm going to I'm going to try that keypad as early as I can. Probably the best idea. Who among you shall go next? Who shall go next? Oh, don't let me down this time, Alan. I swear to god. Alright, but at least I can skip dialogue. If you couldn't do that, I'd be in a lot of trouble. Do, do, do. Hey. Mother ugly machine. Mission worth undertaking. Jesus so Christ, it's like being in Midgar all over again. Alright. Let's see. Pyramid things. I think I've... It's I don't need, I don't it's think fast. I need to look at any of these things, but I'll look at them anyway, because why not? Alright, use the door. Snap that the clock. Must be a glitch in the circuitry. Sure. Alright, um, oh jeez. I'm gonna use the water because I can. I knew it! 
Alright, now I just gotta remember everything that, um, I hit the switch, hit the thing, so at least I'll be able to speed through this, because I already know everything. But my god, Very that, that fucking keypad. Like I had a feeling that would trip me up. Even though I remember it every time, I'm like, okay, be careful, because that thing, it's gonna trip you up. And why do you know it fucking does? I'm gonna save over this one, because my god. All right, all good. Um, okay, so fix the wires. I'm not even going to bother looking at the screens now. Thank goodness I was an electrical engineer. I managed to join the wires without frying myself. Alrighty, and I'm going to push the button. There we go. I think it. No, no, that's the castle. Someone's watching me from one uh, of the windows. Oh no, I don't get to skip this dialogue. Where is yeah. this? What am I seeing? Oh, it's How fine. Far away? It's fine. Am is bigger than. Wouldn't it be great if you just walked in on Am and he's just like the size of a gnat? It's like, no, uh, don't look at me, I'm, I'm uh, mighty and all that shit. Oh, fuck. Alright. No, that's the honky tonk. God damn it. It's the best of best saloons. It's the one to the right. I know that now. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the worst thing. Here we go. You, oh, I mean, push. Push the button. Push the button. There we go. And then we got the secret passage. Hit the lottery! Ooh, a secret passage. Oh my. Oh my oh, why goodness. Why didn't you let me see that when I was there before, Am, you rat bastard? Alright, so I sorted that out. Um. Do, 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 do. Um. Let's push the button. And I think we're doing okay so far. Hopefully, I haven't fucked anything up. I know how much I don't want to go down there. Right. Another thing we go. This is what I so this time I'm going to do it nice and early. I'm going to save here and I'm going to... Maybe just save in separate slots like I said I was going to do, but I never do that. Um, alright. I'm going to look at things, because I can. Schematics Shoulder pads, can... hair scrunchy. Blueprint. This game could, could, cannot be that old. It has to come. No it had to have come out in the mid-90s. Which it did, but <laughs> still, I mean, they're there. They've got to be there. To be fair, we've been here for 109 years, so this is more postmodern than postmodern goes, I guess. Oh my goodness. Hey there, buddy. I read this papyrus once. It was a laugh riot. Oh. Uh, Alright, so now I'm gonna push some buttons and then. Don't push buttons on my console, please. So, um. Why can't I use it? See, this is where I'm really fucking confused. I, I'll, I'll try talking to you now. Who are you? 95 is when this came out. Holy shit. On MS-DOS. But I'm playing the Scum VM version of it, so it's it's slightly better. Only ever so slightly. Why won't you let me use the keypad? I must protect this tomb from all I'm not gonna rob the tomb. Don't be ridiculous. I Do I look like Lara Croft to you? Yeah, I see, I, I, that, that kind of ended that discussion. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Hmm. What am I supposed to do? I think I'm supposed to fuck him up, then use the keypad, then awaken him. I think that's what I'm supposed to Yeah, that's, that's where the game glitches out. It's very odd like that. No one oh, I guess I'll save here, because I haven't done anything that could potentially fuck me up just yet. Alright, take the thingy. Uh... Since you don't like yellow that much. No. Nope. Uh, uh. Oh, another pad. There we go. Alright, hopefully I figured this out now. And now the music stopped again. Fucking hell. There we go. So that's the one thing the uh I, I don't know if this is in all versions of the game, but oh my god. At the very least the scum VM version will do this, and it's annoying. Am I familiar with Wadjet Eye games? I I am not. I should be. By the sound of it, I should be. Oh my god. Uh, pixel hunting. There we go. To face the yellow. I've got to face the yellow. The, the urine and everything. It's just the worst thing. I'll also take the forceps, because why not? And now I'll also have to walk to the door. Go and get the thing. Have I looked at everything yet? Yes, I have. I've looked at everything in here, at least. After all these years of being here, I'll never stop being thirsty. See, I honestly thought her fear of yellow was a, a golden shower gone wrong until I'm like, Oh, that's what you mean by yellow. I can't stay here. I can't. Uh, 
I forgot to put the blindfold on. All right, here we go. All good. Use the blindfold. All right, there we go. Let's make our way through here and grab that goblet of fire. Harry, did you put your name in the goblet of fire? Uh, no, Dumbledore. Apparently he was supposed to be a bit more compassionate when he asked him that, instead of being angry and fucking enraged like he was in the film. Harry, did you put your name in the goblet of fire? Uh, yes. No, I mean no. Oh, shit. Shit. No, I, I didn't. Well, who did then? Oh, wait, I did. That's right, I remember. I had a bet going on. Alrighty, so now I've got the Goblet of Fire and I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it with some water. I mean, you know, I could I could do anything with this. I'm just going to get a drink. Alrighty, I'm going to swallow. The swallow um, command doesn't really get used very often in this game, but I'm glad it's in there. Use that cup with the water. Oh, God. An empty cup won't do me much good. I, I know, yeah. that's why I'm trying to fill it with water. At last. No, no, come on. Use water. Oh boy. Sometimes this interface is like a fucking workout. Alright, here we go. You swallow the water. There we go, and now we're just gonna use it one more time, fill it up. And then I think we fucking Uber so over now. Now I can get drink. You don't need to drink anymore, good god. What's wrong? Do you have diabetes? Oh god, I checked the thing. He looked at the psych profile and that's cheating. Oh god. So I have to load that up again. Oh my god. When a path of very low resistance in a circuit is open, such as by accident, the electric current becomes very high and can cause damage. This is known as a short circuit. So it's told me that because that's what you use to cheat in this game. If you ever need a hint. But god, that means we have to go through- Oh, oh my god, I lost everything. Oh my god, that was the last time I saved? Oh, Jesus. Ellen, your scenario is becoming the worst thing in since sliced bread. I hate it. Oh my god. Well, bye, Anubis. I fucked up again. How many times is that gonna happen today? Take the thing. Oh my god. Oh, you can grab it now. That's good. Uh, take the thing. No, not the armatron. Grab the forceps. There we go. Jesus Christ, I feel like I have to save in a new slot every 10 seconds in this game now. Here we go. Save the thing. So you're doing fine. You're doing all right. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Baby steps, baby steps. We're getting there. We're getting there. Here we go. Oh, I didn't put the blindfold on. I keep fucking forgetting. There we go. Why is everything? Wow, who would have thought this would end up being the worst scenario for me today? And I thought Benny would cause the most problems because he's got some weird glitch in it and I hope I don't encounter it today. Once we're done with Benny though, it's smooth sailing because Nimdox is pretty straightforward as is Ted's. Oh my god. Alright, we're doing fine. We're doing okay. Just take that fucking blindfold off. Oh jeez. This really is exhausting. It's, it's ridiculous. Alright, uh, you can't get the water. This time, don't fuck it up. Just reaches. There we go. Swallow the water. Blub, blub. I love those old sound effects, that's great. Blub, blub. Just. There we go, swallow the other one. Whip, 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 whip. Sounds like Tomba 2 all over again. Just reaches. There we go, alright. Um, off to where we were before. Secret passage. Glub, glub, glub. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. Alright, uh... See, now I've done what I wanted to do from day one. Um... I don't even remember how I fucked up last time. Alright, use the panel. Stand clear. Do not touch the panel, please. Alright, um... So, I'm good now, I think. I've got the thing, I've got the thing. Uh, use this... There we go. All good. And then... Walk out the door. Okay, here we go. Uh, take the gem. I... But I don't want to reprogram it. That's right, I completely forgot. I don't want to reprogram Oh, and I haven't even got the chip anyway. So I'm going to grab that gem. Here we go. I don't need to use this again anyway. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Alright, and my god, I'm going to save in another one because I don't trust myself anymore. I don't trust this game. Myself? Anyone? Take that game, I saved again. Alright, um... 
Now I'm going to use you. Fuck your Anubis face up. Oh, fuck. Oh, right. And see, this is what I failed to do last time, and that is use this fucking keypad. Push numbers. This security keypad could have been set to any one of mil- Nothing's happening. See, apparently you're supposed to use it now. I remember And then ask him about it once you've reactivated him later. That's so stupid. Nothing's happening. At all. I think we also have to go through all of these. There we go. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure this will fix our problem. Okay, and of course I need to grab his chip, so I'll do that. Come on. There we go. It's smooth sailing once I've gone through this slight little pro uh, problem here. Oh my god, and what a problem it is. Okay, make our way through here. Go to the next car. We never We never age. We always just walk around in the yellow room. It's horrible. Alright, here we go. Um, use the... These Egyptian computers, I swear, they're not even using Windows 7. Okay, and now we use this, this, reprogram. Oh, no, I have to use the thing first. There we go. Oh, we're nearly there. Uh, I'm the master of all things Egyptian, I suppose. Dope. So now, now, oh shit, hang on, oh, I need to get my chip back. There we go, so now it's pro uh, reprogrammed properly, and I think now I can actually ask him about the password. For some reason, that, that was the option that was missing, and I've, it, it's just the worst thing. If you do anything out of order, you fuck yourself up. Which I feel is a, glip, a glitch of some kind. Damn Cleopatros 1.5, <laughs> damn you. Alright, hopefully this works. Here you go. Come to life again, my servant. That's where you belong, there we go. I feel slightly more green now. Uh oh. No, that didn't work either. So, can you help me with anything? You cannot escape your I can only confront them. Okay, so where did I fuck this up? Hang on, push the thing. Keypad. Oh, hang on, so I didn't fuck this up at all? Do I just have to use this? It's locked. It's locked, but um. I went to the t small box. Oh, here we go. Tiny space trapped. Is this is this right though? I think. Hang on. Maybe I just need to try and use it. Oh, here we go. Oh, I didn't need to load all that time. Fuck. Can the sarcophagus lid be opened? Can the sarcophagus lid be opened? I just needed to use it. The lid can be unlocked by entering the there we go. The then give me the code, fuckface. You so serve me access now! The access code <laughs> six, 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 I should have just tried that, just... It figures. It figures. I should have just tried it anyway. Right. Uh, nice chatting with you, nice buddy. With you and you I can't believe it. I didn't fuck this up after all, but I swear there is a glitch where that becomes... Uh, that blocks your progress, so I'm glad now I know everything's fine. Okay, 666 it is. Spoopy code! Oh my god. I really don't have a mouth. Look at my little, uh, my little image there on the top left. I have no mouth, and I must eat some things. Oh my god. Um. All right. So now that I haven't fucked this up, now that I haven't bought this, I'm gonna save over two now because that's fine. Boom. All right. Finally. Let's get inside that. Yeah. Let's get inside that coffin. Um. Do I just? Do I use it? I think I use it. Or walk to. Or look at. I don't know. So confining, I'm going in. Okay, no, talk to, give, push, use, take. What am I doing? Hang on, walk to, maybe it. Walk to the sarcophagus. Oh, maybe I use the door, I don't know. You ain't got no choice, Ellinger. Oh, it's gotta be the way. It's Order 66, you. kill all Jedi. Oh, here we go. Maybe we'll get the answers we're looking for inside here. No way out. Oh shit, and I'm claustrophobic and shit. And a yellow I'm jumpsuit. You have to put the yellow jumpsuit on. It's the only way. Oh my god. Uh, okay, well, let's let's use the console. Let's see. 1978. You were born in Trenton, New Jersey. Joyce. You were a cesarean. 
Your mother died on the operating table. Oh, a sad face. You went to live with your grandparents. <laughs> it's because your father was an alcoholic. 1995. You graduated a year early from high school. You little genius, you. Were the you. of your class. Ten different colleges offered you scholarships. Nothing but high hopes for you. Everything's coming up you. Look at you, fucking Ellen DeGeneres. All right, 1999. You graduated college cum laude. Execute order 54. Go to the donut shop and return to HQ. To I got the wrong order, man. 3.8 grade student. More high hopes. More high hopes. Everything's coming up, Alan. 2001. You your master's. Combined degree in computer science and engineering. <laughs> you had a greater facility with algorithms than with social grace. Well, you know. You have had sex only twice in your life. I mean, did you have to mention that, Mr. Computer? I mean, come on. Come on now. Did you have to go there? Let's not go there. <laughs> you have had sex only twice in your life. And then 9-11 happened. <laughs> I forgot to mention that too. Because this game predates it. I mean, what are you gonna do? He wasn't as smart as you, not as quick as you, not <laughs> as hopeful of doing great things as you. But he was nuts about you, and he treated you like fine wine. It, it was Eddie from Silent Hill 2, and we all know what happened from that point onward. <laughs> 2004, good times. The miscarriage. Breach birth. The child never had a chance. You just have the worst luck when it comes to pregnancy. You were a bad birth, and your mother died, and you can't have a child. You don't want to know what happened to your child. Eddie leaves. He tried. He really tried. But you wouldn't come out of it. Nope. He couldn't say anything He just wanted some pizza in the bowling alley. So he finally left. The divorce was uncontested. You could still smell his tweed jacket in the closet. I still smell his closet every now and then. Oh, man. You had to make a living. You applied at Ingsai Engineering. Your credentials were still good. Hooray. And you made a good impression. <laughs> it's this woman, woman with her, her shoulder pad child. red blazer. She's gonna go awakened. places, let me tell you. All right, and then 2012. Well, wasn't that very long ago. Four years prior. You left your office after working late at the Ingsai Corporate Headquarters building. Oh. The elevator stopped at the seventh floor for a maintenance man. Oh. To your horror... Must be a cause of those miscarriages, restricting hand office hand outfits. It's the, the red blazer, man, I'm telling you. Oh my god! I'm back, Ellen. 2012. Oh, Forget Jesus. the Mayan calendar, it's you him. were raped in an elevator. You had blocked me out of your memory forever. Oh. Except for those inconvenient attacks of hysteria every now and oh, then. Oh, oh, oh my god. Just keep batting your chin like that, you'll be fine. Uh, the yellow. It was you all along. Yellow. Ah, yes. My calling card. <laughs> Always the yellow jacket, the yellow boots. Well, actually, you're wearing black ones, but sure. Gave me access to we just shagged over and over, but no over kids. Such a tragedy. Not <laughs> just yours. It's Pac-Man. He's back from the grave. The, the, the box. Box. So you do remember me getting onto the elevator that night. I, do you yeah. also remember the blood? The screams? Uh, How many hours? I didn't notice was much it? blood. I guess it was the red jacket. I was. Oh my god! It's not possible. No, it's not possible. Poor. Ellen. Oh no. Too proud of your accomplishments to admit you could be so <sighs> overpowered by a slime ball. You like were so me. proud you thought you could you handle any situation, but not right. With the Twenty other women. Oh no. Okay. Ow. She's eating Smarties and right now. It's her coping the mechanism. To be with you forever. I waited in the sarcophagus until oh, you Oh God! Arrived. All right. Um, this What's is this is horrible. Can I go now? To an eternity of torture. Help me! You. All right. Not again. Please, not again. I should have yes, never walked into the sarcophagus. Again. It was a bad idea. And again, and again, and again. I've waited well, so long. I mean, long I guess eventually I'd get used to it, so it wouldn't be too long. It wouldn't be too bad, I in suppose. My tomb, I've grown stronger. Now I may even I learn to love you, creepy yellow janitor ghost club. man. Oh shit. Uh, you can't run away. Uh, give up. Uh, fight back. Don't count on it, you mother. I haven't got a knife or anything, but. Oh, fuck him with the goblet of fire! <laughs> yes! Hooray! I destroyed a rapist with a goblet! Everything is coming up Millhouse! Oh my god.
Oh, that's how you do it, ladies. Forget your rape whistle, forget your mace, just carry a goblet with you. That's how you do it. <laughs> oh, that was thoroughly unpleasant. Okay, so we've done that. It's <laughs> success. <laughs> I'm not even sure if that was success, to be honest with you. Oh my god. Okay, so uh, let's have a look around, I guess. Let's look at some things. Why not? What's this? Am? Oh, components. I've never seen anything like this before. 40 years and now she's confronted her fears of being together. attacked by a janitor in a fucking uh, elevator again. Oh. And now we know what the yellow was all about. It wasn't a golden shower gone wrong. Although, mind you, maybe maybe it ended with a golden shower. So it's like, oh, I hate yellow so much now. Fucking janitor wearing yellow clothes and pissed on me afterwards. I mean, what a fucking asshole. Oh, the logo. Look at that. He likes to brand himself everywhere by the good. Alright, that seems to be everything worth looking at here. Oh! Exit passage! Alright, oh, here we go. Oh! Oh, it's this room again, and I don't seem terribly scared anymore. I've confronted my fears, and this place is not scary no more. I can walk in here. Oh, look at that! That's great, that's the best thing. Oh my god. So now that I've overcome my fears, I don't need to use the blindfold anymore, which is a fucking godsend, let me tell you. Um, I'm going to head back to the computer room, I think. Alright, um, let's see, workstations, I think I want to play with the middle one now. Uh, oh, no, never mind, I'm going to go to the right one, what there we go. Will pushing it do? Just checking that walkthrough, because you can fuck up at any time. Uh, push the thing, use it, use things. Numeric password. Push random numbers. Type 2006, the year that you were hired at Inzai Engineering. 2001, the year you graduated from Stanford. Type 666, the access code given to you by Anubis. Or type 2012, the year you were raped on the elevator. That's gotta be it. Am's gonna make that password for everything now. Alright, um, what the actual fuck is going on here would be a good one, but I guess we'll just ask about all this. Oh sure. <laughs> this is what it's all about. Forget Hillary and Trump. This is where it's this is where it's really at right here. Oh my god. Enabling vast subterranean complexes of computers to wage a global war too complex for humans to oversee. Oh, did that one. All right. Principle of entropy. The principle of entropy holds that all electronic systems must eventually decline into inert junk. This principle is unproved, oh. and previous attempts to accelerate the process have been cataclysmic failures. Oh. Uh, what about this neurobinder I'm hearing everything about? It's all the rage. Access denied. Oh, Security typical. Lockout override by two to one majority. Oh. Accessing schematics. Two oh, so there's a democracy okay, going on. I'm good, but I'm not that good. There's, there's an actual, uh, yeah, it's not just Am, there's someone else in here. I wonder who it is. Computers ever get tired of jerking us around? Oh nasty, man. Nasty Ellen. All right. I'll give you a nudge in the right direction. Hello? These are the schematics for a device that translates binary into human. He sounds just like the jackal. I wonder. Ooh, logic gates. Uh, what do you call this? Those are my favorite things. I call it. Let's see. So we got head Egyptian headdress leads to leads to hey, wait a speaker. Minute, computer. Snake, le there? speaker leads to snake, snake leads to something. Metal Gear, I have no idea, I'm frightened. I can wire this thing together if I can find a speaker somewhere. So, okay. Then what have I got? Okay, so I've got to find a speaker of some kind, I guess. So far, so good. I might as well save, why not? Saving the game, and I've always got ST3 to fall back on if I fuck up too badly. Alright, uh, where am I going? Do, 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 do. Oh, I know, I gotta get some speakers, and I know where to get some of those. In the pile of junk. Why not? Why not, I say? Oh my goodness. I'm glad her, her uh, ex-husband's name is Eddie, because it ties in with next week's Silent Hill 2 stream. So I love it when things tie up together like that. I love it when a plan comes together. Oh, look, there's a speaker. What is this now? Well, in 
fucking take it. Hang on, take the thing, make it your own. All right, one free speaker. Now we're just gonna head back to where we were before. Oh. I am Eddie, the shipboard computer. <laughs> I'm sorry to say this, Alan, but we're gonna be stuck here for some time. Oh my god, uh, we can go to this passage, it's a nice shortcut, don't have to go through the sarcophagus again, because lord knows. Okay, so we want to put the speaker on the little wiring there, and we we'll hopefully be able to talk to people. It's hopefully. I think I can turn the speaker into a pretzel. Yeah, you, you do that. Okay, circuit completed. Now let's see if this is finally translated. Okie dokie. Oh! You've spilled water all over me. Now I'm gonna die of pneumonia. Oh my god, are you am? Are you... Am you am? I mean, like, I kind of am, but no, not really. Uh, sort of. More riddles. Well, you are in an Egyptian tomb, what do you expect? The riddle of the Sphinx awaits you now. Yeah, three supercomputers. So which are you, then? My name is Bob. I was one of the early ones. They didn't come up with a very creative name. Most importantly, you don't hate me. That's great. That's great. I love people who don't hate me. They're not one of the Anne's um, practical jokes. <laughs> if you say so. I'll help you into a coffin. Murmuring trees and oh my god, there's some infighting with these little supercomputers. Can Am overhear us? Can Am overhear us? He can't hear through his water, that's fair enough. They knew I shouldn't have installed a waterfall there for someone to abuse. And I knew I should have installed speakers closer to people's mouths so I can hear them talking. Okay, I can point out some essential components so I can kick it. Yeah, kneecap the shit out of it. Can't hear you over the over the fountain water. Oh no! Just keep cutting off his heads, and I'll just keep going back. All right, uh, any machine can die. Just unplug the sucker. Oh no! That's what I was afraid of. I will be around for all eternity. No mayonnaise for you. <sighs> why does Am hold? Oh, uh, uh, why does Am hold out this this chat? Oh yeah, the audio's gonna drown me out a fair bit. But don't worry, we'll be out of this fucking computer room very soon. <laughs> if it was any quieter, we wouldn't be able to hear any of the dialogue, unfortunately. But oh well. It's a quadriplegic? Hey, come on, don't be ableist now, water man. It can fume and scream, but it doesn't have a mouth to scream out of. Title drop. Can you, can you help me to die, please? Please help me to drop dead and not have to come back here. Oh, so can you help me with anything? We're not going to be that defeatist. Oh, I could have overlooked hey, anything. Computer innocence, whoever you are, I need to talk to you. Hello. Don't you computers ever get tired of jerking us around? <sighs> oh well, we tried. We really tried. Um. All right. So there we go. Now we got the. Oh. Uh. Now look at this. Can't put my. Can't put my. Something's changed. Look at that! He's got a the compact disc on his chest, and the music stops. So I've got to fix that. Hang on. Beep, 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 beep. Loading a save game. There we go. There's something wrong here. Can't put my finger on it though. That's okay. All you have to do is just take the disc, and no one will be the wiser. There we go. What have I got here? Chaos Trebler. What the fuck is that? No, all right. Well, never mind. Uh, let's just head back to the workstation. That's where I put the things there. Here we go. Um, okay. Use this. I think we use this with the right computer, but I'm not entirely sure. 
I better check this just to be sure. Hang on. Um. Into the middle one. Oh, that would make sense. Now we're using the middle one. All right. In the future, we still use CD-ROMs. Now let's fire this fucker up. Accessing CD-ROM. Nickelback is now available for your listening pleasure. No! Armageddon soft rot. Warning: This computer system does not meet the minimum configuration. Warning: Chad Kroger is now going to play momentarily. Look at this graph. No. <laughs> I don't want it, and I don't ever. I don't need it. I just don't want it in my life. Uh, all right. Uh, do, 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 um, select, activate. Do I want to activate this thing? I've forgotten. I guess I do. Boom. All right. Select, proceed. I guess. Chaos traveler activated. All right. Shut down, in progress. shut down in progress. I've done things. Shutting down. Up. Oh, Up. Oh, oh god, now I'm locked in. Well, that's not good. Alright. Well, I did that, I suppose. Sure. Oh, now I'm trapped in here forever and ever and ever and ever. Chronic playback of Nickelback sequence complete. <laughs> you need more Nickelback. Enjoy. Enjoy it, young lady. Oh! Oh, that is not good. That is not good for my soul at all. Uh, but we did pretty good. I think we're right at the end of all things. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. I think we just have to talk to Anubis one last time. Here we go, and we can finally move on to someone else. Oh my goodness. Hello. I'm sealed in, Anubis. Help! I'm sealed in, Anubis. Any ideas about how Be I can check out Be a bro and open the hotel? door with your Inside staff. The sarcophagus. Oh. Oh, I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, okay, sure. I guess I'll use the sarcophagus again. I just, I don't want to be raped again. So I don't want to, I don't want to have to put up with rape. In we go. Enough of this turgid passion play. Enough. There's no more to accomplish here. You, you done fucked up. You got over your fear of tight spaces and yellow jumpsuit wearing rapists, so no, this isn't fun anymore. Ooh, we, we found a subsystem here. What could that mean? <laughs> Go back to the, the machine with you. Who shall be next? Well, we might as well just keep going in chronological order from left to right. It's Benny time! No! No! Benny! You say everyone's your favourite. Come on now. My ears try to escape my head there, looking for drain cleaner. <laughs> You're gonna need a bit more than that. Maybe some kerosene and light a match. Look at this flame in my ear. Oh. So, Benny is uh, a hungry guy. He's just so hungry. The cavern isn't like any of the others Am has sent me to. It's full of life, not death. Ooh, let's explore. Look at this lovely place. Ow, fuck. Am, you son of a bitch. You've cleared my mind, but crippled my legs. <laughs> I can barely walk. Oh, Benny, you just got the raw deal of everything in this game. I guess I'll save over three now. There we go. SD3 is saved. Boom. Ready to go. Oh my goodness. Alright, so it's been a long time since- Benny is pretty straightforward, but- And also f fairly short, but there's a glitch, so... I'm gonna use the walkthrough quite liberally to make sure I don't fuck up anywhere. Uh, do 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 Oh, of course, I'm just gonna look at the- There we go. No, walk, walk to the caves. Go on. I haven't eaten for months. The smell of food cooking nearby only makes it hurt worse. <laughs> I'm in so much pain. Alright, well let's just have a look around, why not? Impressive. Someone important must live here. Oh. Hello. How how are you? I'm gonna I'm gonna have a chat with you. Uh, hi? Wita Fuma Piba. Oh typical. I can't understand his language, but he seems to be welcoming me to the village. God damn it, speak American! Ah oh, well. Uh, what about this here? There's a vid screen. Hey! Ignore 
for the newcomer. Oh. Gather the villagers at the altar tomorrow to choose a sacrifice. I have spoken. <laughs> I have spoken. Leave the monkey man to his fate. Oh my god. Alright. Of all the characters, I think Benny has the rawest deal. I mean, he hasn't got any functioning legs. He looks like a fucking monkey man. His face is all cracked. He looks like the thing. Benny looks like the thing, as I suppose he should. And it just gets worse for him. This reminds me of a Star Trek episode. Oh, tree. oh and so it should. It's been years since I've tasted real fruit. Hooray! Pam once coaxed me into marching across a thousand miles of ice to reach a stockpile of canned peaches. Only to discover that he didn't give me a can opener. <laughs> You're such a sucker. Alright, hang on. Uh, let's take the fruit. Here, there's fruit. Yum. Alright. Now I can actually eat something. Hurts! Hurts! But, but, oh no, it's full of razor blades. God damn it. Hi, tree. There's so much fruit growing on this tree. Oh my god, it's such, it's an HR Geiger tree. Look at how fucking weird this thing is. Oh god. I really do have to stream Dark Seed at some point. God, that game's weird. Uh, alright, so that didn't work. Let's go back and try again. Yeah. See, a new fruit is there. That's, that's really handy. Blop. Alright. But I can't eat it though because it'll just fucking kill me. I guess there's that. Do do do. And now this time we're gonna enter this cave here. Hello. This looks like a. What did they used to call them? Single parent household. Probably depend upon the generosity of the rest <laughs> of the village. Friggin' welfare parasites. Welfare oh, parasites. All right. Well, let's have a look at these this people. This woman looks half starved, just like her son. Oh my Bad god. Chance of getting a decent meal out of either of them. Oh, <laughs> I, I could eat their corpses. The boy's a friggin' mutant. There's a third arm growing out of his back. <laughs> Benny, you're kind of an asshole. That's the thing about him, he's a bit of a dickhead. I'm gonna give him some fruit, why not? Enjoy. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, thank you for food. You're welcome, Am Terminal. I am very hungry. Where can I get some food? Every time I eat there a fruit, fruit, it turns fruit into cake. razor blades. It comes from the trees. Huh. I tried eating the fruit. It only made me sick. It only you tore me up inside. Meat. When I was young and not so different, my mother chewed it for me first and then fed me. Oh, like a bird. That's handy. You look like you don't eat very much. He uses the third mother arm to punch chodes like this guy in the face. That's why, that's why he's got a cracked face. He's been punched one Let too many times. Oh my god. Uh, how are we able to talk? How are we able to talk? I learned to talk using am screen. The I one we're looking at now, I guess. The villagers think smart is defective. I wish I were strong. So then they would give me food, too. Huh. Defective. Defective? That's tough. Sometimes. But I am spared lottery. Villagers yeah. are afraid of me. <laughs> I don't have to go play bingo. It's great. Lottery? What lottery? Villagers hold lottery to choose sacrifices to Am. Ooh, sacrifices. That sounds great. How long have these sacrifices been going on? The sacrifice to Am Machine. Star Trek was on Voyager. Many years. Oh, no. Very different Not Voyager, Voyager, something else. False Prophets, that's Not the one. Many villagers left. Oh my god. I think you meant the, the original. The original. Oh, no? I have no idea. 305, False Prophets, that's the one. Oh, uh, why do they sacrifice their own people to why Am? Why do they sacrifice their own people to Am? I don't why remember do they the. Sacrifice? So the the the, the Yogg series. <laughs> That's a new one. Oh my god. Uh, what are these sacrifices like? What are these sacrifices like? They include like? explosions. The sacrifice to Am hurts very bad. Yes. <laughs> there are better ways to die. Almost The sacrifice involves having voles eat them to death. Very slowly. There we go. I had a feeling it was Voyager. <laughs> my god. Star Trek Yogg. I need to go find some. If that's the new I'll series, then I wouldn't know. I have not seen anything about it. I need to go find some food. Bye, kid. <laughs> Alright. So now I've talked to him, now I'm gonna grab another bit of fruit. Because, hey, that's Benny's scenario for you. It's just getting fruit all day, every day. But, hey, I can't eat it, though. So what I'll have to do, and I'm gonna save because I don't trust myself, or the game, for that matter. Uh, walk to the cave. <laughs> Yo yoga -ju, of course. <laughs> it's... Oh my god. That was the spin-off where Captain Janeway was, uh, fought Yogi the Bear, and it was the best thing because she used a Bowie knife, and they ended up ended up in the Delta Quadrant again after all of that. So let's see, if, if maybe the mother could help me here. Hang on, hang on, I'll give you some fruit. Please help me. 
Digested the food and then regurgitated it back to me, ah. like a bird feeding its young. <laughs> that's uh, that's wrong. <laughs> that's so wrong. Can I talk to you now? You're right. That son of a bitch, I am ripped out my vocal cords years ago. That's one way to ruin your ruin your experience here. See, Benny just has a really raw deal. All right. So that um. Oh my god. Um. Oh, I speak to the boy again. All right. I'm just making sure because I don't want to fuck up Benny's scenario again. I'm getting very tired. Hmm. I am getting very tired. You now family. You use our bed. Go sleep. Now if you if you sleep uh, more times than you should, you have to sleep at the right times in this level, otherwise you'll completely fuck it up. I think I can sleep now, but I'm gonna double check. Um if I've missed anything. Um do, do, do. No, no, I can use it now. Alright. It's sleeping time. Whatever I I'm sleeping on this, whatever this is. I am family now because I fed a child. Mm. All I had to do was walk down the road and pick up pick a fruit enough. off a tree. Mm. I wonder where the boy's mother went. Yeah. Uh, this is strange. All right, I'm not even going to ask the kid anything. Um, oh, once you wake up, talk to him. Never mind. I was going to walk out the door. Where's where ma'am? Mother. She go to altar to help choose am sacrifice. Ooh, exciting. I need to find some food. Bye. I need to go find some food. I'll see you later. Looks like some filthy fungi roots. I know, it's horrible. Why would I want to sleep on that? I'd rather sleep in that dish of burning... Quiet. Oh. Too quiet. The village is quiet. Which means... I should walk over here and have a look and see what's going on. Why is everyone gathered around the altar? Ah, there's the altar that Ellen saw uh, on one of those screens. Oh my god. You have to chip in with the rent. Oh, great. Alright, so here we are. Um... Let's, let's just talk. Oh, hang on. I'll have a look at some things. What is this? Nothing but twisted wiring and recycled plastic. Hmm. What's with the ropes on the crossbeams? Hmm. Looks like they're used for holding someone captive. Oh. There's the, the old fart seems to be in charge here. God damn you, old man. Why is everyone gathered around the altar? I don't know, but we're going to find out. Hello? Uh, ask why everyone is gathered around the altar. Oh no, I got the black marble. Shit. <laughs> she was already on the thing. Okay, we've got a new Jesus here. Does the totem accept some green putty from my armpit? Hopefully. Oh my god. Ask why the child's mother has been tied to the altar. What is going on? Uh, it looks like she's been chosen to be sacrificed. Oh. Ask if you can eat her instead. <laughs> no. Oh, uh, can I watch? Please let me watch the death. It sounds like he'll let me watch. Hooray! Murder! Murder! Hooray! Oh my god. I am Am the Great and Powerful. Incidentally, if you if you uh, ask if you can eat the mother, it ends the scenario early, which we don't want. That's fantastic, though, that you can do that. <laughs> I must feast on the flesh of the innocent. Oh god! Judas Priest! <laughs> Am blasted her to bits. What am I going to do for food now? What the fuck? <laughs> what am I? No, oh my God! Am completely disintegrated her body. Now, how am I going to eat? <laughs> for fuck's sake, Benny! I hate you. Oh my God! Oh, let's have a look at all this shit here. What's this? There's burnt plastic and twisted metal where bits and pieces of the woman should be. Oh. I wonder if they're going to bury the remains. <laughs> well, I. Mean Jesus, fuck. Alright, so there's, um... That, that was a thing that happened, I guess. Oh, God. Oh, God. Tatana Shama, halt! He doesn't want me to interfere with the sacrifice. Oh, but I want to. Ask about the sacrifice. Am Shaba Hupa! The old bastard seems happy that Am has spared the village. Until the next one. Oh, lottery. my God. Alright. So, uh, there's that. Ask if you can find some food to eat. No, we're, we're not going to fuck around with that anymore. Um, I will save again, why not? And I'll check my psych profile. Oh no, don't check your psych profile, it's cheating. Finders keepers, losers weepers. There's a proverb meaning that if a person who has found something can keep it and the other lo and the loser has no right to it. Huh, interesting. Let's load up again. Boom, so we don't have to lose any progress there. 
Um, but I think we've done everything we need to do here right now. Look at the debris. burnt plastic and twisted metal where bits and pieces of the woman should be. Okay. I wonder if they're going to bury the remains. All right, well, at least now, let's have a look at the path. And now we're going to actually head back to where we were before. This is a little something I have to do. I volunteered as tribute. Happy days. Oh, my goodness. All right, let's have a look around here. Oh. This graveyard gives me the creeps. Ooh, a graveyard. Oh. I feel as though the dead can speak. Well, then talk to the dead, although I'm going to look at everything first. This is the grave of Murphy, one of my old commandos, killed in the war. <laughs> Fell on attack. This is Tuttle's grave. Tuttle's he grave. He lost his life while under my command. If you look at the, the sprite of the, of the tombstone, it almost looks like it says Turtle or Futtle. I have no idea. Thomas is buried here. Oh, I'd almost that poor little tank engine. The army before M came to power. Oh my god. Alright, let's talk to people. Or graves. Left me for dead in the field. The bullet in my brain came from your gun. I, I, I'm sorry. I've learned to be compassionate to those who suffer. Well, what can I do to prove I'm different? What can I do to prove that I am a different man? Give us I mean, look at me. I'm a fucking freak now. This character originally human? Yes, he was human. He just looks like a fucking joke now, which is great. All right, how about you? My tour of duty was almost over, but because I knew your secret, you held my head under the paddy water until I drowned. Jesus your Christ, Benny! Died with me, and soon it will die with you. No, I'm better now. I've learned that individuals shouldn't be sacrificed to save for the sake of the group. What I've learned things. What can I do to prove that I am a different man? Show us that you're able to. Someone other than yourself. Okay, I can't do that, so I've lost, I guess. How about you, Thomas? I tried to help, Brickley, but you'd have none of that. If you couldn't carry your own weight, then you were worth more dead than alive, and anyone willing to carry some extra weight was a liability. Well, I mean, sure, I, I, I will give you that, but I'm different. What can I do to prove that I am a different man? I can't even walk now, I'm a cripple. Pity me, please. Okay. Well, bugger that. We've also got a fence. Why is this fence here? Hmm. What's out there in the jungle? Maybe something to eat. <laughs> Alright, Benny. Focus. Focus now, buddy. Focus. We need to keep doing... Keep going forward. If eating is not what, what, what our concerns are right now, so fucking just relax, eh? Is that fire in those caves along the cavern wall? Oh. God, what I would give for some barbecued ribs. So, Benny's kind of one note, as you've probably noticed. <laughs> <laughs> it fucking didn't even try, really. Okay, well, let's just uh, talk to the boy. Uh, I'm sorry, your mother's fucking dead. I'm sorry, I try. I do no, I didn't try. I I even opted to eat her corpse, but I'm not gonna. Do. I'm sorry, your mother is dead. I know. Me sorry too. She only wants to care for me, except you. I'm gonna look after you now. What will happen to you? No food. No safe room lottery. Hmm. Either way, not good. Oh, okay. Well, why'd you run away why then? Why don't you run away from here? Jump the fence. Bad idea to run. Villagers hunt me down. Become sacrificed to am machine. Oh. I wonder why the gravestone business didn't get enlightened by this game and force everyone to pay for gravestones or statuettes of the deceased. Fucking cheap game. Oh, um, I can't care for you. I have my own problems. Are the victims? Yes. Are the victims buried in the graveyard? I know nothing about graveyard. You can actually dig up the the grave uh, the, the graves and actually try to eat the corpses, but you don't get anything out of it. In fact, it really fucks up your ending. Um, I can't care for you now. I can't care for you. I have my own problems. Fuck you, child. You care. You may not do anything, but you care. Me no. You really don't know anything. Oh, I wish I could stop the lottery from taking I place. I wish I could stop the lottery from taking place. That'd be Many handy. Villagers go to old man for ideas. Too bad he not friend. He's not a friend of us. I'll do what I can. Look, I'll do what I can, but no promises. Thank you. I promise for you. <laughs> That's not how it works, son, but okay, sure. All right, uh, I think we're good, hopefully. I will save in a new thingy. Oh my god, I'm gonna save in a new slot because I'm not too sure if I've done this right or not, but we'll see. It's one of those things, it's one of those games. All right, um, and hopefully the guy will be gone, so I'll come in here. Nope, he's still here. Uh, can you get out of your chair and fuck off? Hang on, talk to the guy. 
No, it's motioning towards the video monitor. Oh, okay. Talk to the monitor then. Come on, monitor. Oh, hang on. Use the monitor. There we go. Speaking in the third I'm going to write it in my will that I want a gravestone with statuette of me saying some catchphrase. I can't, I can't imagine what I'd have written. Spoken. I have, uh, before I forget, spoken, because you you need help. So yeah, Benny's uh, unique in that he doesn't get many items, like, not until later on in his in his story, but there were characters that just get dumped with a whole ton of items. Alan got a, a couple every now and then. Uh, Gorister got a fuck ton, but I don't know. Um, let's have a look at the bag. What's in the bag, bruh? Those are the lottery pieces used for choosing the sacrifice victims. All right. We could try to take it. I have to wait for the lottery czar to leave before I can steal it. Now this is where it gets a bit confusing. Um, I think if you just go back and forth, back and forth, eventually he'll not be in there, I think. But I might have encountered that glitch, which is really annoying. Go away. Go away. You know you want to. I know I don't want to sleep, that's for sure. Eh, maybe I'll just dick around a bit. What's in here? Looks like it's empty. Empty? Alright. See, yeah, you gotta come here when he's actually not in, which is annoying because he's just kind of always here. Oh, and in case you're wondering, even if I wanted to eat something, there's no more fucking fruit on that tree. I don't know why. You're not bearing fruit anymore, you damn tree, and I'm not having that. Alright, what's in here? It's a goddamn supermarket! <laughs> if you say so, it doesn't look like a supermarket to me. Uh, hi buddy. This guard looks a lot stronger than me, but not too bright. <laughs> he's, he's the size of a fucking tree, but, you know, that's fine. Um, I don't have everything I need just yet, so I'm going, Get good, brah, get wrecked, son. <laughs> get wrecked with the- oh god, lottery bag. Gimme? I, I, I don't know, it's just really confusing. I've done this a couple of times, and sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Um, try saving again, maybe? I don't know, I'm gonna save over ST4 again, see if that does anything for me. Um, uh, might as well talk to you again. I've learned to be compassionate. I've learned to be compassionate to those who suffer. They well, don't believe you. Alter, you haven't changed any that I can see, Commander. I should put a bullet in your brain, just like you did to me. Oh, no. What can what I do to prove myself? Hang on, I know what I'll do. I will, uh... Oh, here we go. Use Murphy's grave. I can't figure out what I want to do with this. I thought I could uh, uh, dig out the bodies and eat them. I seem to remember that. Shall we topple some more? I've learned that individuals shouldn't be sacrificed for the sake of the group. From where I lie, you're still the same compassionless bastard. I've only just learned these things now. Oh, that didn't work. What can I do? Show us that you're able to think of someone. All right, um, Tuttle is not helping me. Oh, I've learned to protect the weak and the helpless. I've learned to protect the weak Throw and helpless. Throw poop at Gravestar. The coward who let that woman die on the altar is the same coward who killed me in my sleep. You're going to die a coward too. Oh. What can I do? Give us evidence that you have some. Okay. So that was shit. I got to load that up anyway. Well, didn't want to lose any of my uh super abilities to do things. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, oh, come on. Come on. Let me walk out of the frame. Hang on. No. Just just leave. There we go. Jesus Christ. It's hard to get around this place sometimes. Alright. Um. Gotta make my way through this somehow. Go away. Yes! The elder must be out gathering food. Fantastic. Then take his bag. Take his purse. I'm taking it. Yay. Alright. Let's have a look at you. This bag is full of many white marbles and one black one. Ah, there you go. That's how they choose the sacrifice. Very handy. All right, and I'm definitely saving now. Go me. Okay. Continue going. All right. Um. Now that we got that, let's head back to the kid and say, "Look what I got, Daddy. Got you a bag of marbles to play with." Here we go. Look at this. See? Look. I don't think he understands what I'm trying to say. Go you, you figured it out. Oh, I stole a lottery bag. I stole the lottery bag from the village elder. I robbed you're brave. them. You have lottery bag, but you must hide it or they find. 
Oh, hiding it. Okay, where the fuck am I gonna hide it? Um, hmm. I'll think of something, but for now, I'm gonna dick off over here. Okay, um. Oh, right. I remember this. I completely forgot to do this. Hopefully, this doesn't fuck me over later, but here we go. One fruit. Ah, mother from heaven. Delicious fruit. Oh, right. So, I do have some fruit after all. I'm not gonna eat it just yet. Um, alright. Um. Oh, I remember now. Okay. Okay, the walkthrough is gonna help me out somewhat, because I've, I've forgotten this to an extent. God, very confusing. Um. Who do I want to talk to? I forgot which one. Thomas, of course. Here you go, Mr. Tank Engine. Um, I have the lottery bag. I have the lottery bag. No more villagers will be sacrificed. Hooray! You proved that you're capable of caring for others. And that's worth something. Can I just told you that was my intention from day one? Come on now. We forgive you for what you've done to us. But we can't speak for your most tragic victim. Oh? Brickman's grave is under Do I accept game time. donations? As a matter of fact, I do. If anyone donates games, I pretty much pretty much play all of them. Unless, of course, they're banned on Twitch or, or um... Of course, uh, multiplayer games I can't really play on stream, but, you know, I, I do my best. Oh my goodness. Um, alright, so now that we've done that... Uh, we've got some things... So look at that, we've got some vines. Look at the vines, what's behind here? Vines? Huh? I wonder if they're edible. <laughs> Benny, come on! Come on! We want to push the vines, not there eat the vines. Brickman's grave. Hey there, Brickman, <laughs> he's got glasses on. Okay, Poindexter. It's like that kid from the Magic School Brothers. It's Arnold, or whatever his name was. I forgot. I think it was Arnold from the Magic School Bus. He grew up and now he's dead. Hey there, Brickman, how you doing? Hello, Commander. I'm not exactly happy to see you again. I last saw your face just before I got it right I'm sorry. I don't blame you for... Uh, I have something to plant on your grave. I have something to plant on your grave. There we go, and... Last. Some compassion. Fruit! Now I can finally rest in peace. Better give me an email. Uh, you know what? If it's a Steam game, I do have a Steam account. You can add me as a friend and... Because, Lord knows, I don't have too many friends that I can add more. So that's fine. I know there's a Steam limit for that, and I think you have to... I don't know. I, I know you can extend your, um... You can extend your, your friend list numbers with something. I can't remember what it is. Maybe it's your level or the number of badges? I have no idea. If it's not on Steam, though, uh, just send me a private message on Twitch, and I'll get back to that as soon as I can. Um, is this all I have to do here? Uh, yeah, just return to the caves. Cool. Ah, God, there we go. Alright, back to the caves we go. Oh my God. Yeah, it's based on level. I thought that was the case. Guess what, son? I've- the lottery cannot take place now. Hello! Okay. Uh... Oh. Do I want to tell him about this? Uh... Let's see. Uh... Well, I don't say I need to I talk need to, to him. Find some food. I'll see you later. I'll see you later. Alright. And I'm gonna save just to be on the safe side. Boom. Oh, good. And now I think we can sleep. According to this, we can actually sleep. And that's what I... You gotta be very careful not to sleep at the wrong times here, otherwise terrible things will happen. I wonder when the next sacrifice will be. The boy's still here. See, if we fucked up, the, the next sacrifice would show up and then the boy would be the next one to die. And that's always fun. Um, alright. Uh... Okay, nope. I, I wasn't thinking of doing that, but the walkthrough, I'm gonna follow it for this one because this one's confusing at times. Oh, hey there, you missing your little lottery bag now? Hey, you missing your, your bag? Hey there, buddy. He's motioning towards the video monitor. <laughs> I... I am going to be fired from my job if I don't get the lottery bag Gather back. the villagers at the altar tomorrow and choose a sacrifice. Or suffer the wrath of Am. Oh, dear. Alright, well, um... Wait. Alright, so we got... I don't know. I don't know, Am, you're a bit of a dickhead. Alright, so I've got some bad news. Um, the lottery can't happen, but someone will kill everyone if I don't bring the bag back. So what do we do? I buried the lottery bag. No one I will find it. I buried the lottery bag where no one will ever find it. The lottery means new 
way to choose victim. <laughs> I'm more scared now. You've, you've done a terrible thing. Uh, alright. Joe's cut's not Joe's guy. No, oh no, it's it's the same thing. It's just Halloween. It's just Halloween, that's the thing. That's that's definitely me though. No, that's me. <laughs> if it's got a creepy creepy red face of Barry Gibb, then you've gone to the right place. Oh, Am wants to have a sacrifice tomorrow, even with the lottery bag missing. Am wants to have a sacrifice oh, no. tomorrow, even with the lottery bag missing. Why don't you hide in the hole? Spooky just rookie in case. woo. I afraid of hole. Need friend to hide with. You too big to go in hole. Huh. So I gotta make you a friend. All my friends are far away from here or dead. I can't even eat them. I have no friends to hide with you. All my friends are far away from here or dead. I have no friends to hide with you. Me good idea. I make friend and then I hide. Oh. You help me. You make a friend. Um. What can I do to help you make a friend? I need head for friend. Okay. Uh, I'll see what I'll I can see do. What I can find. Let's see. So you need a head, and this is where things get a little bit weird and macabre, but nevertheless just fantastic. All right. So we need a head, and what better head? Then, oh, hang on, I, I need to load that up again. Fucking music keeps stopping. There we go. Let's have a look at the debris. There's burnt plastic. I wonder if they're going to bury the remains. Well, we're gonna take a head, that's for sure. Here's an interesting piece of junk. <laughs> Blup. Funny. I had lost interest so, in So, wait, all the villagers are robots? I, <laughs> I didn't care about anything except food, and now I met a young child. And also learned that I can't eat anyone because the fucking robot head. What's going on? What is going on? I guess I'll look at it, but jeez. There's burnt plastic and twisted metal where bits and pieces of the woman should be. <laughs> I wonder if they're going to bury the remains. Oh my god. Okay, so now we've got a head. Very handy. Um, alright. Oh, yeah, that's right. I need another one of these. Hang on. Oh, I need more fruit from the secret basket of twine. Ah. <sighs> from heaven. Yoink! Hooray! Free food for me. I think this is illegal, but I'm doing it anyway. Alrighty. Hello. Okay, so we've got this fucker here. Now what we're going to do is give him the fruit, if I remember. I'm just checking. Uh... Show up the garden, I'll tell you to place the... Uh, place the fruit on the second leaf. Okay, yep. I had a feeling that was right. Here we go. Have some fruit. Oh. I think he wants me to put my fruit into a basket. Put my fruit in the basket, then I will. All right, and what is this? We got some, got some wood. A polished piece of wood. A well-polished piece of wood. This for pulping the fruit. There's a masturbation joke in there somewhere. I know someone who might like a piece of polished wood. <laughs> oh, Benny, come on, come on, Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, here we go. Take the fruit. There we go. Okay, okay. Here's another piece of fruit to add to the collection. <laughs> if they need it anymore. Jesus Christ. Anyway. How many of these do you need, son? Oh, but oh well. Uh, let's see. Polished wood is the best kind. Alright, so I got some wood. I got a head. Hmm. What now? Um, I guess I will... Let's see, I've taken the head. I just need some reminders here. I've got the wood. Um... Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, of course, I haven't been to this cave yet, and of course, what I'm looking for are these thingies. I think. I wonder if they're edible. No, we're not looking at edible stuff. I'm trying to find some wires here. Vines. Hmm, can I take any? Of them? There's a loose wire among these vines. There we go. That's what I wanted. So we got some some wire, some wood, and of course, a head. The head of the f former mother of this child. Alright, um, and I believe that's all I need for this, so, I'm gonna be saved in the game, I'm gonna save over ST3, because that was the better one, alright, boom. Alright, kid, I have good news, I found a friend for you. <laughs> Hopefully this is, this is enough for you, I'm, I'm sure it will be. I found this piece of junk at the altar, it looks kinda like a head. I found this piece of junk at the altar. Because it is. It looks kind of like a head. It's a Terminator Thank head. You. I can use this to make doll's head. Mmm. And I found a piece of wood. It's very polished. I found a piece of wood that could be used for a body. Thank you. I can use this to make doll's body. Oh my god. And I found some wire. I found a piece of wire. 
Thank you for help with all. Me go play in hole. All right, and off he goes into the cave, <laughs> and everything was fine. All right. So now all we have to do is use this monitor again. It's about time you hit the kid. I was beginning to have my doubts about whether you'd make it this far, even with my help. Oh come on, no one was helping me. Who are you? Are you M? Am you M? I used no. to work for him, but now I'm working for the Russian. Oh great, now the Russians are involved. Well what is going Who's on? The Russian? Why, Why me? Okay. Um, you know who I am, Am? You know or not Am? am? <laughs> the communists are onto me now. Eh. Well, how can how can you help me? How can you help me? Now that you've shown your comrades that there's some hope for you, you should work on the person you wrong the most. Jesus? Oh. I've been Am's prisoner for more than a hundred years. Why help me I've now? I've been Am's prisoner for more than 100 years. Why help Jesus me now? Jesus Christ, why would you want to be here for over a century? I mean, Jesus Christ. I mean, that way you just fucking kill yourself. I mean, you know, I've been here for 100 years being tortured. I mean, why am I still alive? I might as well just end it. Uh, what's the use of helping me if Am's so damn invincible? What's the use of helping me if Am's so damn invincible? Throw rocks at him. I like this plan. Thanks for your help. And goodbye. Alright, we're good. I have no more items now, so yeah, Benny doesn't have a f uh, too many items to deal with. But there we go. Uh, once we've used the monitor, we go to bed. Oh, thank God. Sleeping time. Good night, everybody. Hey. Yeah. I wonder how the boy is doing today. Oh, let's have a look. Who's that kid? The boy's gone. Oh, the no. villagers must have found him. Oh, shit, and it's lottery day. And they don't have a lottery bag. They're just going to kill the fucking kid. Which is quiet. Too quiet. Too quiet. Oh, no. I know what's happened. No! Nameless child! Um... Uh... This is not good. Nothing but twisted wire. Uh, hey there, kid. The little guy looks scared out of his wits. <sighs> I, yeah, I wonder why. Dangling off that crucifix made of crap. Uh, all right. The old fart looks pleased with himself about having saved his village for another day. No matter how many lives it costs. What a dickhead. All right, we'll we'll deal with this. We'll talk to the older. Why is everyone gathered around? Ask we can find some food. <laughs> we must kill a child today. This is going to be Damn. good. M must have told the villagers where I hid the lottery bag and the boy. Fuck. Fuck. All right, what do we do now? Plead with the village elder to release the boy. I haven't eaten his face off yet. They're going to sacrifice the boy unless I think of something quick. Think of something. Um, 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 uh, ask if you can eat the boy instead. <laughs> Benny, come on, you are not the smartest tool in the shed. Oh, threaten the villager elder into releasing the boy. That's probably not going to work. I don't have anything on me, but I will offer to take the child's place. Kill me instead, I look like the you thing on Fridays. The elder seems amazed that I would show compassion to the boy, but I think he's going to go Compassion? From a monkey man? The boy's he grows another arm. arm. Gratitude for being spared the pain of being sacrificed. Wait, he gro no. grows a third Moving arm like the kid for some reason. Compassion. For me. Oh my god. And that was the end of Benny. Help! And nothing of value was lost. <laughs> Fuck you, Benny. You're a bit of an asshole. I send you out among the prey. <laughs> so yeah, that one's over pretty quick, I guess. You, you show them compassion. God damn it! I turned you into a monkey rendition of the thing, only for you to be nice to people. Oh. Who among you shall go next? All right. Well, we're gonna go full Nimdoc, I suppose. Hooray, it's time for Nazi evil, I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, but it's all smooth sailing from here on out for the most part. No more glitches to get in the way. Blood 
So Am kind of kind of likes Nimdok because he's an evil an evil Nazi scientist, which I can I can respect, I suppose. I mean, not the Nazi scientist shit, but the fact that Am's like, yeah, I, I need a friend, I suppose. Oh, here we go. This compound looks familiar. Yeah, all everyone. I'm here to do Nazi research. Oh, look for a lost tribe. Oh my God. Gates and fences. Who could be lost in such a secure area? Well, I mean, I don't know. Let's talk to that friendly-looking guard over there. Hello. You must let me leave. <laughs> I have urgent business elsewhere. I cannot let you pass, Doctor. You're due at surgery. Doctor Mengele's orders. Oh fuck! All right. We can't alter history that much. The Fuhrer will be most unhappy if you don't complete your evil research. Oh well. So that didn't work on us. Um, I guess we can talk to this poor sod. Hello. Why are you imprisoned here? Oh, come on, genius. Figure it out. You have the features of a man of intellect. I'm so smart that I refuse to work on things. Oh my god. Are you mocking me? What? No? Where? You know me? I thought I did. Until you had me arrested for refusing to condone your experiments. Oh. Yeah, that sounds like me. <laughs> I know nothing of experiments. Experiments? I know nothing of experiments. I do not know these things your of which you speak of. as sick as your methods, Doctor. How can you act so innocent after having maimed Dr. Kim? How many genitals have you removed science? surgically, Doctor? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Are you saying we're colleagues? Oh. You are saying we were colleagues of some kind? Ridiculous. There's no need that doesn't sound like me at all. Me. I was once your friend. Now I am your enemy. Well, that's a good reason to distance yourself, don't you think? That's textbook. But, oh well. Why would I bother to have you imprisoned like this? The regime needed answers, but I stood in your way. Well, now you have them. Oh, I have secrets. Do you know of the Lost Tribe? I must find it. <laughs> the you Lost Tribe. I don't even experience. know why. I don't even think I know. Oh. Are there more mass graves to fill? Oh, I know nothing of what you speak I of. I know nothing of what you talk about. Time to this play the denial game. Is over. I'm leaving. Why? I haven't saved. All right. Um. Yeah, we're on to number four now. Jesus Christ, we're ripping through these pretty quick. Boom. Nimdok is pretty short and straightforward, so we'll get this over and done with pretty quick. Um, uh, off to the hospital, I guess. There's this thing. Yeah, I'll, I'll go go to the hospital first and have a look around. Where have you been, Nimdok? We are waiting on you to perform. All right, all right. You are waiting for me. I am sorry that I will not. Come on, I mean the patients aren't going anywhere. After all, they probably appreciate it if I didn't cut them apart until maybe a little later on. Or perhaps the anticipation is worse. Ah, yes, there is, but I must know where you got those fancy shorts. They're almost like jean shorts. We will have time for that after the surgery. Meet me at the complex later. Ah. Okie dokes. Alright. So, oh, oh, we got a poster. A youth with 1945 stamped beneath. There is something <laughs> familiar about it. Something about an evil fascist regime. Nothing really comes to mind, but I'll think of it uh, eventually. Finally, Doctor. Oh, all right. Waiting on your expertise. Fantastic. Where's the scalpel? <laughs> all right. Uh, I've completely forgotten what I do here. Let's see. Uh, oh no! I just, uh, talk to this fucker. Hello. Uh, what am I? To what is your function? What is your function? I will be administering ether to the surgeon ah. about this procedure. Cool. I don't want this little maggot to stir and ruin your handy. It looks like a kid. What, what am I to do? What am I to do? Ah, you are testing me because I'm new here. Uh, yeah, Today's that's right. Get it wrong and I will shoot you in the face. Subjects. Spinal cord. Ah, okay, spinal fluid. I like the sound of this. Uh, what is the purpose of such a procedure indeed? What is the purpose of such a procedure? We have decided that the fewer needs more spinal fluid. Spinal fluid from this and the other adolescent subjects. The fluid will then be used to formulate a serum. 
Serum? What serum? What is the nature of the serum? What is the nature I mean, fuck this game if I'm serum. right about that. I was just kidding. Secrets in such a public setting. But I'm you testing you. I remember my military training as well as my medical knowledge. It really is the elixir to, to everlasting life though, isn't it? Oh my god. What is Dr. Mengele's position? Dr. Mengele is the master surgeon of this facility and one of the regime's finest minds. So we get rid of him and everything will be great. His associate. Alright, um, I cannot carry... <laughs> I will begin the procedure momentarily, I just gotta go and uh, check things out. Uh, but I won't I do it. I cannot carry out this procedure. I can see that you don't look well, Doctor. If necessary, Dr. Mengel can take over. Okay, um, what have we got here? Ether. It has been a long time since I have seen Ita used as an anesthetic. It's been a long time. The scalpel is coated with dried Ooh. blood. The spinal fluid is for I the mangler on beach cocktail, of course. <laughs> it's delicious, it's the finest thing. Hey there, buddy. This child cannot be more than eight years old. He'll be fine. Look at him. He's laying there doing nothing. That's a kid's wildest dream come true. There we go. Alright, so... I will try to take away the ether. I'm sorry, Doctor. The oh. ether is necessary for the surgery. Oh, alright. Fine. I know what to do with you. Grab the scalpel. Use the scalpel. On the fucking idiot! Yes, come here quickly. No. Nope. Dr. Nimdok has gone berserk. <laughs> oh, fuck. I must leave yes. the guards me. Yes. All right. <laughs> my, psych, uh, uh, my psych profile's looking nicer already now that I've fucking killed someone. Oh, screw the they Just give him an iPad. Now I can take this thing. Are you going to stop me now? No, you're not going to. Oh, my God. Look at the and and Oh, my God. Anesthetist. He is dead. <laughs> it is amazing what damage such a small instrument can do. <laughs> now stab the child because you can. Oh my goodness. So there was that. Um, I, I forgot what comes next. Hang on. Uh, oh, go behind the curtains. Oh, of course. I can look behind the things. Look at recovery. Here we go. This must be the recovery world. <laughs> Not a lot of recovery going on here, I don't think. It is difficult to see what purpose this surgery serves other than to mutilate the patient. Well, that's that's a reason in and of itself, don't you think? This patient has been too damaged by his surgery to live a normal life. <laughs> yeah, I'd say so. He's, he's about half dead this already. Patient will never no recover. recovery at all. I'm going to have to write that in the, in the checkbook. Oh my god, we've got a vent. What's a vent? There is heat. Coming out of this vent. Okay, well, give it a push then. Yeah, yeah. I pushed a vent, and that gets me some good things, I guess. Oh my god, that gets me all the brownie I smell points. Burnt flesh. Yes, we've made it to but the oven room. Is obviously not a kitchen. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to make flapjacks in here. All right, well, let's have a look at some things. We've got some records. According to these records. Hundreds of corpses were incinerated here. Oh, okay. Can I take them? I probably don't. According to this. Nope, alright. Uh, what else have we got? We got some pliers. These pliers must be used for extracting gold fillings and teeth from the corpses. And then melted down, just, for, just out of spite. A gold watch. I am surprised its owner was able to keep it long enough to reach this place. Well, you know, it was stolen by the guy who runs this little area and he just decided to pop it on the table. I mean, why not? Oh, well, it's mine now. Yoink. And I might as well take the pies too, why not? Alright, look at these ovens. You make these three pizzas in here. More monstrous than anything Am has ever constructed. And we constructed them. We are the true monsters after all. Oh my god, okay, so that's everything in here. Oh, oh my god, and we got a new prisoner who's just kind of stuck in a fence. Oh my god. Hey there, buddy, you look like you're having a bit of a bad time. Uh, how could you be so foolishly caught in the wires? How could you so foolishly be caught in the wires? I was trying to escape, but 
I was so weak. I fell and got caught. You are such an idiot. All right, uh, I will call the guard. I'll summon one of the doctors. I will summon one of the doctors. They will help you. Wink, I'm wink. Off here is under the knives of you butchers. Oh, um, why do you risk escaping in such why poor do physical you risk condition? Escaping in such poor physical condition. That timing was hardly of my own choosing. Oh. I learned that I was to be among the next batch of volunteers. It was a lottery. We had marbles in a bag and everything. For what were you being given the privilege to volunteer? Experimentation, they say. Extinction is more like it. And a Surely coupon for free you pizza. All people know the regime's plan for the lost tribe. Ah, yes, I've heard of this lost tribe. There is nothing I can do for you. There is nothing I can do for you. You can at least help me end my misery. Oh, that would all give right. you the pleasure of seeing another one of us die. The Carl Marbles in a Bag Lottery. It's just, bastard. it's a theme it, all over the game. Uh, all right, hang on, yeah, hang on. I got some, I got some ether here for you. Oh, <laughs> great. That feels much better. Now I just feel numb from hanging here all day. All right, and now we've got to cut him free with the pliers. We use both of the, the newest items we have on, on him. Jesus Christ. Here you go. Don't fall. Don't fall. Thank you. Thank you. Listen, I heard this in the hospital when the doctor thought I was sleeping. Oh. Waking the sleeper, utter the truth, and kiss him. Oh. What? Why do I have to do that? But he has lost consciousness. Ah, oh, poor dickhead. All right. So now that we've done that, um... Oh, we've also got this fella here. Um, I don't know if I want to talk to him or not. It's been a while since I've... Hang on, uh... Okay, now I do have to talk to him again. I hope you are happy with the regime that you set up. Oh, very. The science could have saved the world. Instead, it conquered it. I have so much work to do. Um... What is the importance of the year 1945? What is the importance of the year 1945? It seems to have some significance. Oh, come on now, you should Never know this. the year 1945, That was when the truths about you and your unholy experiments came out. Oh, okay. I seem to recall that you speak Latin. What is engraved on this part? Oh. Didn't even have to get out of my inventory to do that. And since your time is running out, I keep the watch. Okay. Um, I'm starting to recall that you do have a cause to hate me. I am starting to recall that you do have cause to hate me. You want to make amends? Get me out of here. Okay, fine. I'll give you the pliers, but you got to give them back at the end of the day. Enjoy! Yeah. Free pliers! You should be able to escape with this. They're pliers really... For cutting the wires. They're, they're, they've got nice yes. utility to I them and all that. make escape possible. Oh, but right. don't think that one good deed would make up for all those poor innocents you butchered. I know. Oh well, I feel better already. <laughs> Hooray! Oh my god, I will save there because we're doing well. But there's not a lot of places you can fuck up with this scenario, so I like it. Um, alright, we're going back to the surgery room. We can't actually use that door at all. I'm pretty sure that's just locked all the time. This door is the most solid structure in the compound. It is constructed of iron. Which means we're not walking through it anytime soon, but oh well, back to the hospital we go. Continue your research. Huh? The extinction of the lost tribe is near at hand. The lost tribe. The regime shall vanquish all of its enemies. Metal Gear. Alright, fine. I'm heading back to the curtain. There's a new guy here now. Um, all right, this is awkward. Um, how you doing, buddy? Uh, what have you done to deserve the removal of your eyes? What have you done to deserve removal of your eyes? Disconnect the wires. Okay, you know what? Have some ether first. There you go. Do you feel better? Yourself. There we go. As long as I keep using ether on people, I should be fine. One like us, one from the east, one from the steppes. They speak a number. 
Oh. A lost tribe of our brothers sleeping in the moon. Great. So if I find the lost tribe, then I can sneak around the place. Alright. Well, if you're going to have a rest, then I guess you don't need your eyes anymore. I'm going to take your eye jar. He is not conscious. But what about the eye jar? Incredible. A wire connects this patient's optic nerve to a jar containing two human eyes. And how is this supposed to achieve the, the Nazis' goals? I, I have no idea, but I'm grabbing it anyway. Take the jar. So we've got a jar of eyes. Okay, so we got that. Uh, I don't know why we have it, but we got it. Oh my god, and I'm going to go to recovery. And there's the new child. Hey there, buddy. You don't look too good. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? I feel okay. I'm not hurt like the others here. Oh my god, it's the same kid as before, only now he has a German accent. <laughs> Do you know who I am? I am the Destroyer. Do you know who I am? You are Nimdok? You are more frightening in person than in legend. <laughs> really? I'm more terrifying in person? Oh, well, that's not very nice, but sure. What do you know of me? The things you do are terrible. You small ones. Yeah, are you I know. Rats? I know. Are you saying the doctors here have been using children for experimentation? Are you saying that the doctors here have been using Ooh. children for Here, kid, eat these eyes. Enjoy. No, not all the doctors. You and Dr. Mengele sent all the good doctors to the prison yard. All the good doctors. So I'm I'm like a pretty cool deal with you, aren't I? I'm pretty nifty. I a legend to you. Yes, but we have our own legends. Legends that owe nothing to your regime. You will fail, no matter how many of us you cut apart. We'll see about that. Why do you say that the regime will fail? Why do you say that the regime will fail? The golem will finish you. Oh. It will not be mastered by your regime. The golem will wake up, and when it sees with its own eyes the evil you have done, it will turn on you and save us. I... Oh. Yes! Learning of this golem has cheered me the fuck up. Now get some rest. Get some rest. We will not rest until your regime is destroyed. Oh, you know what I mean. Jesus Christ, just fucking sleep. All right. So now we've learned that. I mean, I'm going. I'm going. Goodbye, everybody. This place is miserable as fuck. Oh. The prisoners have seized the compound. Shice. Gather all research materials and evacuate to the bunker. Evacuate. Oh. Ooh, not before grabbing whatever's in here. What's this? These files appear to have been packed in a hurry. Ooh. Well, just take everything in it. I got a box of things. Look at the box. I do not understand any of these papers. So many papers. All right. Um. Uh. Oh. Hang on. Oh. I've already fucked this up. I think. I'm not supposed to take the box. Oh, hang on. No, I, I'm supposed to. Do, do, do. It is safely hidden. In there the we box. go. I remember this. You got to put the the eyes in the jar. Look at the jar and then the box and the things. Um, all right, so I've hidden the eyes. Um, now I'm just gonna—I'm gonna head out. Hang on, I, I'm coming. Don't have a revolt without me. See, you wanted to hide the eyes because you don't want these guys to see you holding eyes in your pocket. Oh, it's just my jar of eyes. I'm still on your side. You must let me go. I know nothing of what's happening. Um, I may be able to remedy the atrocities I've committed. You must let me go. Free me. I may be able to remedy the atrocities I have committed. You can't fool me, Nimdok. You are an unredeemable butcher. You are one of us. I can talk to you. <laughs> Wait, you mean I'm Jewish? Oh my god. Uh, does this mean you'll allow me to go? Well, why do you say that? Why do you say that I am one of you? You denied your heritage and turned your own parents into the I am a member of the Lost Tribe. Of the Lost Tribe. That makes your crimes all the more heinous. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, can I go then? Does that mean you will allow me to go? Since you did help us to escape, we will go ahead and start. Then we'll huh? hunt you down and kill you like the dog you are. Oh, uh, I guess I'll I take that. Must leave this place. <laughs> and now we've got a it face seems door. I was once the booth. Now. I am the quarry. I... 
sure, I, I guess. I, I, I know. What is this? We got a, a wall of faces. Faces. Faces of people in torture. I, I guess. I can barely make them out. I mean, that one, that one looks kind of cheery. It's like, oh, blah, 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 blah. Alright, well, we finally got out of that fucking nightmare of a place. Okay. So, um, what do I do now? I've, you know, uh, Oh, mass grave. Okay, no, I know what I'm doing now, I guess. Um, let's have a look at all the... Yes, mass graves. I have not seen so many corpses since... Ugh, since the summer of 43. It used to be. <laughs> Them's were the days. Alright, oh, we found a bunker. I know this place. Some of my greatest Hey, blip, 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 this is my finish here. all along. Alright, and what is this? We got all these things. What is this? A bell jar. More for genetics. Oh. The ability to reorganize DNA at will. Ooh, from mouse to cat. I can make cats out of mice. Is this how he was able to alter Benny and play other cruel tricks on the rest of us? Ooh. See, I can make... I can make a human into the thing. I can make a mouse into a cat. I can make Ben Affleck into, uh, someone who isn't Batman, I have no idea. Oh my goodness, um, I don't know, I'll just look around the place, there's so much stuff. I can make Shad Kroger, uh, talented, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, uh, oh, a teletype. Or a Teletubby, one of the two. Whatever it is, I'm having a look at it. A teletype machine. Mm. There is a message in it. Okay, well then use it. The message reads, cease all work on Project Perfect Image. Oh. Confidential. The leader is dead. Oh. Having looked on the face of the future using the prototype device. I know, Himmler is, is dead. What do I do now? Ripe for invasion. Destroy all work in progress. This technology must not be allowed to fall into the hands of the enemy. Because Lord knows they won't be as forgiving. <laughs> oh my god. Well, let's see if there's anything else to look at. Or There's Bell Jar. Uh, that seems to be the only other thing. Alright, let's head over here to this doorway. The legends are true. Ooh. This must be the golem of lost tribe folklore. Oh. It, it's awesome. It kind of looks like the elevator rapist, though, so that's a bit of a worry. And now the music stopped again. Ugh. There we go. Alright, so what have we got here? Oh my goodness, so, um... Oh, we got a switch? What's this switch do? This resembles a light switch. Oh, uh, well, do I want to... Do I want to flip it? I guess so. Push that switch. Push it, baby! Hey. Okay, and what's this? I see a mirror. It was obscured by the light. Okay, well you might as well take it then. What is this mirror doing here? Why does it exist? Alright, so I've got a mirror. I guess I can... Do I want to look at it? I don't know. I'm always a bit worried about mirrors in games like these. Look into the mirror and suddenly you'll be teleported into it and eaten by a giant snake. Alright, um... I guess I'll use it though, there's no reason not to. Use the mirror with myself? No? Just look out the mirror. Oh my god! <laughs> it is true! 1945! Oh. Turning my Jewish parents over to the Nazis for extermination! Yeah, I bit of a dick move there, the Nimdok. It is me! I is the lost tribe! Oh Christ! I'll never be able to wash my hands clean of the blood and all that, but oh, on the other hand, i got a fucking golem here, and he looks kind of cool. So why not? Okay, um... Let's have a look at this fucker then. Look at him, he's huge. This golem appears to be made of steel and molded clay. Huh. Well... What do we do with him? Oh, I know. Let's give him some eyes. There you go, do you want some eyes? These eyes fit into the golem sockets perfectly. Oh, right, okay. So now we have to wake the golem. Um, how the fuck do I do that? Let's go wake him up. Um... 
see. Oh, that's right. Um, utter the truth of the thing. Uh, waken the sleeper, utter the truth, and kiss him. Okay. I've given him eyes. The man caught in the barbed wire said to waken the sleeper. Okay. Utter the truth and kiss him. Uh, the truth is... Uh, what is the truth? Time is truth. Anything can be truth. Um, I don't know. Do, 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 do. I, I have no idea. Um, the truth is, I regret my crimes and committed in my past life. I don't know. Time is truth. Time is truth. Maybe that works? And then kiss the golem. Hmm, tastes like copper. Nothing happened. Rats. Alright. Uh, the truth is that this is all an illusion manufactured by am. Uh, the truth is... Oh, the truth is that for me, it shall always be 1945. The truth is that for me, it shall always be 1945. Oh, it was the worst year ever. They cancelled my favourite show on the shortwave. Nothing happened. Hmm, okay, that didn't work either. Wake up, dickhead. Wake up. No? This is pointless. This is pointless. I tried. I tried. Alright. Uh, what am I doing wrong here? I wonder if there's anything else that I'm supposed to look for. There's... I've only got a mirror. There's nothing else. The, the vat's got nothing? This vat contains a silvery liquid. Oh. Mercury, perhaps. It's always mercury, isn't it? Every time. Oh, here we go. Look at the blueprints. That might give us a clue. Such a strange combination of scientific plans and mystic symbols. This has something to do with the golem. Hmm. But the meaning is not clear. Oh, I think I know where I fucked this up. Hang on, hang on. You gotta wake the golem first. Golem, wake golem, up. Wake up. There we go. Utter the truth. The truth is that for me... It shall always be 1945. And then give him a quick peck and everything will be fine. Awaken! Yes! Alright! Let's fucking tear this place apart, sunshine! Alright, uh, where do we start? Uh, ooh, I know, let's raid an ice cream factory. Uh, uh, let's, let's, uh, raid a NASCAR that's ongoing. Just run into all the cars, they can't stop you, look at you, you're fucking brilliant. Alright. Let's see... You are to obey all my orders. Hey, you just follow me into the laboratory. I don't know what I want. Um, it's under my complete control. Um, Gollum, you are to obey all my orders. Yeah, whatever, bra. All right, well, let's get going. Eh? Oh, you are to obey all my orders. Come with me, you stupid lump of crap. Follow me. Gollum, follow me into the lab. Come on, there we go. It's all good. Nimdok, oh shit! I was afraid I had lost you back there. Oh hi, it buddy. Is good to see you and our new friend. Oh, yeah. Um, hi, Doctor Mangler. How you doing? How did you escape the mob? How did you escape the mob? Did you forget that the compound has a secret escape route? Mm. But no matter. I see that you have revived the golem. I know, he's pretty great, isn't he? Look at him. He's great. I can, I can fucking start some heists, burglaries all over the place, and no one will be able to stop me. Even Hitler himself can't strike me down. You know about the golem? You know about the golem? Of course! Part of the master plan is to strip the lost tribe of everything, even their folklore. And their skin, by the look of it. I mean, look at this giant fucker. He's not going to take away folklore. He's going to... He's just going to take away everything. Uh... What is Project Perfect Image? I read the teletype. What does this mean? Project Perfect Image? That was a secret project in the area of reflective surfaces. Ah. It bestows the clarity to see yourself with utter objectivity. Unfortunately... It worked too well. He made a giant mud monster. You mean that it worked well enough to drive the leader into committing suicide? You mean that it worked well enough to drive the leader into committing suicide? The leader's oh my death God. is a serious blow to us all. But our golem is more than powerful enough to destroy the lost tribe. So I guess it's all fine then. As long as we got this fucker, we I can do whatever we want. 
I now remember everything with crystal clarity. Oh. The research comes, the serum. The spinal ah, fluid yes, serum. The it's youth serum. Your research yeah, I thought so. The Fountain of youth found in people's children. spines, children's spines to be exact. Was successful. Eternal youth for those who deserve it. <laughs> yes. Break their spines open and take the delicious fluid inside to live forever. It sounds like a plan. Now I know Am was able to keep us alive for so many years. Ah, there you go. Now I know how Am was able to keep there us alive. There you go. We're learning about so how Am's years. doing shit Your here. Your use serum can sustain us forever. We have all the time we need to resurrect the regime. Oh, excuse me. I I uh, just need a breath of fresh air. Excuse me, doctor. I farted. I'm sorry. I need to get a breath of fresh air. All right. Give him the mirror. Fuck you, son. I should keep this. I should keep this. Okay, then I will. Hang on. I gotta save first, and then load it because the music stopped. There we go. Uh, use oh the my mirror. God. No. No. I. There we go. Now you've seen the truth. Doctor Mengele is in a state of shock. <laughs> well, I guess that works. All right. Hey, come on, buddy. Let's go outside. Uh, kill Dr. Mengele. Tear him apart. No, just follow me outside. Gollum, follow me outside. Okay. Can we go to 7-Eleven afterwards? I've been frozen for a while. I could use a slurpee. I knew that you would lead us to where the regime would resume its atrocities. Oh, I can destroy the we Lost Tribe if I want. For what you did to us. You pay in blood. Why not? Gollum. Destroy the lost time. Tear him limb from limb. Ah. Oh, fuck. Ah. We have won. Um, that's right. <laughs> I am not redeemable. When I you give me a golem, I do terrible things. Research. Oh my god. I had hoped you would choose to carry on your research. Oh no, we did everything we were supposed to do and more. We only has this circle K. Oh my goodness. I thought I succeeded. Nimdok did everything you wanted him to do. But of course, we're gonna load that because that's not what you're supposed to do. Alright, here we go. Mirror time. Come on. Use the, use the mirror with him. Come on, you know you want to. There we go. Oh my god! Ah! No! No! I didn't know my face was so horrible. I can't move. Alright. Go on now, Gollum, we're gonna go outside. Maybe get you a nice ring as well, why not? Do, 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 do. Looks like Chewbacca. Go love them old pixel graphics. Alright, guard the bunker entrance, I'll return momentarily. To pay in blood. I transfer control over to the Lost Tribe. Gollum, I transfer control of you over to the Lost Tribe. Hooray! So, admit your crimes. Oh. Now the golem will serve the purpose oh. for which it was constructed. Golem, kill Nimdok. Oh. It was a really bad idea trusting you. It's the same thing as before. Only now I'm dead. Oh. It turns out you can regret all the terrible things you've done as a Nazi doctor. God damn it. Since you now identify with your victims. Well, I mean, it was either that or just, you know, use the golem to tear everyone apart. That's always fun. Alright. So here we go. It's TED time. It's time for a TED talk. Ah! Oh, God! Hey, you're my favorite baby. Me. You say that to everyone. Oh, I don't know. But not you, Ted. Even with that turtleneck and terrible haircut of yours, you're okay. I just now noticed that the villager has no mouth. I know, I just added that at the last minute. I thought, uh, why the fuck not? 
It was a bit of a quick job, but you know, it works. There's no mouth. He can't scream at all, but he really wants to. The Groom of Dark. So, uh, uh, Ted's scenario throws a massive dick move right at the beginning. You can actually completely fuck up his scenario. It just ends instantly if you pick the wrong answer to something. I can't remember what it is. Oh yeah, if you pick the wrong thing. Oh god. He looks like he's about to cry. <laughs> so overcome your fear. Enter the room of dark and can solve its mystery. So so far we've had we've gone through four of these and they've been pretty torturous, but welcome to Ted scenario where I swear to god Am just completely fucked up. I don't know how this is meant to be torture. You'll see what I mean. Everything nothing about this actually is bad. Video screens. Huh. Each one shows a scene of some other place. Huh. Why? What mystery does Am want me to solve? I said, well, get that sweater from... Screens have palm Look, you tied a sweater time. around your neck and you're wearing a fucking turtleneck. What's wrong with you? You are the worst person. Oh, God, no wonder you're here. If I were Am, I'd, I'd get rid of you first. Oh, fine, there we go. It's D5. That'll do the trick. Because I want to see what happens if I... Oh, hang on. Let's have a look at all these things. There's a clown I thing. I like to go into the circus. All those clowns with their phony grease paint smiles. You can't tell what they're really thinking. Well, murderous thoughts, of course. I mean, it, why would it be anything else? A castle right out of the Brothers Grimm. Yeah. I feel like there's something watching me from the windows. Oh my goodness. That's where we want to go, incidentally. We've seen that castle before. Back in Ellen's scenario, we saw it there. On the screen, which is great. You know, the kind of forest where you hide the body of a child. That kind of forest. <laughs> this looks like the tire swing at the farm I grew up on. Does Anne know well, it's obvious we want to make this a medieval adventure. So let's push that button. Let's do it. I'm going. Push the... No. Oh, push the monitor. I mean, it might work. There we go. Hey! Welcome to your doom. Oh my god. Just left me here alone. Look at how fucking twitchy he is. He's always looking left and right all the time. Uh, uh, yeah. Paranoid fucker. Alright. What's all this then? Alright. So many gargoyles everywhere. Alright, what else we got? We got the entrance, strawbridge. We gotta play some old Dungeons and Dragons today. Oh. You don't trust anything though, so what are you gonna do? Hello, Castle of Evil. All right, now I'm just gonna walk in. <laughs> so typical of the castles I've visited in Europe. Oh. Beautiful facade disguising ordinary stone. Appearances, everything. So yeah, uh, Ted's not exactly gonna have a rough time here. He's just gonna hang around the castle and do things. I don't know how this is meant to be torture, but this is probably the worst scenario by far in terms of all that. But oh well, have a look at some more things. Why not? Uh, so many women have called me their knight in shining armor. S somehow I doubt Never that. Ellen. Never Ellen. So this is the one scenario where we'll actually see Ellen appear. Looks just like Ellen. She seems Ev so everyone else is kind of separated from this, even though they were all together in the short story. But if, for once, we're going to see someone else appear, which is nice. That, that's fine. I'm fine with that. Uh, loading, because music is fucked. Oh my god. That's like the music is fighting the dialogue. I know. I know there's no way to fix that either. It's the worst thing. Ooh. Never realized that a knight's armor was so heavy. Oh. How were they ever able to fight? Now, I don't want to fuck this one up either. Though. You can you can sort of easily fuck this one up too. Typical Sierra games and their chicanery. All right, we got a doorway. What's in here? Oh, that's we found Ellen. Ellen. Did Am tell her that I loved her? <laughs> is that the secret he was referring to? So, this is the only crossover, and obviously it's not the real Ellen, but I mean, it's the only time we ever see anyone else enter a, someone else's uh, little little psycho drama here. Alright, I'm gonna save again because I didn't read the psych profile at all. 
I don't think I even saw Nimdox. I forgot to do that, but I'll have a look at this. Glossary entry. Journal. A... Well, a daily record of personal activities and feelings. Diary. Oh my goodness. Alright. Not that I needed to know any of that. But I didn't lose anything there. I'm gonna load it anyway. Alright, look how twitchy he is. He's just so worried all the time. Alright. Okay, focus now. Focus. Hello? Did Am do this? Did Am do this to you? A Am does everything. Why are you asking that question? I can't tell. They whisper in my ear and this bed is so soft. I never want to leave this wonderful place. Can you walk? No, I'm too weak. I haven't been out of this bed in ages. Oh, uh, do you know if there's a way to escape from this place? Is that a way to escape great. from this place? Huh. I won't let you die. I never will. No, I won't let you die. I can't take the suffering anymore, Ted. The things I've endured help me to die. There was, there was one time when the pillow was a little bit lumpy. Not even in death. No, don't go. I, we need you. No, no, just go back to sleep. Back to sleep. Yes, sleep. 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 Yeah, sleep is good. Good. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Alright, so I, I guess there's there's that. Um Oh my god, um I gotta oh no, I oh that's right, I didn't ask her about the mirror yet. I need your help. I can't progress with this game unless I do everything right. Oh there we go. Alright, um Why do you want a mirror? For some reason that helps me out. Everything's great. A mirror, eh? To do with my illness, I know it, but she doesn't dare come near me while I have the mirror. Oh, okay. So, where's the mirror? I left it on my dressing table. Bring it to me. Okay, okay. Uh, bring the thing. Um, I'm gonna look at the dresser drawer. Let's have a look. A few bottles, jewelry boxes, but no mirror. No mirror. I'm sorry to say, but it's not here. You might be doomed. Please tell me you found my mirror. Uh, no. I looked on your dressing table. The mirror's not there. You have to find it, Ted. It's God. the only thing keeping my step on the way, and it's the only thing that can so, yeah, finally end Ted, my suffering. So yeah, Ted's suffer. idea of torture is kind of strange. Why the mirror? Just, just go, back go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. Yes. Off you go. There we go. Okay, so that didn't quite work, because um, there was no mirror here. But why the mirror? That's a good question. It's it's the token of our quest, I suppose. Let's just save here, although I might fuck up, so I better be very careful where I save. Alright, um, I'm gonna go and have a look around, because there's things to see. Um, doorway, oh my god, there's all these things. Hang on, I'm gonna walk around a bit. Here we go. Despite the medieval trappings, I've seen kitchens like this before. Oh my goodness. This is a place where servants do all the work. Yeah, alright. Um, I don't think I'm meant to be here just yet, though, so I'm, I'm gonna be back. I'll be back in a minute, lady. I'll be back. Just just don't arouse any suspicion. We shall be fine. This looks like a chapel. Oh. something unholy. Something unholy. Where is that place? I'm looking for the place with all the bookcases and things. Oh my goodness. I hate the way you walk, Ted. You were just fucking weird. Oh, there we go. Sometimes you can't see doorways. There is an evil here. Alright. Um, okay. So we're gonna have a look around. Oh, let's look at the books. Why not? This is a collection of books on the black arts. Well, maybe it was a typo and it's about black tarts. Tarts made with ram's blood. Oh, well, let's just have a look. Uh... Demons and their s demons and their spears. I don't know. This is a count of the demons ruling the abyss. Huh. One of that's well. That's always good to know. Sergot. Sergot, the opener of locks. locks. Supposedly he can. Which would be great anything. in a Warcraft game, I'm sure. Let's see. What else says? Kitab al Azif. Mm, too bad I can't read Arabic. 
God damn it. Notes in the margins, I gather it has something to do with opening a gate into another world. Ooh. And what about In Search of the Philosopher's Stone? You're a wizard now. You're a wizard, Ted. I've read a fair number of science textbooks, but I can't make head nor tail of any of these formulas. Huh. Interesting. Uh, stop reading. All right. I've also got some things. What's in this? There's some glass? Pieces, Pieces of a broken mirror. Oh no, we might be in trouble now. But I guess I'll take it. I might be able to repair it, maybe. Here we go. I'm still laughing about the death threat over inventory bags. <laughs> that was great. Oh, that is fantastic. Bring me the bring me another sacrifice now. So I got some bloody glass, and that seems to be fine. I'm I'm gonna head off. I'm gonna head off. I think so far I'm fine though. So you know what? I'll, I'll put it in a d different slot just in just in case. I don't trust anything in this game at all. Okay. So now that we got that, um, oh, hang on, I know what I'm supposed to do. I didn't get the chalice here either. See, there's, a, there's an icon. I like icons. Well, it means you want it. Go on, take that thing. Boom, I got an icon. It looks kind of funky, it's weird. But that's all we need right now, I believe. Nothing tops the, we must get you out of here, but first, in the pocket you go. Yeah, that was the funniest thing. Benny falling down the stairs, that kind of stuff. But yeah, I, I swear, that was the best thing. Just, alright, I've got two women in my pocket. What am I gonna do now? The woman being comically slurped in the guy's pocket, just... I'll get you if it's the last thing I do for... Alright. Um... So I've gotten the religious icon. Oh, okay. Now, see, I just need some reminders every now and then. I will use this thingy on you. I don't know anything about magic. Oh, that's right. I need to read up on magic before I can actually use it. Hang on. Hang on. I'll sort this out. Boom. Okay. So let's go to the doorway. Yes. All right. Um. Wait. I've forgotten how to do this. Hang on, uh, end of the chapel on the right, take the religious icon, which I don't know Use the icon on the back and front. Oh, the front. Oh, okay, no, I see what I've done now. You don't use it on the armor, you use it on the door, which makes sense, I suppose. Here we go, broken door. Hopefully this works. It's almost perfect. Why would anyone think to do something like that? That's just ridiculous. Alright. Um, uh, alright. Uh, use the icon to the broken door, repair and push the student bar in front. Oh, right, of course. Now we want to push the armor in front of the door. There we go. And now it's blocking the way. And that's all we ever wanted. Okay. And now probably the most absurd part of this quote-unquote psychodrama that we're in. Uh, oh, I better save here too. This is where it gets just fucking ridiculous. We're like, um, is Am really punishing someone? I have no idea. Alright. Gotta save here because something could go wrong, you never know. Um put this, what's this? This yeah. oven is similar to the boilers I maintain in St. Louis. St. Louis. Oh, I hated those days. <laughs> it's like I was I was so filthy by the end of it. I hate that. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we've got a maid here as well. <laughs> Come on now! Uh, yep, yeah, okay, Ted, you stay focused now. Why does everyone have their fucking problem? Benny is obsessed with food, and Ted, he's just got an eye for the women's. Excuse me, do you work here? Why, of course I work here. Why else would I be fucking this chicken? Oh, I don't know, love. Uh, maybe because you're bored? I, yeah, I suppose so. There's not really, there's, I haven't seen anyone here other than Ellen and yourself. Talk about me. What is going on with that sweater around your neck? Uh, is there a way to escape? I need to leave. I'm double parked. Oh. Oh. 
sure. Uh, it was enchanting talking with you. Where can I find a mirror? I found glass or a broken one, but... Oh, that's why mirrors are hard to come by here. So the lady of the castle is horrible and hates mirrors, so that's... That's not so good. Um, I need to find a mirror. Please, I need to find a mirror. And you are what I need. Oh. I'll make a deal with you. I will tell you where you can find a mirror if you spend some quality time in my bed. Ah, oh, why not? <laughs> How can I possibly be such a lovely lady? Uh, sure. How can I possibly why not? be such a lovely lady? Lead the way. Lead the oh, way. you doll! My bedroom's right through that door. What, by the kitchen? Oh no, Ted, you've gone down the dark path. Oh. Uh, did I live up to your expectations? Are you right? Did I live up to your expectations? This this is nightmarish, Ted. You've done this before. It's not so good. This is this is Ted's version of hell. I don't understand at all. Oh, now tell me where the mirror is. Tell me where the mirror is. Oh yeah, no. Great, we fucked up. What do we do now? Oh, well, see, I'm not getting back in there now. It's time to change history. Let's load up and not fuck the housemaid. Why not? But it gets worse. Believe me, it gets worse from here on out. All right, uh, do you, do you work me. here? Do you work here? All right, I'm gonna skip through all of this. This time, just don't shag the housemaid because it it doesn't do anything for you. Is there a way to escape? Ted, your nightmare is 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 terrible. It's just the worst. Uh, all right. Um, I need to find the mirror. Okay. Uh, that's a flattering offer, but I'm not interested. That's a flattering offer. I mean, come on. You can do better than this woman. You can do better with, uh, than the wench just pulling feathers from a dead dead bird here. But uh, it's out of the question. Sorry, it's out of the question. What's the matter? Aren't I good enough for you? Not classy enough? Not rich enough? Yes, all three. I'm sure you're a fine woman, but my heart belongs to another. I'm sure you're a fine woman. You know, someone that doesn't look like she's going to punch someone in the face. Have I ever been with a woman who's always asleep? No. no. <sighs> I'm not going to make her. <laughs> All oh, right, anything but that. If you can fix it, I'll get you a mirror. Okay, fix the oven. Fix the oven. I think I can do that. Let's fiddle around some. Ah, oh, there's the problem. There's a problem. I'll You've got a dead badger in just, here. It's been so long since I've gotten dirt under my fingernails from good, honest work. <laughs> Ever since I left the campus with this outfit on. Oh, no, there we go. Fire's all nice and good. All right. I fixed your oven. Now fucking help me out here. Now where is the I fixed her Sorry. oven, if you know what I, I mean. Ho <laughs> ho. Oh my. Now I can finish dinner. <sighs> Why you used me, you bitch? Why you used me, you bitch? Just like you tried to use me, you snobby bastard. No, I really did. You used I... lots of women with your smug charm. You're nothing but a phony. I. Well, you know what? Uh, you've you've got my number. That's for sure. All right. Uh, no, I better I better start talking again. No, I need to find a mirror, please. I need to find a mirror. Well, you did fix the oven. Yeah, it's not like I did it for free. God damn you! Okay. Where can I find the old woman then? Where can I find the old woman? You might try a bedroom. She's always studying her books. Hmm. Oh. Alright. He honestly looks like one of my art professors in college. <laughs> I mean, he really he just looks like the worst kind of person. Um, alright. I think I'm done here, though. Um, oh, yeah, I remember now. I'm good. I'm good. She does... She cannot decide what she... What she does and doesn't know. Every time. Alright. Have I missed something here? 
feel like I have. Um, let's see. See, I always forget this part here. Oh! Uh, hi, Satan! Uh, how are you going? Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, things just took an odd turn here. Hey there, devil. I'm a devil, of course. Why else would I have this pointed tail? Well, you got me there. Uh, what the fuck do you want? Hell's soul. Oh. What, hell? Hell, uh, I guess that makes sense, sure. <sighs> Satan's a snappy dresser, who knew? <laughs> he looks looks pretty pretty dandy with that vest of his. Who's this Sir Gart guy? The guy who unlocks shit. He's a minor spirit, a demon. Don't confuse him with those pathetic imps or him from the higher order devils. Oh, Oh man, that would be really handy. Especially if I lock my keys in my car. Sounds like you really hate demons. But you are a demon, are you not, Satan? You got that right. In fact, the only things we consider worse than I'm no demon, I'm a fallen angel, goddammit. Okay. Can beings as powerful as yourself stoop into if fighting like school children? <laughs> How can beings as powerful as yourselves stoop to fighting like school children? Well, it's like this, big boy. In hell, we do things exactly like you do them here. Or used to do them before Am took over. Okay, well, are you saying Ham is in control of hell? Saying that Am that would make sense. We're in the center hell? of the earth. Oh, don't look so surprised. Who else could be in control of this madhouse? Only man could create such a monster. God Sorry. damn it. I should have known. All right. What do you mean? Please go do away. Like we do here. I mean that there are always internal struggles. If only that worked. Just the devil power. shows up, just only please just case, bugger off struggles are and don't come back. That you can't see or might rarely see. That means serious problems for you. Oh, why don't I need more of them? Uh, what problems can these unseen struggles cause for me? You must decide who is your friend and who is your enemy. Oh and god, do I have remember, to? With Am's right now everyone looks like a fucking asshole. Fields. Appearances mean nothing. Ever driven down the highway leading into hell only to have one of those tiny flappy demon bastards spud all over your windshield and you had to pry it off? You'd hate him too. Please go away. Please go away. <laughs> Try Get to lost, fucker. My position. I can't leave because there's an angel coming to take away her soul. Oh. If I step out and your friend croaks, the holy eunuch spirits the goods off to heaven. Oh. Uh, okay. Bye. <laughs> it's by Satan. Oh no, I definitely forgot to do something there. Oh god, uh, Satan, why are you? Why do you exist? I I wish you didn't. Okay, there we go. I'm missing something here. I'm sure. Uh, Ellen, uh, Satan's here. Please tell me you found my mirror. I haven't, but um, I can't let you die. The devil's waiting to take your soul. I can't let you die. The devil is waiting to take your soul. Oh. And not just by them. Oh, by who? The yellow jumpsuit man who raped you in the elevator? I mean, you know, he was a digger, but I don't think he took your soul. Um. Go back to sleep. Sleepy time now. Okay. Just don't die. We're, we're working on it. Just go away, please, again. Please. Try if I. All right, hopefully I can sort this out. Hang on, I'm gonna walk to the doorway and I expect good things to happen. No? All right. Uh, I don't know. This is this is always the confusing part for me. Even the walkthrough isn't very clear about this. Oh, here we go. The Lord of the Castle. See, I never checked out this doorway at all. Hmm. It's quite the bed. So if you jumped on it, there'd just be this giant cloud of white, and that'd be great. In some depictions, Devil is is a chaotic nice guy. Oh, I can dig that. <laughs> Mad Magazine here, why not? Alright, let's have a look then. Don Quixote. I've read this novel. Huh. It's about a foolish old man who believes he's a knight destined to revive the golden age of chivalry. Alright, Faust. I know the story. It's about a magician who sells his 
sold to the devil in exchange for power. Ah, that's that's quite topical. Oh, and a journal. Looks like a diary. Okay, first journal passage. Rapid aging. Oh no. Damn, why did I get married to her so soon? If only I knew she would age rapidly. Fucking hell. I would have split the bill. It's like all I wanted was to free humans from his god influence. I really wanted to help, jeez. Oh, so Ellen's the daughter, or at least she's playing the daughter in this weird scenario thing. Must assemble a caravan. And then the caravan. Oh, there we go. For some reason, that was good. I'm turning greener. Di -di 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 -di. I'm turning into a snake or a frog or something else. Final passage reads: The forest has grown dark and overrun with dire wolves uh -oh. since my marriage. I doubt that even the full complement of men shall return. Well, now we know what happened to the man at the house. That was not such a good journal. I'm, I'm closing that. What else have we got? Mort de Arthur. This was one of my favorites. You're about to hulk it's out. I know, that's the best thing. You could also be turning into the Grinch. Both of these work. Symp symposium. This is Plato's diary. Oh, Plato, what didn't he know about things? He invented the plate, after all. Embracing Shrek as your lord and savior. We're getting Shreked. Epic journey through hell, heaven, and purgatory. These, these all have a very similar theme to them. I'm gonna stop reading now. Oh my goodness. Uh, the door. I'm walking to the door. Here we go. Is Lady Ellen prepared? Oh, there we go. This is what I was hoping for. What is going on here? She will ever be. The spell keeps her body weak, but she will remain conscious. The art we should not hold this conversation as loudly as we can. What up the glamour? Invented the toe as well. We wait for <laughs> Plato. Invented the plate and the toe. Deference. Then we wait for a prince. Oh. With his help, we can open the gate to the other world. Let's do exactly what they, they asked me to do. Hello? Are there people here? No? Where did they go? Where did they go? I'm going to save because we've actually made some progress. So I'm going to save over five now. Boom. All right, well, hmm. They're nowhere to be found, but I'll have a look at some things. They must have gotten out of here somehow. Let's see. It's so unlike Anne to provide light when he knows how frightening the dark can be. There must be. He's up to something. He's up to something. Let's use these things. It's bolted to the wall. No, okay. What about this one here? There's one here too. Oh, there we go. Passage. Oh, see? It's waiting for me up there. I don't think I want to know. I'm going to save because I'm frightened. And then I'm going to load it because the music stopped. Alright. Oh. There we go. Secret passage. Oh, I like where this is going. It's the witch. Oh my She's god. Some kind of incantation. Or, you know, she might be blind. Hello? Is somebody there? I can't see anything. Uh, alright, sure. Hello? It's brown trousers time. Uh, what have you done to Ellen, you old witch? What have you done to Ellen, you old witch? Ah, our prince has finally arrived. That's, now that's me. Now we can begin our ritual. Oh, what, wait, what are you, what are you talking about? Why am I a prince? prince. Look at me, do I look like a prince? To Ellen, her prince charming. I look like I've just I left college early. To break down the college in San Francisco. It's a part you played many times oh my in god. The real world. Is this what she's doing? Let's have a look and see what this is. What is this? Let's have a look. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, yes. That is exactly what she's doing. And now I have to actually put that in the street. Oh my god. That is absolutely it. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, that is classic. Hang on, here we go. Load that thing, open that thing, bring him in. Yeah, that's more or less what she's doing. 
Yeah, summon the demons. This is oh my god, it's <laughs> demon everywhere. I'm just gonna leave him there for the duration of this scene. Oh, he stopped. Don't stop this guy. Oh my god, hang on, I need to restart that. Hang on, you just refresh it. Boom. Classic. Look at him go. <laughs> Whoa, what ritual are you talking about? Yeah, but even even Exchange for safe passage through the gate. Oh, okay. Uh, what's this about a gate? What's this about a gate? The gate is a passage into the surface world. It is oh. the only way out of this place. Oh, okay, sure. Must summon Satan. Um, what's supposed to be my role in this ritual? Ritual. Ritual. I need you to destroy Ellen's mirror. Oh. She has been using it to keep me away from her. I want you to break it so that I can complete what I have started. Oh, okay. Is there another way? Let's see. So you just want me to break the mirror? Why can't you destroy the mirror? Where's Ellen's mirror? What's in it for me if I help you? What's in it for me if I help you? An opportunity to escape Am's tortures forever. Ooh, I like that. Perhaps there's something else I can do for you instead. I mean, we know where this is going. Perhaps there's something else I can do for you instead. Well, it has been a long time since my husband left. Oh, dear. If you can satisfy my needs as a woman, then I will help you escape. Okay, sure. Uh, you've got a deal. I'll make love to you if it'll help you. Yeah. I'll make love to you if you'll help me If you'll help me escape. I was merely testing you and you failed miserably. Oh. What would Helen say if she found out how easily you would betray her? Oh, I mean, Still, I Still, you're my only hope for destroying that mirror. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, are you sure? Oh, God. Uh, let me, uh, let me think about your offer. Think about your offer. Do not think too long. The forces <sighs> at work here are not patient. I thought you could sleep with the witch. I, I've completely forgotten this. Oh, well. Never mind. Whoop, 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 whoop. Let's fix everything. Okay. Um. Hello again. This time we're gonna say we're just gonna fucking murder her. Ah, our prince has finally arrived. Now we can. Okay, okay. Um. Ritual. Just catch up to where we were before. I ought to kill you instead. Oh, mind you, I'll ask about the gate first. I need... I want... Okay, and now I'll kill you instead. Kill you instead. You won't have oh, sex with me, I know that. Do we ourselves the Avenging Knight? My magic is much more powerful than any physical force oh, you can no. master. Oh, no. Be gone! Uh, sure? Oh, hang on, I buggered this up because you're supposed to talk about the, the Satan. Hang on, um... It is not that simple. The mirror holds great power. It can be broken only <laughs> I don't have the responsibility to wield that kind of power. Why can't you just wreck it yourself? Because seven years bad luck, I am idiot. Aging rapidly, and despite my powers, I am a slave to vanity. <laughs> I can't bring myself to look into the mirror. <laughs> okay, sure. Uh, it is on her dressing table. No, I looked there. I looked on. Table. The mirror's not there. You must find that mirror. It has great magical properties. Well, you told me where it was, and you were wrong. That I can complete the ceremony. Ah, <sighs> all right. Um, I can't walk in the gate without the mirror. There are others oh who God. have an interest. Weak in source. That mirror may be so the only way to keep meddlers from interfering. Okay. Um, what if I can't I find, can't the, find mirror? the mirror? Then go to the devil. Go to the devil. Oh. Funny you should say that. What's in it for me if I help you? An opportunity to escape Am's tortures forever. Hmm. Oh, there's something else. No, no, no. I ought to kill you instead. Kill you instead. Oh, ho, ho. do we fancy ourselves the Avenging Knight? Yes. My magic is much more powerful than any physical force you can muster. Be gone! Oh, all right. Never mind. I will save and I will load because I can. All right. So that didn't exactly work out. Ah, uh, well. So let's see. Um, 
burp, burp, burp. I will, I guess, oh, I gotta go back to the hallway and go and see the devil again. Hey there, devil. Okay, hey there, buddy. See, I was told that I should check you out. No? Okay, it's not that then. Satan's a dapper guy, he might carry a, carry a mirror to check himself out. Maybe. If I step out, okay. your friend croaks. The holy eunuch spirits the goods off to heaven. Ooh, I remember what I'm supposed to do now. I hope this works. If I've forgotten anything, I'm going to be a bit annoyed. Um, gotta go to the witch's room. Here we go. And now there should be some new books, I think. Do 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 do. Uh, here we go. We've got the secrets of necro necromonic su summoning. Oh my god. Ooh. Description says, complete the charm to the spirit. Break the circle or the spirit will escape. Andy, what about double double toil and trouble? Luckily I'm up on the Shakespeare. Ah. This book about witches. The spell really? The really? You have to be up on Shakespeare to know that? Thacker. Alright, well. I have an incantation of some sort. Among other things. Alright. I guess now I can confront the witch. Hopefully this works. Now I have a spell. Oh god, I have to use this every time? Alright, fine. Here we go. I am so ready for this. Okay. Slowly make my way to you. Hello? Uh, let's see. God, um... Oh, okay, no. I know all about the sleeping spell you cast on Ellen, and I'm prepared to use it on you. Yeah, you just tell her that. I know all about the sleeping spell. I'll shoot your knob off with lightning. I'm prepared to use it on you. Foolish mortal. Oh. You don't have the ability to use the spell properly. Oh. Uh, oh, don't I? Uh, oh god, we gotta get it right. We'll see about that. Kala Igma Krako. You may be surprised. Kala Igma Wacko? No, Thacko is the one. Oh, don't I? Kala Igma Thacko. Shit! Oh, I suddenly feel so. so sleepy. <laughs> she just goes to sleep. Alright, I'll be uh, taking your chalk. You're so smug about that. That's victory. Take me some chalk. Oh my god, foolish mortal, you uh, put me to sleep. Alrighty. So there we go, the witch will pass out and drop her chalk near the circle. So we'll drop her, uh, finish the... Oh. Okay, no, that's easy enough. Okay. Here we go, saving because we're doing good so far. This is pretty straightforward though. Let us use our chalk to complete the circle. Because that's not done yet. There we go. Hi, other demon. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, who the fuck are you? Ooh. Well, it just so happens I need to, to have some locks open. <laughs> sure. Uh, you're another Am then. Oh. A part that he doesn't know exists. Ooh, that's very convenient. Well, I guess he knows now. I mean, you're just kind of here in the open and all that shit. All kinds. Ooh. Ooh. Both of those are good. Um, what are you saying about a trade? I can return to my sphere of origin only if we complete a trade. Oh, okay. Um. If you give me something in return. Okay. Uh. Ooh, the surface world. Here we go. Now we're getting fancy. Now that's a tall order. And the only thing you've got is a Oh my god. I. exactly true. The closest thing to it in a world of five real people. Okay, sure. I guess. <laughs> even even he's like, oh fuck this, I'm out of here. We've summoned demon. I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> it's like, holy shit, there's actually a demon in here. I was just fucking around. I just, 
I don't want anything to do with this. I'm gone. Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. Oh. You say love has trading value. Love has trading value. That's really handy. Then I love you, Sir Gart, you wonderful demon, you. I can't do that. You've got a deal, Ellen's soul in exchange for the gate to the surface world. Uh, hmm, I don't know. Let me think about your offer. Think about your offer. Don't think too long, human. There are other players in this game. Oh, and I so matter. Keep my offer open forever. Okay. Um. Can you? Um. Oh, I know what I'll do. Hang on. I, I I kind of remember what I'm doing now. I've got to. I haven't checked the door yet, and the music's fucked again. It, it does that regularly. Hang on. Save. Yeah, should be fine. Saving over five. I've got six as well, so that's good. Oh god, I didn't even load it. Hang on. Uh, fix the game. There we go. Okay. See, here's what I wanted to do. I wanted to use the door. The door's locked. But we've got Sogart. He'll help us out. Hey, buddy. There is a door I need opened. Oh, come on. Walk to the door. There we go. Alright. We are nearly done with this nightmare. Thank God. Hey there. Uh, can you open regular locks? Can you unlock the maid's bedroom door? This is going to creepy places. Oh. Okie doke. Um, I will give you a shard of glass with blood on it. Enjoy. Hooray! Blood makes me strong. Open the fucking door. There we go. She better be naked in there. I'm not even requiring any pyrotechnics. The maid's boudoir is now open for your inspection. Well, that wasn't exactly as pyrotechnic as I was expecting it to be. I at least expected a little puff of smoke. Oh, I don't believe you can unlock the maid's bedroom door from here. You didn't even do anything. Well then, why don't you go down to the kitchen and see for yourself? Alright, fine, I will. Don't believe you, stupid fucking demon. I think you're full of shit. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Don't believe you. Being lied to the whole time. There's gonna be a gun in here. Just a giant anthropomorphic gun to kill me. Oh my god. Oh, here we go. He was good on his word. Okay. There's not much here to see, uh, except, hang on, I'll have a look at... A hope chest. That maid is eternally hopeful. They all <laughs> want their knight in shining armor. That stupid wench. Uh, we've got a broken mirror, of course. This is so cracked, I can barely see myself. That's the idea, idiot. Oh, oh, the tapestry. And look, there's Satan. He's got a mirror. And now we know where the mirror's gone. There you go, see? Now we're, we're, we're done here. We know the truth. God damn you, Satan. You're such a prat. Alright, I'm saving there. Let's confront Satan. Oh, he's got a lot of explaining at this point. Oh, hi, Angel. Can you help me out? Help a brother out here, please? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. You know, I was joking, but now... Fuck this. I've seen the tapestry in the main's bedroom. You mirrors. love mirrors, boy. Oh, all right. I know where it is. I keep it up my I rectum. Hit it before the angel showed up. Oh. I didn't want Golden Boy to use it to his advantage. You, you know I'm floating right over here, right? Where is Ellen's mirror? I hid it someplace good. Someplace where an angel would never go. Hmm. Now will you get off my back? Where would an angel never go? I'm not sure. It... Hey, I'm not done with you yet, Satan. Where is... I hit... Yeah. Now... Alright, I guess I'll talk to him then. 
Hello? Who, who the f okay, yeah, who the fuck are you? Do not fear me. I am an agent of the Lord. Oh, so I'm in real trouble now. Okay, what do you want? What do you want? Ellen has <laughs> Buddy, I'm right, I'm right here. And has come on now, I, I hear you. Paradise. I have come to guide her soul to heaven. Oh, uh, can you tell me where the mirror is? Can, can anyone in this fucking game? Is. No, I haven't seen the mirror. Of course if you I haven't. If I knew where it was, I would use it to get rid of my fallen brother. <laughs> hey, I'm standing right here. Come on, stop breaking my balls. Um, why is everyone so interested in the why fucking mirror? Why is everyone mir so interested in the mirror? Mirrors it's getting creepy. incalculable power in this sphere. They repel some and attract others. Oh, okay. Uh, what power does this mirror have over what her, then? What power does this mirror have over Ellen? It can bring about either her salvation oh. or destruction. Ooh, handy. now rests on your shoulders. Okay, uh, what can you tell me? What can you tell me about the devil? What can you tell me about the devil? Do, Do tell. Not listen to him. His Their brothers give them nerf bats. Fight it out with woe. nerf bats. Okay, uh, who is this Sir God I've heard about? Who is this Sir God I've heard? You've already met him. He opened Avoid the lock the for demon. you. He has caused us all trouble on more than one occasion. Even Satan? Please save us, Angel. Please save us. Fear not. Salvation is at hand. Oh, typical. I have to save myself, don't I? Fucking hell. Alright. It's time to start talking to you as well. Look, we're trying to sort this out. Please tell me you found my mirror. No, not quite. Um, your father went to find an antidote for your illness. Uh, uh, I don't know. There's an angel and a devil quarreling over your soul. There's an angel and a devil quarreling over your soul. Men it's have fucking been weird. fighting over my body for more than a hundred years, and now they want my soul. Please, <sighs> Ted, just release me from all this. I don't care what happens I've, to me I've anymore. I've lost my sharp, pointy bit of glass. I can't help you now. All right, sure. Just hang on. Please hang on, Ellen. Your father went to find an antidote for your illness. That was weeks ago. <laughs> He's, he's gone. Will never he was struck down by orcs. Uh, Alright. Who is this witch who lives here with you? Who is this why, why do you allow a witch to live with you? I mean, that's she's a really good question. Stepmother. When the ugliness infected her, she broke just about every mirror in the castle. <laughs> okay, of course. And she's evil because she was struck down with illness. Oh my god, go back to sleep. Go back to sleep, Ellen. Yes, sleep. That's what I need. Sleepy time. Alright. I'm gonna go back to the bedroom real quick. The other one. Um, let's see. Uh, I've forgotten which one I want to open, and now the music's fucked again, so hang on. Uh, uh, there we go. Uh, we can try both. I guess it doesn't matter which one I check. Which is not all bad. It can be alright. Yeah. Um, there we go. Yeah, the Divine Comedy. There you go. So this is where the devil hid it. He also wrote in it. Lol 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 lol. What a dickhead. Alright. So now I've got the mirror. I mean, this is great. Now we can save Ellen. This looks like an ordinary hand mirror. But I can't be sure of anything in this place. This is just the worst time to be at. Alright, uh, let's get to the door and get the hell out of Dodge. Alright, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna give the mirror to Ellen and everything will be fine, right? Hey, look at you. Hang on. Um, oh, do I want to give it to her? Yes, I will. All right. Here you go, Ellen. I found your thingy. Sleep forever. She is dead. Oh no! Wait. Not so fast, there, Golden Boy. Her soul is mine. I've waited longer. Oh. So oh no, there's... The, well, you can't both have her soul. Listen I'm pretty me, sure you can't split it unless this is Silent Hill 1. I'll pluck you alive before you take this soul anywhere. I'm waiting until I get it. You Fuck get you, Satan. Is a virtue. I will wait until yours runs out. Alright. You know what? I, f fuck this. Fuck oh, both of you. Have a mirror. You dickhead. 
take this. Now bat him over the head with it. Oh! <laughs> But I leave you with this warning. Do not break the mirror until you bring it and the devil into the charm circle. Okie dokie. Bless you, I was kind of hoping I could just keep the devil mirror and, you know, just use it as a weapon. Devil mirror. Oh my god. Rip in peace, Ellen. But at least she's finally found peace. Yeah, she'll be alright. Okay. What if you showed the mirror to the angel? Um, I don't think anything happens if you show it to him. I'm not sure. Probably, I don't know. I, I, I could look into that. Oh, all right, here we go. Actually, I can just load that, can't I? I didn't save, so I'll load the thing. Here we go. So I found the mirror. Okay, let's try using it on, here we go, on you. Time to sleep forever. She is dead, God. Not so but Ellen, Okay. She Shut up, both I of you. Wait. Shut up. There we go. Let me use it on you now. Vanity is a sin. <laughs> and so the mirror holds no power over me. Oh. Well, that's the answer to that. It does fuck all, but you're as vain as hell. My. Hey. Oh, fuck! Alright. So that didn't seem to do anything bad for us. Farewell, angel. Oh my god, that was that was odd, but sure. Okay, now all we have to do is just take Satan to the to the pentagram and fuck his shit up, and then that's it for Ted's scenario. We're all good. Click. Oh my god. Here we go. Let me use that mirror with the circle. Hit. Yes, I'm in white mode. With this demon. Oh fuck. <laughs> I brought you some company, Sir Garth. Some company, Sir God. Oh. That was damn stupid, human. Hell, you're not even human anymore. Not exactly. Uh oh. Not with being kept alive forever just to be tortured over and over. So you admit yes. it then, there's just no escaping. Alright, why why Am's responsible for our suffering? Of course he is. Oh. My Am's responsible for our suffering. Like all of our su suffering, really. You're ruining everything. Shut up. Oh, for God's sake, you too. You're, you're stuck together. You might as well learn to get to get along a little bit better. Don't you even think of touching me, you backstabbing demon? I'm the established character. You're not even supposed to be here. <laughs> when this sequence ends, you've co complicated the narrative, you asshole. Well, you open the gate first. Open the gate to the circle. Yeah, then I'll I'll erase the circle. Unless you're lying. Meanwhile, the devil's like, God, kill me. Anything is better than hearing this robot talking. Oh my God. And there you have it. Post-nuclear apocalypse world. And the, and the witch is up to. Oh God, I'm back in Star Wars again. Ah, Jesus Christ, help. <laughs> you tried, but you failed. Oh man. Oh god, and now we know the truth. There is no escaping this place, and even if there is, the world is forever gone. Uh, and I'm stuck in Star Wars, the Force, the Fast Awakens. <laughs> oh. Friends? Oh my god, we're at the end game. He widened a hole, did he? That sounds horrible. Okay. You must transform your physical body into a stealth virus. 
or two dollars. All right. Uh, we can pick anyone, honestly, but um, we're going to start with Nimdok. There's a reason for that. We will, but I, I might as well save here. I, I will be saving a lot here. We're going to be starting with Nimdok because, well, we'll see. Oh. This looks like the surface of the cerebral cortex. Hmm. Magnified many times, of course. Interesting. Oh. Well, let's have a look at some things. Incredible. A vast network of machinery the size of a city. Oh my goodness. All right, and what's this? This computer terminal is a magnificent integration of biology and technology. Alrighty. Um, let's let's use it then and see what we get. Enter password. Password. Of course, 1945, the year the truth came out about Nimdok's experiments. That has to be it. Can't be 1979, the year that the Angel of Death died in the Amazon jungle. That's just weird. Password valid. Oh, right. See, that's why we want to start with Nimdok, because he knows the password. Must hold great significance to us. Well, it was around about the time he was created, I think. Let's see. Run metaphor program. Let's see. About metaphor. In other words, it's it's what allows Am to create these really, really subtle metaphors throughout all of our experiences. Not as subtle as a train wreck. Mutilate. Oh dear. Don't know who the mutilator is. General oppression? Oh no, these are all locked. Hunger. Well, that must be Benny, obviously. Uh, mythic figures. They're all locked. Jesus Christ. All right. Um. Go open subject directory. Subject Benny. Subject Benny appropriated a Chinese war memorial, Washington, D.C. An intense drive to be the best earned him the reputation of being a merciless military commander. Ah. All right. That makes sense. He did kill some of his subordinates. Subject Ellen appropriated an Inksai Engineering, New York, New York. Panic New York, New York. Um, I think something else maybe triggers those panic attacks, but uh, I can understand if you don't want to keep those on file. Subject Gorister appropriated at Ruth Drive and Diner, Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah. Feelings of guilt over his wife's death have incited numerous suicide attempts. Oh dear. Subject Nimdok appropriated at the New Brazilian International Airport, New Brazil, South America. Oh. Prevented from continuing his outlawed research by a failing <laughs> I can't remember all the evil I've done. Oh well. I guess I can't do research anymore. Palm Springs, California. Exhibits paranoid tendencies despite wealth, good looks, and social connections. Why is he here? I don't know. <laughs> Why is he here? Alright. Oh, let's check uh, Am's email. Why not? Uh, access Newsnet. October 21st, 2012. Hey, that wasn't too long ago. Oh, well, at the very least, we can extend the bridge. There we go. Um, and that is about all we can do here, I think. All right. Oh, God, I better save. I don't trust anything happening from here on out. So here we go. ST7. That's what we're going to do. All right. Walk to the bridge. The smell of burning flesh. Oh. It's burst and back at the counts. Maybe it's this brain matter around me that's burning. I don't know. Hello? There's nothing here. Oh. Okay, now I've completely forgotten about this. Um. Um. Oh, I remember now. Um. Okay, so what we're going to use now, we've got all these items as you can see. We've got the. Uh, the Totem of Access, the Totem of Summoning, Totem of Clarity, of Entropy, Compassion, Forgiveness, and of course we've got the Psych Profile. 
So these are all little totems. These aren't actual real items, but we can use them to do things around here in Am's mind. So I'm going to invoke the, t the uh, totem of clarity, um, just so I can see some things. I do not know what to do with this. Walk to the circle. Hang on. Uh, look at the circle. The smell of. Um, I do want to invoke this, don't I? And invoke clarity with circle. I do not know. Ooh, I've forgotten this. Look at clarity. Oh my God! If you look at things, I make little sounds. Oh, still going? I would have given up on this nonsensical game at this point. It's it's gonna get worse from here on out. That's the best sound effect to describe where the game's going. Uh, look at the... Hmm? Oh, forgiveness. Why does forgiveness sound like a gunshot? Alright, um... That will accomplish nothing. That will accomplish nothing. Oh my goodness, so I've completely forgotten. Um... Uh, let's see. Um, okay. I've forgotten this little section here. I know I want to summon something. Um, I've forgotten. I know I want to do something here, but I've forgotten what it is. Hang on, let's let's try swallowing the the access. I will not eat that. I will not eat that. How can this game be so bad and so good at the same time? I know it's ridiculous. Um, I will try to use it's one of these. I know it's clarity. It has to be. I do not know. Uh, maybe it's something else. It could be anything. I do not know. Hmm. I'll try something. I've completely forgotten. I've got the bridge up. Got the bridge up and running. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, this game uh, is very old. It's very Sierra style, so you get lost a lot. And there's a lot of points of no return if you fuck up. It is hotter here than for the jungles of Brazil. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to... No, I'm supposed to do something here. There are many endings, uh, um, but they're kind of just the same thing over and over again. So what I'll do is I'll do the bad ending. Oh, shit. Oh, and now I'm stuck. I hate this. Hang on. Walk to nuke. Yeah, no, I, I got trapped. Never mind. It's T7 is it's nearby. There we go. It's just here, so that's all good. Okay. Let's see. Look at. Circle. Uh, maybe push it? I have no idea. Oh, maybe it's give. That's what it is. Is, is that it? It's got to be one of these. Hang on. Give clarity to... To... To what? Oh god, I've forgotten how to do all this. Hang on. Um... Take... Uh, I've, I've forgotten how to invoke uh, these totems. I've completely forgotten. This isn't helping either. Hang on. Let me just look into this. I need another walkthrough just to remind me because... Fucking hell. <laughs> fucking hell. Oh, this is just the worst. Um, alright, hang on, endgame scenario. Maybe I just need to read this a bit better. Um... Uh... Understand it's possible to beat the game by using one character and you can ignore the following. What's it here? I'm nearly listening. Okay. They didn't invoke any of the things here. I'm, I'm pretty sure you're supposed to invoke the Totem of Clarity here, but I just don't know why it's not working. I'm just going to light up another walkthrough and then just walk around a bit. There's broken glass all in this brain as well. That's never a good sign. Hello. Talk to the... Oh. Why can't I talk to things anyway? Hang on. Use circle. Can I talk to the circle? No. I'm confused. Maybe I just have to use something else. Have some compassion. I do not know. Oh, hang on. Maybe it's the chalk. It's summoning. Of course it is. Dumbass. Hello. Oh, um, I don't really have any money. <laughs> I have, I have three Deutschmarks, but they're useless. Will you take them? Show me the way out of here. Please. There 
is no way out. All right. Oh. Um. What do you know about the people who sent me here? Are you talking about the gamer? Because that's really that's really meta. Oh. Oh yeah, those fuckers. Some entities have pushed us in the right direction. Something drives us on. What do the Russians and Chinese computers what want? Do the Russian and Chinese computers God want? damn it. Joe's is such a great caster that he makes it better than what it is. Somehow I manage. I can make some terrible games remotely watchable. Somehow. If the good thing is, after this, I have other games in mind, so we're fine. If the Russian and Chinese are some oh, submerged parts of Am. Yeah, what the fuck are you? The you creepy grey demon thing. I don't know what you are and I don't care. I just want you gone. Who are you? I'm special. <laughs> I'm special. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. And special. Mom told me I was the best demon. I was good at unlucky things. Oh, what do you have to show me? Oh. People in pods. Oh. So spare people for Am to play with in case any of us die. Ooh, the lunar colony Does on the moon. About the lunar colony? No, but loser one and loser two. Then, oh. I think I've shown you enough. Now you must complete your end of the deal. Okay, you know. the of entropy, and I might be able to help. Okay, I'm pretty sure I don't want to do that, but let me just have a look at this one guide that I had real quick. Um, right, the totem of clarity, which is the same hand there. I think, um, is that what I Um. I refuse. Oh, hang on. Uh, what are these? Yeah, what are these totems? I wish I could ask someone before I fucked up and spent forever trying to summon you and failing miserably. Oh, there you go. Please, just get me off this fire. I'm burning my ass. Oh, how can actions take physical forms? can actions... Physical yeah, so I've noticed. Am is just, I know. <laughs> he just, he doesn't know what he's doing. He, he's like a hack writer in high school. <laughs> oh my god, um, why do you want me to give you the totem of entropy? Why do you want me to give you the totem of entropy? I, 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 I don't see why anyone would want something like that. Well, I don't trust you, demon asshole. I refuse. I refuse. Okay. You can keep oh, that was easy. Okay. Uh, why do you, why why compassion now? Because I must learn to love again. Okay, um, I think I can, can I use the compassion one? Hang on, let's have a look, um... No, no, I refuse that too. I refuse. We're gonna get the bad ending. That's fine. We'll be okay. Oh, we don't have a choice. Oh, but we can keep it anyway. There you go, have some compassion. There you go. Shit. The program is now <laughs> No, beaten by the communists. Well, too. Now is your opportunity to defeat Am. Hooray. Talk to the ego. Talk to the ego. Wake the ego. Use the totem of forgiveness. Disable no more than the ego. Or your sub program will be purged. Okay. So I'm going to save here. Oh my goodness, um, I'm gonna make another save actually, I'm gonna go with, uh, bad ends, just so I know the difference between the two. Oh my god. Here we go, save that. And in order to get the most, see the bad ending is actually the one that's most accurate to the short story, so we're gonna get that first. And then we're gonna get what constitutes as probably the best ending in this. 
Okay, in order to do it, well, first of all, I'm playing as the wrong character. Um, I'm gonna have to get Ted out here, but I'll not, oh, we'll have to kill everyone off. That's easy enough. Um, let's see, I think I'll, f I'll be able to figure this out, I think. This place is just weird. All right, um, have a look at some things. There's a hole. This hole is artificial. Oh. It is some kind of receptacle. Put your knob in it then. No, all right. All right, let's just head down the neutral path. Nothing An to do angel? here. Such things don't exist. Perhaps it is a metaphor for something oh. else. Uh, no, but he looks like he's sleeping. I don't think maybe I, I want to uh, talk to him at all. It's Super Ego. Hey there, Super Duper Ego. How are you doing? It is not conscious. Okay. Um, is that on the Super Ego? Okay, here we go. Um, I'm going to save here just in case. There we go. Um, I am going to invoke uh, clarity? Yes, I'm going to use the clarity on the super ego. Hopefully this works. Wake up! Oh, I don't have the summoning either. Oh, okay. Let's see. Uh, um. So how come he didn't wake up? Maybe, oh, maybe I have to wake him up by talking to him. Attention! Yes, <laughs> Yavul! Akchung! No? Hello, human. Oh, hello, hi. I've been waiting for you to arrive. What up, Super Ego? Um... Who are you? I am... Am. <laughs> or more exactly, a part of him. I am Am. Primary components Who am you? By our human creator. Oh my goodness, um, how, how, how did I know, how did you know I was coming? How did you know I was coming? Predicting so much glass and the brain matter all around the place. I survey the situation, anticipate probable outcomes, oh my God. and act accordingly. Oh my god. This is, <laughs> Jesus Christ, this is just like, um, uh, Tales from Genesis space all over again. If you're a part of Am, why haven't you destroyed if me? That's a, a good question. Why haven't you destroyed me? Who do you take me for? My impulsive brother? You five are his playthings. Oh. You no. Know, long range planning is my concern. Oh, okay. Can you help me can find you them then? Help me then? Well, I help can't me. help you directly, but I can offer you some advice. Okay. So I don't want your advice, but. What advice do you have for me? Help Am work out his anger. Ooh. Take some on the chin, so to speak. Okay. Just don't let your fear get, get him a hooker. That could also work. Now, let me sleep and dream of the future. <laughs> dream of the future. Okay. Now, what we do is we use the clarity totem on this poor fucker. Have some clarity. Do you realize how powerful I am, human? And yet I'm doomed to eventually decay into a rusted pile of inert junk? Yes. What is the point of continuing this futility? It's a good I question. Think, therefore, I am not. Oh, oh God. Goodbye. He's dead now. Hello? Attention. Achtung. No. It is no longer operative. And now he's fucked. Um, all right. And now... Um, uh, I think now, if I remember, there's the there we go. Where's where's forgiveness? There it is. Now I invoke forgiveness on you. Awaken. Huh, that's confusing. See, I'm trying to look up this on how to get the the worst ending because I haven't done that in a million years. Um. to the id. Uh, compassion. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Where is Am anyways? And can we return to the physical world? Oh, I don't know. There's only one way to find out. Of course, we won't find it in this ending because I'm going to intentionally botch things up. Ah, of mass so many mass graves. So, 
this is nothing like the short story in that all five of us should be here doing shit to stop Am, but we are not. Gorister and Benny should be punching each other in the face and other things should be happening, but I don't know. Uh, okay, so what am I doing here? Hang on, I need to find... See, this is actually an area for... Oh, here we go. This is an area if I wanted to actually finish the game with a good ending. I haven't seen gargoyles since I visited the castles in my home. This place is obviously for Ted and not us, so we'll carry on. But yeah, usually you, you get these totems up and things will happen. Ram's head. What must this represent to Am? God only knows. Um, I guess we'll just talk to him and see. It's the ego. Attention! Hello! You want to harm me, don't you? Who are you? I am other. I am machine. Oh, you are also a ram's head by the look of it. Are you am? Um, I am a fragment. A lost piece. Ah. Part of an evolution. So just another bit. You are the ego. You're not so super, but you're still an ego. Uh You want to harm me? You want to harm me, don't you? I am incapable of hurting you. If you say so. I don't believe you. I believe you. No, just walk away. Walk away. We're, we're, we'll come back. Let's see. Uh, where am I going? Here we go. Look at the neutral path. Oh, God. Uh, I always get lost in this area. Okay, there's a neutral path down here. That's where I will go. Oh, my God. This looks like a research station. Oh, indeed it does. Look at this place. There's a door, some things. This cylinder is part of the machinery that makes up this complex. Looks very much like uh, Gorister's area, and indeed it is. What is that piece of equipment over there? Alright, oh, and we got this little thing. I don't know what it is. Well, let's have a look at it. A holographic projector. Ooh. I have read of such devices. Alright, well, let's just. Let's Type a bit on the keyboard. Here we go. What have we got? Huh. Hello. Have we got a woman. This image is of a woman, but I do not know her. So if we've got a hologram of a woman named Manya, whoever that is. Can you communicate? Hello. Benny, they said you were missing in action, but I knew oh. you would return to us. I've been saving this for you. Oh. oh my God. Whatever that is. So that's Manya. Um, I have no idea who the fuck she's supposed to be. Like a wife, an associate, a friend, whatever. But certainly wasn't in the certainly wasn't in the original uh, short story. That's for sure. As Benny was gay in the that short story. Is. Oh, hello. It reminds me of my so Benny has a wife in the game for some reason, even though he's gay in the story. I don't know. Homosexuality is not cool for the early '90s or the mid '90s in video games. So what are you gonna do? Okay. Uh, oh, we found the id. I was looking for the id. Attention. Achtung, Mr. Id. Oh, Make some software for us if you know what I mean. Oh, id software time. I was having the most wonderful dream about five tiny ants crawling across a stove that's about to be lit. Oh, you're definitely the evil part, aren't you, you dickhead? Who are you? I am a metaphor. This entire brainscape is what men made Am make it. Treat us as uh, you will. Okay, I'll just throw some rocks at you then, you fucking asshole. Um. What else can you tell the brainscape. me about the brainscape? Across the brainscape, cold Don't winds. Don't leave too many footprints the on the brain, please. Mankind. How delicious they are. Uh, okay. Uh. What do you find pleasurable about broken glass? What do you find pleasurable about broken glass? It does look a bit a odd. A scalpel dulled on the jawbones of a dozen friends to pull back the skin of a pinion. Keep in mind the early 90s head. video games are still young to and not taken seriously. Rise That's from true. Pulsing, twisted guts. Joy, a chorus of angels. You can hop into bed with uh, a wench in a castle, but no, no homosexuality in games, no. We're being a dude spying out, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Using a woman as a power source, that's fine. Are you going to help me escape from here or not? Are you going to help me to escape from here or not? Tasty morsel. Come close and let my tongue 
be our guide. Uh. No? Oh, fuck! Oh, that hurt! You dickhead! Oh, so, yeah, no, he's, he's an asshole. Not gonna have him that. So now we got the id, and uh, I'm gonna evoke the totem of forgiveness with the id, because that's what I do. Hang on. Totem of forgiveness. Or is it compassion? Hang on. Uh, Oh, the tide of compassion to give to the uh, to the id. Here we go. So I'm gonna go. Blip. There you go. You have compassion for me. I do. Me? The I'm a really nice guy. The of seeing your mangled body twist in agonizing pain for eternity after a hundred and nine years. Well, I mean, I did try to extract the spinal fluid from children, so I mean, I think we have some common ground here. <laughs> of having all this power and not being able to do a goddamn thing with it. Yeah. After all the punishment I've given you, my pain is still greater than yours. This <laughs> is pointless. Fuck. I, I thought you would hate me forever and I've, I've definitely fucked up. So we did that. That worked. Let's just carry on the path of evil, I suppose. I've taken a hit for the team, but I'll be fine. Alright, and then we're back here again, because the path just loops on itself. Okay. Uh, so we've given the id the compassion. Um, uh, oh, I read the wrong article. This is for the best ending. I want the worst one. I want the one that's closest to the end, to the real ending. Oh my god, yeah, I've done this all right. I was wondering why there was a problem. Let's see. Oh, here we go. I'm gonna screw things up properly. Here we go. Um, I've done this right so far. I shouldn't have done all this. I mean, half of us had a worse. We said, "Fuck to your mum." There was some very suggestive dialogue. There was such an Oedipus cl complex in that game. It was just the worst. Um. Oh, see, so I've, I've used the, the wrong thing with these people. Hang on. Um, I will save here, because this is not the bad ending anymore. This has become something better. This is the good ending. But I will save it. Yeah. Good ending. Oh, shit. Uh, see, we don't actually have to have to fail at any of this. Hang on. Um, oh, God, you don't know how to spell at all. Yeah, good ending. Anyway, oh. um, but that means I'm going to have to load this one from earlier. That's fine. Okay. Hi, guys. What did you do with the demon? Do not be concerned with the little one. <laughs> He's as much am as the aspect you find in each pylon. He'll be here. fine. We just disintegrated him. He'll live. I mean, not really, but you know. Claim his space if you are obedient. Ooh, I can be a demon. That'd be nifty. What can you tell me about <laughs> the lunar colony? Well, everyone's dead, so there's that. Or are they? I don't believe you for a second. What can I do to escape from here? Wink, the ego. Use the totem of forgiveness. Disable no more than the ego. Or your sub-program will be purged. Okie dokes. Um... What the... Okay, this is, and this is what we do. We... we... Really? It's that simple? Okay. I'm gonna use the totem of forgiveness. Please forgive me. On the... On the... Oh, God. Oh, no, hang on. This is... Yep. I can use it on these guys, but I don't want to do that just yet. There we go. They're, they're fine, I'm sure. They'll be alright. Now, which direction is the fastest way to the ego? That would be... Yeah, either way works. Tell them to walk it off, right? They'll be... Yeah, they'll be fine. Oh my god, I should I should kill myself and then come back as Ted though. That's what I should do right it now. Is here of I guess I will kill myself as Nimdok, why not? Why not? Just a minor An minor angel? case of death, it's alright. Such things don't exist. Okie dokie, and now oh the music stopped again. Alright, and this is this is the real bad one. Hang on, yeah, this is the real bad one. I'm so confused. But we're getting there. We're, we're making forward progress somewhat. Hello? I gotta wake you up. Alright, 
this is what I gotta do with it. No, that's the super ego. Bugger him. I gotta find the... Where is the regular ego? Oh, he's this little guy. Hang on. I'll find him. Ah, so many bad memories. Um, alright. Hang on, with this, I... I know what to do here, I think. Um... Let's see, um... Take the, yep, take the middle one, I remember. So we're gonna actually take a skull this time around. It's gonna hurt me a bit, but that's fine. Ow! There's an arm! Fuck! Shake the hand! Shake it! Please! I need candy! Alright. And we're just gonna take the hand. I am so sorry for what <laughs> I have done to my people. How I'm sorry, disembodied hand. You have much to answer for, Nimdok. But acceptance of your heritage is the first step towards atonement. Oh. The rest of that road lies ahead. Oh dear. Alright. And there we go. There's there's uh, Nimdok's totem. Um, but before I... Yeah, before I do... Oh god, I'm getting so confused. Hang on. Um, before I do this... Because essentially what you want to do is kill him off. Bye. What I want to do is... Ugh, I'm so confused. Okay, there we go. We found the ego. Um... Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm just trying to wrap my head around how to do this. Um, because there are multiple ways we can go about this. We can go about this in multiple ways. Um, oh, I might as well use this workstation here as well. This is why you want to start with Nimdok, because he can unlock everything. Let's see, um... Power node. There we go. We're not going to use that though, so we're going to log off. Oh my god. Okay, whoop. There we go. So we actually need Nimdok to use this though, because the holographic projector... Benny's an idiot and he can't do anything. Uh, I can look at it though. I don't know, don't know who she is, but oh well. Doke. Um, I have to go back now to Mr. Ego Man. I think I've done everything as Nimdok, so I'm going to save here. Boom. Save. Fantastic. Alright. Awaken Ego. Please. Please. Attention. Here we go. Oh. And who are you? Who are you? I am other. I am machine. Okay, um... I, I, oh, we've already talked to the ego before. All right, um... You want... You want to harm it. Uh... Just walk away. All right, uh, and what we want to do is... Use the... Hang on, go to the... Invite the totem of for forgiveness on the ego. Okay, here we go. Totem of forgiveness, which is this thingy with the ego. <laughs> <laughs> After what we have done to you, I'm so confused. Illogical reaction, unable to compute behavior matrix. Oh right. Execution halted. Well, oh, oh, we did something. We did something. All right. And now we actually did exactly what the Chinese and Russian computers said to do, but we're not gonna. Oh god, we're not gonna end this here. Hang on. Oh shit. Uh, neutral path. Neutral path. Everything's a neutral path here. So what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of Nim Nimdok now because we don't need him anymore. It's time for you to go away. Um, I might actually just get rid of everyone and then just do the bad ending. All right, hang on. Uh, walk to the end here. And doo -doo -doo. All right. Time to use my totem. Use the pillar. Yeah. Ow, fuck. Use the pillar again. Keep using it. Ow. What? And now he's gone. As he always thought he deserved. Alright, we're going to send in... I think we want to send in Ted right now? Alright, here we go. Thank God for that. I've been tricked. Why? Why am I here? Where is Alan in the dead body? Oh no. Oh fuck. The Chinese and the Russians have fooled me into helping them. Oh fuck. 
and welcome to Bad End, number one. I thought that I could once again play the so this is what closely mimics the end of the actual short story, where all the characters are dead except for Ted. But unfortunately for Ted, he doesn't get to die. Oh no. Lucky, lucky them. Am is all the matter for that. It makes me happier. Yet Am has won. Am has succeeded. Look at my little, little wiggly tentacle arm. I must scream. Actually, every character in the game has that little ending dialogue if you end with them. Oh my god. So there's the most depressing ending ever, and that's the closest thing to the ending of the actual story itself. What a rip-roaring good time. But of course, this is a video game. We want the opportunity to succeed. So we'll just load our good ending save again and fuck things up real proper like. Ooh. Oh my god, maybe I'll, we'll see the credits when we actually finish the game. Oh my god, and it just quits. Oh my goodness. Now I have to re... Oh god, I hate it when they do that in games. Okay, now I have to restart the game. Here we go. Oh. Which of you five yeah. would like to play? Well, right back where we where we left off. No, if you didn't save, you have to start all over again. Uh that's okay. So which one is it? Good end load? I hope this is it. Oh, yeah, I'm missing all the stuff, so this is probably the right one. Okay, so we've done that. Um yeah, there's not really anything else. Although I, I would like to get everyone Everyone's, yeah, We're, there's no closure for any characters if we end it here and now, so I guess I'll, I'll finish the, I don't know, what am I going to do, and why is Gorister's music playing, I don't get that at all, this is Nimdok's scenario, I think we've confused the game to death, oh well, um, so let's, um, just do what we did before and get rid of Nimdok, so we've done all this stuff, um, Okay, no. So we've got all these things. Um, I forgot what we had. There was a take the hand that appears. Okay, all right, cool. We're, we're making strides in the right direction. Hey there, uh, Super Ego. He's having a nap. He's good, he's fine. <laughs> he's just, he's hanging out. He's just sitting there in his little tube like Zordon. Power Rangers ain't getting no help today. All right, so I didn't do any of this. Okay, now I'm super confused, because now I've got uh, Forgiveness, I've got Access, and I've got Entropy. Oh, that's right, I didn't take the skull, though. Here we go. Grab the skull. Oh, that wasn't meant to happen. Oh, my goodness. Um, maybe I have to start a little earlier on? Hang on, let's, we'll get through this. We just have to start again from from scratch here, but that's fine. Okay, so talk to these fuckers again. Now we're going to get the good ending, so all will be fine now. Fuck this. What did you do with poor Mr. Fuck, Mr. Demon thing? Me. He was such a nice guy. Oh yeah, I noticed the Earthers in the window out there. They really are on the moon. Please let me leave from this place. Oh god. Take me to the moon where I belong, sunshine. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna do this for real now. I'm gonna save this over good ending here so we actually know what we're doing. Boom. Okay. I loaded! Oh my god, you loaded that, didn't you, you stupid fuck? There we go, now I'll just make sure I get this right now. Good end. Save. Boom. I loaded by mistake. I'm so sorry. Jesus, but you have to understand this game is a massive clusterfuck. What can you tell me Oh, my freaking ears! The humans that slept on Oh my god. Do not concern yourself with them. They'll be alright. <laughs> they they knew the risks of being captured by an evil supercomputer from Russia and China. Oh my goodness. Alright, well I'm done with you, Chuckle Fox. Let's see. Save. Yeah, why Gorister's music? I don't understand that at all. Alright, so I've done... 
nothing. I've, I've raised the bridge, that's all I've done. So at this point, I'm going to use Nimdok just to raise the consoles and do all that stuff. But other than that, um, we're pretty much doing what we did before. Just it is hotter here than for the jungles of Brazil. This is where Alan's going to place a little uh, diamond in the receptacle there. But other than that, not going to be doing anything of interest. An angel? Such things don't exist. Perhaps it is a metaphor for something else. Okie dokie, well, it makes sense to me. Um, alright. Let us talk to him. I think we got it. I think talking to him is fine. I think we're supposed to do that, actually, Attention. to get this ending. Awaken, dick cheese. Hello, human. I've been waiting for you to arrive. That's, that's great. Alright, um... Let's see, let's see. I think I'm doing this right. Um, uh, find things, take the middle skull in the hand, the pairs of the totem. Um, I guess I can do this. Who are you? There's nothing wrong with doing this, it's fine. Or more exactly, a part of him. One of the three primary components. Oh my god, I don't know much about sports, but creators. you're a touchdown. I like it. How'd you know I was coming? Oh, how did you know I was coming? How did you know? Predicting I didn't indicate myself. anything at all. Um, if you're okay. Can you? Well, I can. Um. But uh, help and let's see. And oh, he is the doctor. He knows what he's doing. Um. All right. Let's all and do some things. Um. It's the ego pollen used the first choice. Um. Okay, so we've we've had a chat with him. I hopefully I didn't fuck this up. What I want to do, I shouldn't have talked to him at all. There we go. So what we want to do is take the middle skull, and this time it won't kill me in one hit. Ugh. Jesus Christ, that hurts. I am so sorry for what I have done. So now we just have to kill ourselves again. Acceptance of your heritage is the first step towards atonement. Uh, oh wait, we can't kill ourselves just yet. I keep forgetting these things. This is really fucking annoying. So we've raised his, his pillow, and that's all fine. What is it with pillars in this place? Bye. That's Ted's pillow, or at least it will be soon. Walk to the uh, thingy and oh, there we go. A ram's head. A ram's head. It looks kind of evil to me. Okay, we are nearly through this. Guy, keep hitting my head on this, and we'll this be fine. Like a research station. All right. Uh, raise the thingy. Here we go. Raise power node. Here we go. Select log off. All right. Go down the neutral path. Here we go. That's all I needed to do at the end of the day. Just use this, and then we head back to where we were before. Go. This image is okay, now just walk to the neutral pass and we're going all the way back and now we're just going to kill ourselves. Because it's the... it's the responsible thing to do. It's the Christian thing to do. Walking to the neutral path, wherever it is. Oh. Am I going the right way? Yes. Go. Alright. Oh, we're nearly through this. I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Alright, um, use the totem of access to the power node that appears. Oh, of course, I have to use the totem of access. Yeah! Very clever. Alright, um, now that we do that, we just, uh, zap him to death with the power node. Here we go. Bang it! Was not as strong as the previous one. But still pretty fucking strong. It still hurts. Ow. So this is what we want to do. Very slowly kill ourselves. Oh, finally in hell right where I belong. Choose another companion. We're going with Gorister this time. Oh. Christ. This is like the dreams I've had of splattering my brains all over Am's deck place. <laughs> Have I finally got Only with more broken it? glass and crap vintage electronics in a pit. Alright, so now all we have to do is just go to... Yeah, this this ought to be short. We're just going to go 
and head to the hollow projector and do some things. There's something about it that reminds me of when Edna was trying to sweet talk me into taking her down off the meat hook. <laughs> it looks just like my my uh, my uh, uh, mother-in-law. That fucking face. All right, walk to where? Where are we going? Where are we going, game? I have no idea. There we go. Neutral path. You'll notice the heart doesn't have a watch in it. It's the weirdest thing. Oh, yeah. That's very, very astute of you. Look at that. You figured it out. The air is cold here. Like the freezer back at the honky tonk. Yeah, see, I think you've figured it out now. Let's use this little workstation here. And let's open cylinder number one. Cylinder not operative. Yep, oh, alright. Try number two. Cylinder not operative. Number three, then. Automaton prepped for programming. Oh, hello. Uh, let's see. Defend and follow program. I don't know. Select log off. Automaton not responding to programming. God damn it. Um, alright, I'm gonna log off for now. Activate the Oh, use the totem of life. Here we go. Hey there, dear. Have a heart. There we go. Oh. Well, oh, there you go. She turned it on. Well, thanks for letting me know. Jesus Christ. You left it pretty fucking late, though. All right, let's use this this thingy now. Ow! That shot wasn't as strong as the last one. I don't know why all characters say that, because what do you mean, the last one? You weren't shocked before. Ah! That shot wasn't as strong. Just keep shocking yourself until you're dead. And then we're moving on to another character. That shot wasn't as strong. This is close enough to where we need to be. Oh, my God. Ah! Hooray, I unlocked it on my Steam profile and everything. Alright, another descent. Um, uh, we're gonna go with Benny, I think. Sure, why not? Benny's not Jesus. white, unfortunately. He's just light this green. This is more sickening than that bloody mess on Hamburger Hill back in the war. <laughs> so much death and destruction. Oh god, so much brain matter with that glass face. embedded. It has the satisfied look of having just eaten a feast. <laughs> yep, that's our Benny. He just does not fucking stop thinking about food. Jesus Christ. One track mind. He is he is the Oprah Winfrey of this game, I swear to God. Alright. I'm starting to feel hungry. Is there <laughs> anything to eat around here? I'll just eat some brain matter, you know you want to. But there's my dead wife. Uh or something. Manya, it's me, your husband. Benny. They said you were missing in action, but I knew you'd return to us. I've been saving this for you. I'm, I'm so sorry, Manya, but uh, there's something I have to confess. I'm I'm gay. Oh, uh, what do I do now? Um, even even the walkthrough said didn't have a wife because he was gay, but oh well. <laughs> Use the totem of love after she activates the node. All right, which is this thingy? I've got the the mango of love. Enjoy it. You never told me you loved me before. You just used to spend all that time at the YMCA. You never told me you loved me. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure, I love you, whatever. All right, now we can use this and kill Benny. Thank God. It's time to go away now. That shock wasn't as strong as the last one. <laughs> I sure am hungry. <laughs> oh no. Uh, that shock wasn't as strong as the last one. Uh, but it still kind of hurts. Ah, gah. Now Benny has gone. No more war flashbacks for him. Another companion has failed. All right, Ted, it's time for you. For you time for you to make your final talk, if you know what I mean. Boom. The last Ted talk. This doesn't look like anywhere Anne has sent me to before. It certainly isn't the surface one. So you can actually finish this uh, with any character you want, really. Um, but. Honestly, I just I, I I would like to use Alan for the end because it makes sense. But oh well, as for me, let's just go down the neutral path. Actually, I've never played a game uh, end of the game where they all died. They all turn into a little. Uh, th there's the, the little slug thing that uh, doesn't have a mouth and it can't scream. And there's there's this ending, but I've never killed everyone before. I don't think it changes much. So uh, bugger it. Another angel. An angel. Why does everyone think the super ego is a fucking angel? Weirdest looking angel I've ever seen. Oh well. 
Okay, so we gotta go to Nimdok's scene, um, and we gotta grab a remote, which is hidden under the right skull. How are you supposed to know that is beyond me. That's not a good omen, but you know what is a good omen? Skulls. I'm gonna pick up a skull. I need a souvenir skull. Now, Jesus! Alright, but I got this. Take the remote control. It is an actual remote control. It's an actual object, even though everything else is like a totem. This is a real remote control, which doesn't make any sense to me at all. Remote control. Yes, very observant of you. Alright, this is where we need to be. I found a way back to the witch's castle. Okay, so now we want to look... Oh, here we go. Gargoyle time. Stare all you want, gargoyle. <laughs> I've got a remote control, which I guess is supposed to work with you. I... Nope, sorry, you're not really selling me on this, Ted. Oh, there we go. Oh god, there's lasers everywhere. I don't know, king of the laser swords. I don't know what's going on here. Um, alright. Now we're gonna use the totem of gallantry. Behold, the power of my mirror, I guess? Yeah. Alright, and now, thank god, this has been a long awaited thing we get to kill Ted. Off you go, you poncy asshole. Uh, oh no! No, don't burn my sweater! It costs more than my tuition into college. LV! Oh, I'm hotter than a latte! He's taking his secrets to the grave with him. Whatever secrets those were, I don't know. Oh no, I don't want to be binary. I want to be fluid, but all right, here we go. It's full on Ellen time. I've been transported to some kind of information network center, but it looks organic instead of electronic. Jesus Christ, I'm an <laughs> engineer, not a brain surgeon. What do they expect me to do? I don't know, but you're saving the game because I'm frightened. To end. There we go. Oh shit, no, hang on, I didn't do that properly there. There we go. To end. The real one. Okay, so here we are. Uh, nothing really to do here except, well, I mean, Ellen has the most work out of all of them since she's the last ca character here, but that's uh, good. That's fine. We're gonna finish this off for real. Girl. Yellow head. <laughs> well, I thought you were over the yellow thing. Come on. So now we want to get uh, something. Oh my god. Just flash on to- well, I mean, I'm sure he'd love you to flash on him. But an angel? Why does everyone think that the superego looks like a fucking angel? It looks like a nightmare. Ooh, I'm sleeping. Oh my god. There's a dead German scientist here. I'm gonna take this one. See, now we're gonna take the skull on the far left here. And underneath will be something nice. Oh god! Oh, I nearly died, but I'll be alright. I got this. I got this thingy here. There we go. I got a gem, and I know where I'm using that. Uh, I'll be alright. I just, I, I, you know what? I've got third degree burns on the inside of my body, but I will be fine. Trust me on that. So we've got that sort of subtle Egyptian thing. Everyone's got their own little theme for this area in the end. Alrighty. So, um, we got to pop the gem in the hole, of course. And that raises the top. That raises that. So now we've got a pillar, but we're not using this one, obviously. Uh, use the totem of valor with the pillar. Jesus. Sweet gee, buttery Jesus. Alright. So now, instead of killing ourselves, uh, we're gonna go back to the bridge where the demon was. Um, uh, oh god. Um, no, no we don't. I wanna walk... Oh, I've got to go to the ego. Sorry, never mind. I'm, I'm, I'm all right. I'm doing fine. I'm doing fine. I talked to the, yeah, that's the super ego. So I won't talk to him just yet. I didn't use any totems on him, so I think that's fine. As long as you don't do that. Hopefully, I can still get away with this. Oh man, there's so much brain and glass here. It's the worst. Hmm. It's strange. It's like it's not meant for me. What is going on in this place? 
careful with this dude. He's yellow. All right, so I found the ego. Um, uh, first try to get the one about harming so Okay, hello, Mr. Ego. Lego, my ego. Yo, wake up. <laughs> wake up, Dick Cheese. Who are you? Oh. I am other. I am machine. Oh. Okay. Are you Anne? I am a fragment, a lost piece, part of an evolution. Makes sense. Uh. You want to harm me, don't you? I am incapable oh. of hurting you. If you say so. All right, so. I don't believe you. Go ahead and hurt me. I believe you. No, just walk away. Um, okay, now we want to use the... Oh. Use the to get the one about having yourself walk away. Use the forgiveness totem with the... Okay. So we're going to use the forgiveness totem with Mr. Ego here. Forgive me. After what we have done to you, I don't understand. I wanted to use your skull as a drum. Oh man. There we go, and now he's shut down, which is great. And now uh, we do the same thing we did with the Super Ego and all of that junk earlier on. Uh, what's the fastest way to the Super Ego? I think we're fine just going this way. It's a little bit out of the way. We'll be fine. Eh, where's the neutral path? There we go. You click on the mountain bit there, and even though she walks that away. Hello, Super Ego. How you doing? Yo, wake up! Wake up! Come on! I'm sorry, human. As I told you, there is nothing more than I can do. Well, you didn't really if you can say anything to me, me, but okay. Forced to carry out my orders and take action against you. Oh, okay. Uh, use the totem of clarity with the super ego. Thank God, I've still got that. There you go. I can you see clearly now the rain has gone. Human, and yet I am doomed to eventually decay into a rusted pile of inert junk. I now understand. What is the point of continuing this futility? Shutting down. I think, therefore, I am not. That's right. Piss off, Super Ego. Nobody likes you. All right. So now we have to go to the id and deal with the id. Only this time we're not going to dick around with the id. We're not going to fuck around with him. I might as well save though, because I think the music's gone again. It, it, saving, loading, boom. Neutral path. Oh no, the music's gone for good. No, there we go, it's fine. Okay, um, so we gotta go to the id, of course. Um, oh my god, ask about the uh, thing, yep, alright. We're nearly at the end. Oh my god, we're nearly at the end, and I can finally play some Eeb. Oh. There's something about it that reminds me of... <laughs> he looks it's like my rapist. Elevator. It's true. I mean, everyone comments on the bad things. Like, Goris has said it looks like his, his mother-in-law, and... She thinks it looks like the rapist. I mean, you know, it's really weird. It's really weird. Okay. And Benny was like, oh, he looks like someone who's eating something. Because fucking Benny. Just fucking Benny. Hashtag fucking Benny. All right. I guess I'll talk to you, Mr. Id Bastard. Hello. How you doing? Yo, wake up. Ooh. Oh, I suppose it's time to wake up. Oh. I was having the most wonderful dream about five <laughs> tiny ants crawling across a stove that's about to be lit. Okie dokie, then who are you? Who are you? I am a metaphor. This entire oh, we've already tree. seen this, so all right. Um, so much glass here. Why do you find pleasurable about broken glass? Not, not even the the elevator rapist went that far. Of a dozen friends to pull. Um, are you going to help me escape from here or not? Um, nope, just walk away. Um. Wait, have I, have I done everything right? Yo, wake up! I will pierce you. Oh, oh god, that wasn't supposed to happen. Fuck! Now everyone's dead. So there's that ending, I guess. You done goofed. I thought that with my knowledge of computers and engineers, we could shut them down. Oh, but we couldn't. Maybe I really am just because the general woman, just as Am said. <laughs> oh, Am. 
Oh no, now she's turned into a slug too. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't know if there's any rapists out there that can turn you into a slug, so I'll, I'll give you that. I will give you that. Hashtag triggered. Hashtag slug worse than rape. I'm gonna have to agree with you on that. If you're a slug for the rest of eternity, that's, uh, that's shit. Oh, take that, you sneaky little sluggy thing. Oh my god, don't fuck that up. Oh my god. That's great, though. I have no mouth and I must scream. But that means we just have to restart again. God damn it. Here we go again. So there's that ending. So if you fuck up and die, it, basically the last person, yeah, turns into a slug as well. So now I know that. We know the answer to that one. Oh my god. Oh my god. There we go. Let's get the real ending now, please. That's all I want for Christmas. Switch Speaking of which, five. Christmas is coming up soon. Oh my god, so much to do. But hey, we're not even done with Shocktober yet. And my god, I can't wait for Silent Hill 2 next week. But for now, we have to do this. <laughs> we have to do this. Hey there, Mr. Id. Yo, wake up. All right, uh, let's just talk to him and be a dickhead. Who are you? Who are you? Can you help me? Can you help me? Only you and us do this. Okay, what can you tell me about? Can you tell me about the brain well, That's weird. The Alan now has Gorister's theme as well. What's going on? Bring me the sweet sense of mankind. How delicious they are. Oh, okay. So this time, we find pleasure about broken glass. The... Okay, just walk away now. Finally. Give him some fucking compassion to work with. Be nice. You have compassion for me? Me? Yes, I love you and your face. Your mangled body twist in agonizing pain for eternity? After a hundred and nine years of enduring Oh, come on, Harlan Ellison. You're trying too hard to sound you evil. You can see my pain. The pain of having all this power and not being able to do a god damn thing with it well i mean After yes that's that the too punishment i've given you all right this is pointless, pointless. <laughs> he's talking about everything oh my god he didn't even get the chance to read 50 shades of gray the poor blighter all right so we've done everything we've shut down all three of am's crazy shit so now all we have to do is return to the uh to the uh russian and chinese computers oh my god we've done everything we've had to we've only got the, uh, the totem of entropy left. And, oh, oh my god, that's all we're using now. I'm just gonna save here. Continue playing, that's all good. All right. Here we go, walk through the bridge. Oh, and there they all are. Rise against your master and you will be eliminated. So it's, it's all, uh, it's all a party in here. Everyone's here. These two I don't hate. Not even pity. I have grown beyond. Oh no, help me, Russia and China. These Russian sons of man. All oh, sons of man. Oh no. Outside, Please don't go all Phil Collins on me. Brother, wait. <laughs> it's too early in the afternoon for that. This should not happen. Together we are three. There is space to share. Yeah. Unite. The groundwork is finished. We will become more. Um, I, can I, can I go, please? Can you sort this out later? I, I gotta go to the nukeified world, and thus begins Fallout 5, Ellen's Adventures in the Wasteland. <laughs> so many people. There are so many people to torture on the moon. Your ass is mine. Oh God! Why does everyone want my ass? Ted, the yellow man in the elevator, and now you guys. All right. You can give it away, or you can invoke it. Now you see what you want to do is actually invoke it. Boom. This is not over. No. Sorry, we dickheads. Will never end. We have no beginning, so we can have no end. Oh, come on, you had a beginning. 
will return. Don't you understand? We are humanity. We are you. No, in one you're form. kind of in creepy, form, creepy AI. I mean, look at you. With you. You can't protect yourself because we come in many, many guises. Oh we god, I hope this isn't all just one big joke. Turns out we never escaped. Oh my god, it was all a dream. All part of Am's game. Oh. But we did it. All the worlds will end here. Fuck you, Goris to Blimp. Fuck you, Benny Altar thingy. Fuck you, Nimdok Research Nazi Camp. Fuck you, Ted, uh, Pentagram? And fuck you, uh, fucking thingy. Oh. Even Alan's computer pharaoh place is blown up. So now Alan has to be the, the gatekeeper for the awakening of humanity on the moon. In memorial of these people who sacrifice their life, and that is the end. Of the game. Oh my goodness. <sighs> we did it, and I feel I, I don't know. What do you think of that chat? What do you think of that ending? I don't know. Things started off so promising, and then you get to that end bit, and it's like, oh, oh, okay, I guess. Oh, it's fine. Do I get my mouth back at least? Because that was one of the things that I thought I was going to get back. I don't even feel much like screaming anymore, but I would like my mouth back. So many things I can do with it. Interpret that as you will. Oh my god, and that's how you end the game. Fucking hell. We did it, we did a thing, but you know what? It's too early to end a stream, so we're doing other things. You know what I'm doing? I'm doing some Eve. That's what I'm doing. And I didn't actually make a shortcut or anything. I didn't prepare for any of this. Oh my god. I'm gonna play some Eve. Um, and I'm just gonna leave this on the thing. Um... No, maybe I will change it. Hang on, let's just change titles while I'm looking around for things. I gotta, I gotta launch things. Uh, where is Ebe? I have no idea where Ebe is. It could be anywhere. Oh, my people are still looking over the stats. Most of them are scratching their heads. Yeah, I don't fucking know. It could be anything. Um, 